Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry makers, happy Wednesday. I'm chuckling because Michael has just shared the funniest story ever. And so I was like, Michael, you've got to come and tell everybody that story. Um, and it is him basically confessing at the same time. <laughs> come here, tell everybody your story. Did you hear this, Ross? You watch now, it'll be Ross that goes, that'll say, Hi. it's mine. Take it away, because this is hilarious. So I was uh, eating lunch the other day in lunch club. <laughs> With Lauren, shout out to Lauren. Anyway, uh, my wife had made me a sandwich and I opened it up. No, there was pickle on it, there was tomatoes, ham, cheese. It was a beautiful sandwich. I mean, it was like next yeah. level. Ate it, sent her a voice note saying, Curse, amazing sandwich, thanks so much. <laughs> anyway, like the day later, we were talking about the sandwich because I sent her a voice note and explained why the girls were giggling. And um, I was like, You put pickle on there? You never put pickle. She was like, I didn't. I spent half an hour <laughs> trying to tell her that she put pickle on the sandwich. It wasn't my sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> Some poor person have gone to the fridge, looked at the sandwich, found my poor excuse for a sandwich. And they're like, no, because the foil was like half undone on the sandwich that I had. And on it was like, it was cheese and like guacamole and stuff like that, but nothing compared to this, this bountiful sandwich that I ate. <laughs> So I do need to put some chocolates in there uh, and put a note saying, I'm really sorry, but someone- I ate your sandwich? Someone had a packet of crisps that day and, a, and maybe a banana. So um, if it's you, if it's anyone uh, in uh, the call center, I'm, I'm really sorry. And <laughs> it will never happen again. Touch wood. I love it. I love it. You're thinking, oh, Kirst, that was the most amazing sandwich. It's also totally Ross Geller, isn't it? Our friends, my sandwich. Did you eat it all or did you throw some of it away? No, no, I ate it all. That's all right then. <laughs> it's yeah. too funny. Too funny. Right now, someone, one of the one of the members of Jewelry Maker team, might not be Jewelry Maker, might be Gems. Yeah. Uh, might be Gems. And I'm curious to know, what pickle was it? Was it Branston? Or? Oh, no, it was, it was, it was Gherkins. Ah, oh, yeah, that sounds amazing. Right now, they're like, that was mine. That was my sandwich. Brilliant. So good. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. <laughs> what is coming up on today's show, Jewelry Makers? You've got a super Wednesday. You really have. Your eight o'clock hour is locked and loaded, as you all know. Um, remember, it times out, though, come the top of the hour. So make sure you're checking out your baskets. Your early bird is a gem that we seldom ever, ever, ever see. I'm talking about the natural beauty that is dog tooth amethyst. I can't remember the last time we actually spoke about dog tooth amethyst. Um, it's absolutely fascinating, incredibly rare. Um, and usually, I'm gonna say this, emphasis, emphasize, usually quite considered, not the case today. So if you are fanatically in love with dog tooth amethyst, then make sure you do check out nice and early. They're a lovely size as well. Um, something you can incorporate. Oh, like I said, we have, don't see it very often. Then at nine o'clock, we've got lovely Ellie, everybody. Gorgeous Ellie, sorry, we got, we we didn't introduce you properly then because we were learning about the uh, sandwich. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you've got some amazing projects, Ellie. We've got Sapphire Sensations at nine yes. o'clock. Yeah, they were wonderful. Stunning jewelry. Really, really lovely. Stunning. Thank you. Then at 10 o'clock, to say that these are out of this world would be the understatement of the century. We have some of the most fascinating. I want to say kind of like bi-coloured carvings because you've got the reds obviously but then you have 
greens and you've got yellows very much like that Asprey's boulder you know where you've got the different colors um, in these carvings that are going to be launched by the wonderful Dave Troth at 10 o'clock so make sure they're mind-blowingly beautiful make sure that you are watching at 10 o'clock 11 o'clock we're going to be talking about the newest variety of jade that is quartzite jade we've got bamboo cuts we've got rice bead cuts as well all totally and utterly natural so you've got a lovely selection of your quartzite jade and then at 12 o'clock we're going to be uh, learning about the wonderful technique that is gallery wire um, with our lovely Ellie and you've got some wonderful faceted labradorite too. Yes, they're really beautiful as well. Every single one of them. Schiller everywhere. Full of Schiller. Full of Schiller. That's what you want, yeah, isn't it? It is. That's what you want. Oh, Ellie, look at that absolutely beautiful so jewelry makers it is going to be an absolutely super super wednesday ross it's going to be a cracker isn't it he's back he's back from his sister's wedding congratulations to ross's uh, ross's i almost said ross's wife then ross's sister <laughs> on on her nuptials nice wedding yeah nice do you have a few beers not one beer what did you drink then Gin tonic. Oh yeah, very civilised. And what? Clothes on the margaritas. Very civilised. Very, very <laughs> civilised. <laughs> Shall we get cracking? Do you get your messages in? I think the, the, the texting topic should be, have you ever had a scenario like Michael Wolf where you have eaten somebody else's sandwich or otherwise? <laughs> Are you said owner of this sandwich? <laughs> <laughs> do text in, do text in. Um, yeah, we'd love to hear from you. It's going to be a wonderful show. I can guarantee you of that, jewellery makers. We've got loads to bring you. A real selection um, of beautiful gemstone, sterling, silver elements. It's all there. It's all there. Shall we get cracking with a gorgeous sterling silver? It is silver, isn't it? Wow. Um, okay. Con connector. It's huge. It's set with a beautiful black opal cabochon and also white topaz. Hold on a minute, Russ. Hold on a minute. Darling, nice and early. I mean, you could literally just pop that onto a slider bracelet, couldn't you? Yeah. And away you go. Um, Elizabeth is there. Your first one there, Elizabeth. Check out nice and early. Oh, you're not alone, Elizabeth. We're going to go straight down to it, Jordan Makers, not dilly dallying. It's the first auction of your Wednesday. No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you notice how I was quite hesitant to even re even reference it just in case it didn't happen? Because I was like, it's sterling silver. It's black opal. Has it gone? <laughs> not gone yet. Not gone yet. You've got to check out your baskets. Not gone yet, jewelry makers. Make sure you check it out to guarantee your success. Oh, there's over a hundred of you with it in your baskets now. Well done. Well done, everybody. You gotta be gotta be up and at it nice and early to guarantee your success on these deals. Shall we do Crazy Lace Agate in your beautiful smooth rondelles? It's agate but crazy. Um totally natural. <laughs> but you get these lovely formations all over it beautiful palettes of color from your okra to your mauve are you ready are you ready on your marks get set <laughs> go it's a burnt <laughs> 95 carats of beautiful crazy lace agate for a burnt come on michael it's a pound. It's a pound. Well, that's not very <laughs> Frank Butcher, is it? It's a pound. Pound. Pack, pack, pack. Um, last one of these one pound deals, jewellery makers. Up next. <gasps> no, you can't possibly. What? Oh, no. Okay. Uh, you can't possibly. He says, watch me. Watch me, Elle. Oh. Marambaya. It's been that long since I've spoken about Marambaya Topaz. It's it's like the top 5%. The best colour. I'm not going to get a chance to talk about it for very long because guess what? It's burned. Do you want to know how, oh how many goodness. minuses we are on this? 1400%. Oh my goodness. That's how many minuses. But we're making friends, aren't we? Loads of friends. Aren't they beautiful? I should think so. <laughs> yeah. 
I hope, yeah, I hope so. Well done, sold out. Well done, well done, well done, well done. Um, next up, shall we do? Some? Oh, I was, I was eyeing these up. They're beautiful, and they come in a little pochette. Little pochette. Ross is saying I might buy these. I think you bought something similar a, few, a while back, wasn't it, on the birth of your daughter? And you gifted them to the beautiful midwives that delivered your your lovely child. Um, there you go. Sterling silver stud earrings with uh, one of the most desirable gemstones at the moment. That is, of course, your um, your Malachi classic studs. You can't go wrong. Plus, they're in the pouch, so um, you know, perfectly giftable. Twenty-four pounds and ninety-nine pence. Now, if you pop along to Van Cleef, if you pop along to Shopard or Piaget or uh, Dior or uh, Wolf and Badger, any of those designers that are absolutely including this gemstone in their collection at the moment, you ain't going to see a twenty-four ninety-nine price tag, are you? Definitely not. You've got those wonderful shades of greens. Lots of you getting involved nice and early. Let's do something extra special. You haven't even got to buy the, you know, what what you're gifting it in. This is a little bit of a hint, says Ross, to why he might be buying them as well. Because this is not your price. What, twenty four ninety nine is not your price? Oh, this isn't your price. <laughs> We're going lower for a genuine gemstone in sterling silver. Not just any genuine gemstone, Malachite, the gemstone of the moment. You know, it's like, it's like I don't know, what's the most current music artist at the moment? <clears throat> Who no, do you reckon? No idea. <laughs> Taylor Swift. It's the yeah. Taylor Swift of gemstones at the moment. It's everywhere. Everywhere. The hottest gem in the world. She is, she is killing it, isn't she, to be fair, Taylor Swift. Not 9.99. £7.99. pence. You'd be paying that for the pouch, I think, let alone the gemstone and the sterling silver. Seven ninety nine is not your price either. Hampshire says, give me two. Five says, uh, I'll have some of those. So does Judith, so does Paula, so does Lisa, so does Susan, so does Sandra and Jill and Ronald and Sharon and Lisa and Alison and Susan. Um, what's that? A single, yeah, a single round at Piaget is £2,000. We're bringing you two, two in precious metal and seven ninety nine is not even your price. I'd expect to pay more than seven ninety nine for the butterfly backs. I definitely expect to pay more than six ninety nine for the butterfly backs, but you're not just getting that, are you? You're getting the pouch, the sterling silver, the butterflies, and of course that beautiful gemstone. Um, Ross has just looked through the archives. He said this was the exact pair that he bought. How many years ago? Two. One. One year ago. Your daughter's one, isn't she? Yeah. Just turned one. Ah. Ah. Time. Time flies when you're having fun, Roscoe. Time absolutely <laughs> flies. And she's still golden, isn't she? She still sleeps. She's perfect. Ah, oh, bless. How many have we got, Roscoe? 50 available, but again, great little Secret Santa gifts. What do you reckon, Ellie? Yeah, ideal for Secret Santa. Mm. 6.99. I mean, no one's going to think that you paid 6.99. What about teacher presents? Yeah. No good sat in those baskets, though, jewellery makers. You need to be checking them out. We only have 50, and you can bet your bottom dollar there's more than 50 people watching right now. So if your name is Nancy, Patricia, Elaine, Elaine, Jill, Ronald, Alison, Jenny, Pauline, Hampshire, Alison, Helen, Hertfordshire, Elaine, another Elaine, uh, Fife, London, another Nancy, uh, Nancy in Bristol. Make sure you're checking out your baskets to guarantee your success. 50 can go in a nanosecond. Um, and there's loads of multi-buyers. For me, I'm just putting these away. So I've got a wobbly desk. I've got a wobbly desk today. Um, I'm popping these away in the, in the Christmas drawer. Yeah, that's a good idea. I need to start my Christmas shopping. Have you started? I've not started, no. Have you not? And I feel like it's going to be Christmas any moment. Any moment. Any yeah, moment. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah it, oh, it creeps up. It does, it does, and, and you've got to think about Christmas. it. Like We're paid monthly here, so that's how many, yeah. how many days? 98 days. So really, you've only got what? September, no, October, November, December, three paychecks. Mm. Three paychecks to get all your Christmas shopping in. Six ninety nine is going to help you out, though, isn't it? Massively, yeah. 
Check out your baskets, everybody, and do drop us a message. We'd love to hear from you. Have you ever eaten somebody else's sandwich? <laughs> Michael has. Intentionally, unintentionally. Or unintentionally, <laughs> yes. Um, <laughs> it's a day of confessions. Have you ever stolen anybody else's food? <laughs> or anything else. <laughs> because Michael did, with pickles and all. I do apologise. Uh, you did apologise. <laughs> and it was... I do apologise. You do apologise. You don't know who it is you're apologising to. Have you actually put us some no, chocolate? We'll do, uh, tomorrow, yeah. uh, they're, they're probably not trusting of that fridge anymore, so they probably won't even go in there. So I somebody... bet they just keep it in their bag now. They'll never go to the fridge again. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure you check sandwich it out. Thing. Sonia, well done. Here, yeah, someone ate my sandwich. Right now, that person's going around accusing everybody. <laughs> Suzanne in Merseyside, well done to you. Aberdeen, sure, congratulations. Make sure you're checking out your baskets. I need to move on. We can't go any lower. It's genuine malachite and sterling silver. Well done. Well done, well done, well done. Don't forget, in fact, I haven't shown you yet. Dog tooth amethyst is your early bird. I genuinely think it's been years since I've had the opportunity to talk about dog tooth amethyst. I've not seen it in ages. It's lovely. It's such a gorgeous so gemstone. Um, basically, it's a... Uh, um, iron not reaching certain areas of the amethyst that cause that separation of colour. You get these re really beautiful bands. Um, it also forms in almost like canine shapes, which I'll talk about during the opportunity. But here it is, Jewelry Makers, here's your early bird, and it is totally and utterly natural. So do shop ahead on this. I will tell you, we've got 130, which isn't as many as I'd hoped, to be honest. Um, imagine that in a nice long line necklace, maybe with a tassel at the bottom or something yeah. like that. Um, or with pearls, it'd be lovely with pearls. Oh, yeah, really you know, nice to really pearls. draw out the sort of white areas within that beautiful gemstone. So that's your early bird jewelry makers. Do shop ahead on that one. Um, shall we do the pearls? I was eyeing these up. These are lovely. There's only six available though. Oh. Beautiful pearls. You know, everything that I have on this on this table right now would go with this strand of pearls. Yeah, it would. Easy. Everything. <gasps> with the yellow. <coughs> oh, with the yellow jadeite, casual. Yeah. yeah, that would be lovely. Coming up in the next hour. That's lovely. Together. You played you launched this whilst I was away. Oh, he scheduled it so I wouldn't miss out on the chance to see this beautiful strand. Look at that's perfect yellow as well, isn't it? Um, there's 11 of these coming up in the next hour if you fancy that combination. Equally lovely with your deal of the day. These pearls are 9 to 10 millimetres in their size, jewellery makers. Um, yeah, you could use it with a dog tooth amethyst. You could use it with some calcedony. You could use it with your quartzite jade. You could use it with Ellie's sapphire that's coming up in the next hour. What was it? What was? Okay, Ross is saying for a Wednesday, got to be honest, that Malachite auction was a little bit slower than he'd have imagined. Uh, maybe everyone's just, uh, I don't know, easing themselves into the Wednesday. Okay, enough easing. Tell you what, let's bring you up. I would say it's got to be up there with our number one or two most popular gemstones here at Jewelry Maker. Mm -hmm. Pearls and Jade, most definitely. Um, and yeah, anywhere else, 799 is not unrealistic for a 9 to 10, 10 millimeter um, freshwater near round pearls as well, no less. I've only got a limited quantity, so you will need to be quite quick checking out your baskets on these. Look at that beautiful, beautiful mirror like luster. Um, I can also see. Yes. I mean, look, look how perfect that is. You could dot those in between if you wanted to. It's going to work beautifully with your dog tooth amethyst that's coming up as your early bird. It would be amazing with the yellow jadeite. Okay, we're going to do something ridiculous because we like being ridiculous. First price crash, but not what you're paying. Not. Not what you're paying for genuine pearls. Not faux, not simulated, not even shell pearl. Genuine cultured pearls, and we're not even stopping at 99.99. I was talking about this on the weekend just. You know, you walk into, I don't know, Ernest Jones, uh, Beaver Brooks, any of your high street jewelers and look at the price of pearls. I bet they're no way near, even the first price, 799 especially of this quality and of this size. We are going lower. They are limited, though, jewellery makers. We're going to do something ridiculous, said Ross. 
It's already ridiculous, he says. No, he says, no, 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 no. I'm not going to be ridiculous if there's, I can't see enough names on the call screens. We'll take the graphics out. That's already silly. We brought Malachi at 6.99. And only 20 of those went, which we're really surprised about. Out of 50 that we had available. Okay, we want the best deals. We've got to work together. Got to mm -hmm. work together. Because basically, we can't bring something to where it takes to a really low price tag and then not sell them out. That's how shopping TV works. We go to that low price, sell them out. If you want these, we will go lower. 20 past eight, we're usually really busy. So I don't know. The deals that we want to bring you this hour are absolutely ridiculous. But we don't want to waste the product, if that makes sense. You know what I mean? We don't want to bring it to that, take it to that extra low price and only sell a percentage of them. So I'll tell you what we'll do. 30 seconds, 10 millimeter near round pearls. The most, one of the most desirable, well, the most desirable is a round pearl. There's only 10 of these available within the vault. If you want us to go lower, we need to really guarantee that they are going to be an on-screen sellout. There you all are, lovely jewellery makers. Hello, Marion. Hello to you, Alan. Hello to you, Lanarkshire and Barbara and Janice and Christine. Multi-buyers getting involved. I've also got anonymous callers joining us on the web. It's already ridiculous, Ross. But let's go lower. We can't replace them at the price that's on your screen. For nine to ten millimeter near round pearls, not potato pearls, which you can access a bit more affordably, can't you? Genuine near round pearls. This could be a three hundred pound strand, couldn't it? I mean, if I if, the, if we had quantity of these, Roscoe, um, say we had like a hundred and fifty, it would be a deal of the day, one hundred percent. It would be a deal of the day. At sixty nine ninety nine, that's an absolute giveaway deal. If they don't sell out, Roscoe, I'll be getting some of these. I bought some pearls on the weekend, you know. I bought some of the pearls on the weekend. And, and, and my intention is, like I, obviously I buy a lot of pearls because I want to pass them on to my, to my daughters, but I could very easily not these, put them on a gold class, sell them at a premium. Um, 69.99 is no reflection of the true value, obviously. No. Not for near round pearls. And pearls are that constant in popularity. Alan, well done to you, you've got yours, congratulations. If you do want the multiples that I can see in people's baskets, make sure you're checking them out as well. London, you've got yours. We've got retailers who are shopping with us this morning. I'm not surprise why would they bother paying the ticket to get to um i don't know hong kong pay the um the extraordinary prices that we're seeing the pearls now and we've shared vts and footage of that um when they can still get them from jewelry makers with just one potion and packaging i've got two of these left jewelry makers within the vault once they're gone they're gone i'd have my eye on these 69.99 is an absolute giveaway deal you can't get you can't get a pair of shoes from some places for that price tag um, the last one, who's going to get it? Who's going to get that last one? Barbara, you can. Christine, you can. Lanarkshire, you can. Anonymous collectors, you can. You just got to check it out. I'll leave it with you. Leave it with you. Well done. Moving on. Okay. Um, moving on to... Oh, the necklace box. See, if, you, if you've knotted those pearls and you've put them on a nice clasp, you're going to want the nice box, aren't you? Yeah. It's, it's that whole experience. Beautiful, very classy colour. If you've got the pearls, I think you need... Also, don't keep the pearls in plastic. They don't like it. Yes, there is a very, very, very special defining feature of this box. Um, you've got that lovely, rich navy leatherette, which is wiped clean. But this here in the centre is abalone. Oh. Beautiful abalone. Look at the quality of that box. You can see it's wonderful, wonderfully lined internally as well. Let me get those pearls actually. You know, imagine you've knotted it, you've put it on a nice clasp, you're gifting it to one of your loved ones. You've even got the, the elastic to keep everything in place and keep it nice and safe. It's that whole presentation, the experience, which I think is so, wow. um, so invaluable. You know, imagine, like, I don't know, an anniversary, a birthday, a special occasion, and they're opening up to see a beautiful piece of jewelry like this. It's elevating the quality of your creations and your wonderful jewelry. You know, does, would you go with that or would you go with something that's, I don't know, maybe just gifted like that? 
it it you're showing how much you care about your piece of jewellery. And by the way, these, if you were to try and find them elsewhere, they're very expensive yeah, to buy boxes are. usually. Graphics Alive, £34.99. It's bothering me that I haven't put that in there centrally. So one second, there you go. Um, there we are. Yeah. Not, imagine that as a finished piece of jewellery and you're gifting that to your loved ones. We could stop here all day long, you know, um, certainly the jewellers that I used to sell out. It's very difficult, firstly, to get a box that's not branded. Yeah, um, it is. That it has really actually is. got their logo. Um, unless you're going online, and then you have to buy a certain quantity of them, don't you? Um, you can feel the quality. Are you ready for this? You can hear the quality. Mm -hmm. um, we could stop there, couldn't we? Have we got quantity of these, Roscoe? just under 40 available but again you know i buy the boxes when we launch these i always buy them and put them uh, literally in the cupboard i've got i've got some boxes in the cupboard so when i make a piece of jewelry and i might not have even made it yet or bought it yet yeah. um <clears throat> but eventually it's like right, okay i need a nice box you know my my mother-in-law we gave some beautiful pearls it didn't come box like this but knotted them put them on a class needed the box then um 14.99 jewelry makers goodness me um, and that's the necklace box. Just so you know, FYI, we do have the others. We've got the universal box and we've also got the ring stroke earring box as well um, <coughs> that will match beautifully if you are thinking about the full suite or if you are thinking about maybe a little collection. Yeah, I, I bought um, some boxes um, online and when they arrived, they were just quite naff. Yeah. And I was really disappointed. I bought them all to put like my large tree of life pendants in, like for when I sell them. And I put some of them in, thinking, oh, maybe they do look okay. And by the time I'd travel just from home to the craft fair where I was setting up, mm. they'd managed to get knocked, and they looked awful. I couldn't put them out. Yeah. And it was quite disappointing because I was like, well, I put the necklaces out separately, but I I just got rid of the boxes because yep. I was like, I can't sell something like that. No. Because it just. It just looks naff. Yeah, <laughs> like totally. If you've made this beautiful piece of jewellery, you don't want to just have it in a cheap box no, because absolutely. it doesn't do it justice. It's, 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 you know, you might have, you might have um, um, say, chiffon bags for something, say yeah. a stretchy bracelet, but if you're actually gifting something maybe which is you know, more of a considered purchase to your yeah. customers or you're gifting it to your loved ones, you want the, the, the box to match the quality of the piece of jewellery, don't you? Well done. Dorothy's multi-bought on these, Anna's multi-bought on these, Tina, Rachel, new customers. I'm going to be adding these to my order as well. Um, you know, little, simple things like a sterling silver chain with a pendant on which I quite often gift um, at Christmas time and birthdays mm. and things like that you know I don't just want to gift that because it gets knotted in a chiffon bag yeah. um, I want it to be beautifully uh, presented in a box like so now we're at 14.99 already multi buyers getting involved congratulations who would like this under 10 pounds It's very good. That's a great price. Yeah. With abalone as well. Let's not forget there's abalone on these. Look at the quality. Ready? So good. Such a good sound, Such isn't it? <laughs> if you're buying any high-end gemstone, jade, pearls, diamonds, ruby, sapphire, whatever it might be, how you present it, I think, is as important. Look at the quality. Look at that beautifully fluted fluted edge mm. even down to and this might sound strange but look at the quality of the finish there's nothing sort of fraying away which sometimes happens uh, something that goes through me and it was funny we had this conversation this morning but I cotton wool or that kind of weird white wadding that you sometimes yeah. find in jewelry boxes goes right through me to a point I can't touch it. Yeah, my husband doesn't like it. Oh, oh, it gives me, gives me goosebumps. <laughs> oh. um, so I would avoid boxes like that. Whereas this, you can see that gorgeous quality. We're under £10, jewelry makers. We've only got 40 of these available, but we're going to go again. We've got the ring box, stroke earring box. We've got the universal box as well. Multi buyers already, we're going even lower. You're going to need to be quick on this, jewelry makers. 40 is not a huge quantity for us. Anna's got two, Dorothy's got four, Tracy's got three, London's got four. Well done to you. New customers getting involved. Aberdeenshire multi buying. Alan's just got two. Well done. I've got Elaine, Maker, Maker, Michelle, Tracy. Uh, Tina Northumberland, are you coming back to get some more, Tina? I can see your name twice now. 
I don't blame you. I'd be doing exactly the same. Veronica's just bought 10. Well done. I'd be doing the same. Put them away. You know you're going to use them. Yeah. Whatever piece of jewellery, I agree, that you put in there, wow. Ross is just saying, I think you're elevating that price point significantly. Massively. And it's just $6.99. How are these $6.99? That abalone should be that. Yeah. Imagine we were bringing you that bezel set abalone on its own, $6.99. They'd fly. <laughs> but it's a whole box. Yeah. Oh, Ross, I wanted to get some of these. They're going to sell out now. I like the colour as well. It's a really classy colour classy isn't it yeah you know there's certain colors that i think really just ooze sophistication and that's one of it the midnight navy blue a bit like uh racing green that's a classy color isn't it or the tiffany blue or like the cartier red they're classy colors aren't they and you don't expect them to be six ninety nine, do you? No. <laughs> um, just so you know, if you want to, if you want to buy a Cartier box, it's going to cost you best part of a hundred pounds. That's just the empty box. Just the empty box. There you all are. You were just waiting for these amazing deals, weren't you? Make sure you're checking them out, though. So many multi buyers getting involved. I've got nine left. And look, we've had people buying tens. Someone's got eight. People have got fours and fives. I'm not surprised I'd be doing exactly the same. Um, just so you know, these ones are coming up as well. We'll do it straight after. So we've got earrings and ring, stroke ring, and then we've got what we call the universal uh, box too, and we're going to do another amazing mega deal. I'm just going to take those out of there so Lauren's not looking for them. <laughs> yeah, this is the pendant, isn't it? But it's, it's a pendant, but it's also universal. So... What I mean by that is you could put a bracelet in there, you could put drop earrings in there, yeah. you could put a brooch in there. Um, so you have, can you see the grooves at the top, but you've also got this fold over bit for you to put a brooch or something like that on there. This literally lifts out. So also if you're displaying your creations, if you're doing things like craft fairs, you can do that. That's what we used to do at the jewellers, just literally prop it up. Again, imagine a, um, a lovely necklace or long dangle earrings presented in these. You've got that same feature, that beautiful abalone, that beautiful fluted, um, fluted design. Are you ready? You saw what we did on the necklace box? Let's match that price. Probably the shape that you'll use the most, I would say. Yeah, I think so. That's what I would use the most anyway yeah. out of all of those. I've got 80, just under 80 available. We're at 6.99, but we're not stopping there. We're going to actually break through a price barrier. <laughs> you know what that price barrier is, don't you? Yeah, stock up your stashes while you get the chance. Imagine you've bought yourself a sterling silver chain and you've bought one of our, I don't know, amber pendants. Yeah. A lovely amber pendant. You could stick that in a chiffon bag and that's okay, but let's be honest, you run the risk of it actually knotting and tangling before they even unwrap it. Um, or you can present it beautifully like this. You can just literally see their reaction as they open up this beautiful box. Um, yeah. How about jewellery makers for a luxury box under five pounds? Stock up on these. I would love to do. In fact, we were asked by the team upstairs, what would we like uh, in the lead up to Christmas? I'd love to do an hour of boxes because I think they're just, you know, it, it, we need them, don't we? You yeah. make, how many pieces of jewellery do you make in a week, do you reckon, Ellie, approximately? Well, I made all of this and extra in a week. So let's so. say 30. Yeah. Yeah, and you might not make 30, but let's just say you make five. You're going to want to present them, aren't you? Not just actually have them sort of just draped across a, yeah. a tea bar. It looks so much better actually in a box. Four pounds, 99 pence. Judith's got 10, well done. Morag's got four, well done. Uh, Michelle's got four, well done. In fact, I'm looking down the list. Everybody is multi -bought. Literally everyone uh, that I can see anyway. Um, Durham's just got six for five pounds. You could put like, yeah. You could, you, you could put like what? If you imagine like a diamond pendant presented like so. In fact, you know what? I've got, I've got, I look after some of my mum's jewellery and they're not in, and she's got some nice diamond jewellery, etc. And they're not in boxes as nice as this. 
and they're from a nice jewelers yeah but they're not as nice as this no these are actually really lovely i love that idea of having an hours box show as well yeah especially at this time of year because not like if christmas. you are if you are yeah for christmas but also if you are someone who does sell at craft fairs and things like that it's an ideal time to get that extra bit it just like you say it elevates what you're what you've got to give to someone an hour else. of boxes an hour of chains that's what i asked for yeah. because we're so short of chains as well and we need them don't we jewelry makers we do need them so i put the request in i can't guarantee it's going to happen the last one is your earrings stroke rings Ah, oh, seriously you can put rings in here too um are we doing this under five pounds as well there's your beautiful abalone look at that quality it's so nice so those malachi earrings that we just had have I read your mind? We're on the same page, Roscoe, that's why. Here we go. So instead of it, uh, there's nothing wrong with the pouch. The pouch was nice. But, ready? I've just, just because gift. Just because you're wonderful. Just because. All of a sudden, you are elevating the beauty of the gemstones. That combination right there, twelve pounds. Yeah. Twelve pounds. Everything that you can see, the malachite and the box. And then you've got a nice little pouch for something else. You can use that for something else then, haven't can't you? And Secret Santa's usually ten to fifteen pounds. Yeah. That's what you usually spend on exactly. people, on Secret Santa. Are they gonna think, oh yeah, they kept within budget, or are they gonna go, they totally broke that budget. Yeah. <laughs> Look how much they love me. <laughs> they do. <laughs> They do love me. <laughs> not nine ninety nine. We're going even lower. You know it's not stopping there, jewelry makers. We'll put the malachite studs on the side of the screen as well for you. Um, how about under five pounds? Durham knew it. That's why you've multi bought nice and early. Robert's multi bought. Elaine's multi bought. Lorna's multi bought. Lisa and Emma in West Midlands. Well done, everybody. The malachite earrings um, are still available because uh, it's like it's like we just wanted easing into the show. But yeah. That's a, it's it's fat it's it's fast and pacey now, Roscoe, isn't it? Yeah, we've woken up a little bit this Wednesday morning. Morning, Jane. Morning, Sue. Multi buying. Hello to you, Mary in Cardiff. Hello to you, Morag in East Lothian. Um, fours, threes, twos, fives. I'm not surprised. Um, well done. And earrings, especially for gifting. You know, earrings. As long, all you really need to know is have they got the ears pierced? Yeah. That's all you really need to know. Oh, do you know what I think we should do is earrings that you don't have to have your ear pierced for as well, that you can switch out for non-pierced Clip-ons. Clip-ons, that's it. So I've actually bought some for my craft bag. Some people are like, oh, I don't have my ears pierced. And I was like, actually, I can switch out. And they're like, oh, really? That's a good and idea. And that changes people's mind, like, almost instantly. Because like, oh. it's really hard to find clip-on earrings. Yeah, it yeah. is. And especially, like, nice clip-on earrings yeah. or, like, something that's, that's a, a bit idea. different. Otherwise, you just get the standard ones that you can find. Yeah. You can't even find them that often anymore, no. clip-on earrings. They were big in the 80s, weren't they, clip-on yes. earrings? Big in the 80s. I remember my mum, even though she had her ears pierced, she had clip-on earrings as well. Mm. I know people that, yeah, um, that have never had their ears pierced. Yeah. I suppose it is quite a weird thing because like it's funny because um we, we were talking about this actually like we went into town my family and Tiggy was like I'd like to have my ears pierced so I was like I don't think you really know what you you're asking for here and I was like Willow's got hers done and Tiggy was like can I get my ears pierced I was like Tiggy it hurts and she was like oh, okay I was like, it's effectively a hole in your ear she went no I don't know no, no. no it's a hole in the ear and she's like oh no 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 soon changed to her mind but so willow asked for hers to be done and i've always said each to their own but i've always said if you ask and they're old enough to understand that it hurts and you have to have it done twice yeah um as well so willow was six i think yeah willow was six but i waited until she asked me yeah so i think um yeah, I think I was yeah. 10 or 11 when I got mine. Yeah, I think I was older than six as yeah. well. Yeah. Um, you were eight. You were eight. Have you actually got any piercings? Yeah, I used to have one here, one here, two here, and this one's still open. So you've still got some? Yeah. Yeah. Remember that when everyone had their eyebrow pierced? Yeah. Um, it was the rage. It was the rage. <laughs> now, 
coming up. You've oh, yeah, got yeah, your yeah. early bird, absolutely day. beautiful. Your dog tooth amethyst, but also I need to give you a heads up. Um, on, mm -hmm. I'm going to say it, the finest yellow jade I, I've seen. That's absolutely unbelievable. It literally is dippy egg yolk yellow, isn't it? Um, so the only reason I'm getting the opportunity to see this is Ross is saying, we launched it um, when I was away on holiday. Um, I've put it in today's show so that you got to see it at least once. And I'm so glad. You, they look lovely together, uh, yeah, that's Ross, what I was don't just, they? I was just about to say that. They're amazing together. I really like that Love combination. That. And Both coming up for this time of year. Yes, if you put it with bronze or copper wire. Oh, beautiful! Imagine, like lovely. Loving that they're Autumnal. both coming up jewelry makers. You can shop ahead on your dog tooth amethyst. I generally can't remember the last time I actually saw this. Um, it's in. Um, it's on the website as we speak. All the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Remember that this hour does time out. It's not available for the entirety of the day. Um, so make sure you check out nice and early to guarantee a success. It's coming up as your beautiful early bird but not yet let's do some natural burmese black spinel we launched it only last week um, but there's less than 20 of these remaining there is something so special i think about black spinel but more so than that burmese black spinel seems to for, in my opinion anyway seems to possess more luster um, than any other location. Um, we need to remember that Burmese spinel forms alongside Burmese ruby and Burmese sapphire, um, and they are regarded as some of the best in the world. So I guess we should; those expectations should be there for the spinel as well. And my goodness me, doesn't it deliver? We launched this only last week, jewelry makers. I've got less than twenty available. Um, when you think about this, they're two mil. They're two millimeter, and yet producing so much surface luster. Yeah. I, I agree, I agree. Ross has just said in my ear, I, um, for your two mil, he thinks Burmese spinel's the best. I agree. Of all gemstones, I agree. Because you think at two mil, you can't really see the brilliance, can you? You can't really see the brilliance or, say, the trichrosum or pleochrosum, whatever it is. It's all about the exterior. So a black spinel will literally, it reflects they're mirror-like facet. Um, I totally agree with what you've just said there, Ross. Of, of your two mils, I think black spinel, um, if you could choose any gemstone, it would be black spinel. I totally, totally agree with you there. Because um, two millimetre size as well, you might think, oh, they're tiny, 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 tiny. Um, but they still pack a punch. You can make beautiful tassel earrings, can't you? Maybe something like these uh, um, comet earrings that featured on the jewellery editor. For just a cool 20 grand. Wow. You could do that. You, you know could do that. As well, they're so like, I can see them on the screen here and see them on your hand, and they're so much more sparkly on your hand In than person. they even are on the screen. Yeah, and yeah, they're yeah. sparkly on the screen. <laughs> we should be chart. You could multi buy and make something like this, and I actually think yours is better quality. Or you could make a tassel like this, and I definitely think yours is better quality. I'm not. I'm a bit underwhelmed by that tassel. I don't think they're very nice, nicely faceted or polished. What that's about? What I, that's what I want from a micro facet. That's yeah. sparkle. Yeah, exactly. What about Harvey Nicks? Go to Harvey Nicks. You can get a simple bracelet, two hundred eighty-five pounds. What about Wolf and Badger? One hundred thirty-five pounds. Plus, what about what about Monica Veneda? One hundred twenty-five pounds. You see the prices that this gemstone commands, and I don't even know if they're Burmese, whereas I can guarantee yours is. Yours is Burmese, but they're uniformed. Even the likes of Sandra Bullock wearing her black spinel on the red carpet, that simple bracelet, you could recreate that, couldn't you? You could be inspired. Uh, Jennifer Aniston. Now, natural Burmese black spinel all about the exterior so faceting and polishing is crucial we launched this last week and i've only got 20 of them left and um, there was initially 150 of these available we were discussing wouldn't it be amazing to do something like a capriccio bracelet with boobies black wow. spinel how amazing would that be something like that yeah something just like this just like this that would be lovely wouldn't it in black spinel imagine amazing. that for your new year's eve party we're at 9 99 natural Burmese black spinel. We know that Burmese ruby is likely to sell out in the next couple of years. For me, common sense tells me that that
probability is also the same for Burmese black spinel because they form alongside one another. I've only got the last remaining quantity though, jewelry makers. We launched them last week. They absolutely flew out the door and I don't think today's gonna be any different. Um, how about if you struggle with knots? If you struggle knotting your gemstones, say those pearls that you saw a few moments ago, um, I know it doesn't do the same as in holding your pearl in place, but you can, visually, you can yeah. use these as an alternative to a knot, can't you? And in fact, they'll probably give you more impact. 9 is good, but it's not your price. Super popular on launch, equally as popular today, okay. $7.99. Micro faceted gemstones should cost more, right? We've still got to source That's the gemstone. So We've into. still got to facet them. We've got to drill them. We've got to strand them. It takes longer to do so the smaller than they are. That, yeah. that they are. There's just so much work that goes into them. Like yeah. Every single facet has been faceted how? and polished how? by hand how <laughs> by hand on what we call a dobber stick yeah it's amazing though like i can't like i can't fathom doing that it's uh... Ellen, it's 38 centimeters as well we're oh, not yeah. talking about just a little short strand yeah. here you're getting a full 38 centimeters tina sue beverly sharon angus maker jennifer well done london new customers getting involved uh kevin in neathport told that morning everybody i hope you're all well hello elaine in beautiful devon um lovely to be with you this wednesday morning Bit of burmese black spinel yes please just 7.99 if you insist <laughs> Bargain. Oh, look. Look at that. Look how it transforms that yellow. We're making lovely projects now. Hang on a sec. Let me just put that there. Uh, wait, wait. Space them out together. Ross, oh, yeah. hang on. Yes, yes, yes. Hang on. <laughs> Can you tell I used to make the kits here? Uh, I'll have that kit. I'll take it right you now. You want that kit? <laughs> That'd be nice, wouldn't it? <laughs> I put some nice uh, precious metal findings in there as oh. well. Um, yeah, that would be absolutely beautiful. They're all available for you today. Now, one more auction before I bring you Amethyst. And we're going to do a massive close-out deal. Okay. On. Oh, that's a tough call, that is, Roscoe. How about a gemstone that I reckon I could probably count on my hands how many times I've actually brought it to wear this year? And we're almost in October. Mm -hmm. Of this, of all gemstones really, in terms of quality, you would prefer it to be natural. You can still get, I'm not counting heat in that because heat treatment basically is replicating what mother nature can do anyway. This is not dyed, this is not diffused, and it's not even heat treated. How about, and I always say it, the number six of the big five. In fact, once upon a time, before De Beers swooped on in there with their hugely successful marketing campaign, mm -hmm. and Aquamarine was the gemstone of engagement. I wrote, uh, I showed you Pragnals in the past. Pragnals talking about this beautiful gemstone, how um, the finest color is like the perfect azure day on a summer, um, azure sky on a summer's day. I'm about, to look at it from there. Look at that quality of blue. This is an opportunity for everybody to own the finest grade aquamarine. If you've always loved it, but maybe it's not been within your budget today, is the day this is the auction for you because we're going to do a massive close out deal look at that gorgeous color imagine that with the pearls that we just had earlier on so yeah let's go to pragnal pragnal is one of the most reputable jewelers um here in the uk and they describe um Aquamarine, they say it's like a refreshing swim on a hot day. Aquamarine is cool and watery shade of blue, named after the Latin phrase meaning water of the sea. When you look at those sort of rough, well, that's basically um, an aquamarine crystal. You can see the rough formations. There is that beautiful, cool blue that they're referencing. Now imagine it's sort of shaped and polished to perfection in natural rounds, something that 
um, that you could easily knot maybe with your silks and include with your precious metals, um, workable for us jewellery makers. Imagine that in Pragnals. Imagine this as a piece of jewellery being sold in Pragnals. I can bet your bottom dollar jewellery makers is not going to be anywhere near your closeout deal price. You can see the azure blues from distances away. You're approximately, I reckon, about three, four metres, and yet you can still see that wonderful deep blue. Straight away, we already have collectors getting involved. Do we have many of these available, though? 35, there we go. Six millimetres, your go-to size. It's Brazilian, so Santa Maria, by the way, is Brazil. Um, is Brazil. These days, though, we use Santa Maria more as a description for quality of colour. Um, but you are getting it from that um, at that same location. So, I mean, again, that in terms of... Oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Provenance. Um, that, that elevates the price ordinarily massively. Not the case today. I've got to do it, Ross, because I think this, again, alongside your, your yellow jade that's coming up in the next hour, I think would be absolutely breathtaking. We are about to open the auction. 35 can go literally in a heartbeat, so make sure you're checking out. If you love that combination, again, it's summertime, isn't it, um, in a design. We're going to do a massive closeout deal um, just ahead of your early bird jewelry makers this will go lovely with your early bird in actual fact 100 carats not heat treated not fissure filled not diffused in any way shape or form natural brazilian so again you have that provenance of the location as well a full 38 centimeter strand i know and never mind comparing outside these four walls never mind looking at pragnal prices which we know are going to be four figures i know even here at jewelry maker we have brought you Brazilian aquamarine for more than what's on your screens right now. And you've got the split pay. I know we have brought natural Brazilian aquamarine over 300 pounds. For what you are getting, I agree, Ross has just said, this is as good as those one pound deals that we start the show with. It's true, it's true, Ross. 99 pounds and 99 pence is, all, is already far too low. Yeah, you know, you think about the big five, let's be honest, it's the big six. Because Aquamarine is in that, people know Aquamarine, don't they? People aspire to Aquamarine. Let's half that price. And I'm going to say, Jory May, because I've got 35 available opportunities. Every single one of those will sell out today. So I'm going to say, if you love Aquamarine, Join us on the web, join us on the phone line, even if you don't press your option one as of yet. We should be though. I mean, seriously, when did, when did, when did natural Brazilian aquamarine become 49.99? Never is the answer. Never, it's never, it should be. Anywhere near that price. I'm gonna wanna see you there because we are promising a closeout deal. Massive closeout deal. The split pay is gonna be embarrassing. It's already far too low. We should actually be on split pay at 49.99, but we are going lower. In your favorite six millimeter rounds from 100 carats on the nose, not heat treated, not fissure filled. Close out deal, jewelry makers. I've got 35 available. We've got jewelers and collectors getting involved right now. That is embarrassing, Ross, you're right. That, I mean, that even if it was 29.99 or split pay, that's embarrassing, seriously. Add a nine to that. That's the price that it normally would be elsewhere, in my opinion, anyway. Um, but Ross is saying, L, there's a reason why I've been getting getting so excited about this opportunity and saying it's as good as one of your one pound deals. We could easily close it here. Oh my goodness, we would have closed it at 49.99, couldn't we? Easily. People have already, already checked out. Your final auction before your early bird. Today, you're about to acquire, hopefully, 100 carats of natural Brazilian aquamarine, the perfect azure blue, on split pay, interest fee split pay, for less than 29.99, because we go even lower. Like I said, 
that's why I wanted you to join us on the web on the phone lines it's a massive closeout deal we tried to give you as much of a heads up as we possibly could jewelry makers I had 35 I don't have 35 anymore if we had 300 I still think they'd fly out the door you know that would still be a quantity that could could go in one auction there will be people missing out on this opportunity the deal that we're about to do imagine these are the pearls that you saw imagine these are the yellow jade that's coming up or the red jade that we've got coming up with dave or with ellie's sapphires ah oh, that's embarrassing to be honest natural brazilian aquamarine and we're at 20 quid 20 quid I popped into our local super... I can't believe I'm making this comparison verbally on air, but I'm going to roll with it. I popped into our little local convenience shop, got some pasta, got some milk, got some bread, you know, just really basic essentials. Just one shopping bag and it wasn't even full. And I paid almost double that price tag for our little essentials. You're getting 100 carats of, of the finest quality aquamarine, Brazil, Santa Maria, that location, that provenance, for £20. Split pay, tenner. Goodness me, you know it's far too low. Manchester, well done, multi-buying. Sue, Denise, Janet, Norman, hello to you, Rhonda, Christine, uh, Patricia, you've just got three as well. I've got Janet there, new customer, Sharon there, another Patricia, Sylvia in Isle of Anglesey, Karen in Hertfordshire. Morning, everybody. Like I said, we tried to give you a little bit of a heads up, tried to make sure that you were there so that you could you could check out nice and uh, nice and quickly. You don't want to be missing out. When was the last time that we brought you natural aquamarine? Not in, not, not in nuggets or chips. Natural aquamarine in a six mil for 20 quid. Never, I think. I don't think we've ever done that, Ross. And we shouldn't expect it either moving forward. Dorothy, Janet, Patricia, well done. Uh, new customers, Sharon and Glamorgan. Morning, everybody. Again, make sure you're checking out your baskets on this. I only had 35 available opportunities. We've got the dog tooth amethyst coming up. It's on the horizon. We've got beautiful projects coming up with our lovely Ellie as well in the next hour. Keep on checking out. Remember that this hour is also on a curfew, so it's not going to be available for the entirety of the day. So it's a pointless exercise putting it in your basket and not doing anything with it because it will disappear. Um, so more likely to uh, sell out before that though. Oh, imagine you've got, you've got Brazilian aquamarine knotted on a silk with a precious metal clasp presented in one of these boxes. Oh yeah. I mean, that's luxury jewelry if ever I saw it. So coming up next jewelry makers, you have your wonderful early bird. And I generally can't remember the last time I got the chance to talk about it. I think if my memory serves me correctly, I think it was Ivy House days. So I think, do you think, do you agree? I, I, I generally think we're going back to sort of Ivy House days, which was what, a good three years ago? Yeah, yeah. good three years ago? Got to be up to, uh, almost that anyway. Coming up to three years, gosh, time flies. Um, but you can get, of course, different variations of different gemstones. Dog Tooth Amethyst, whilst it doesn't win awards for the most beautifully named, um, it does win awards for its overall beauty. And how it forms is very interesting too. It's up next, jewelry makers. I've only got 130 available opportunities, so do be quick. It's your early bird. So I've, I'm quite often, well, I say quite often, when I get the chance to actually talk about this gemstone, the, the question normally arises, what's the difference between dogtooth amethyst, chevron amethyst, and banded amethyst? Now, firstly, dogtooth amethyst actually references how it forms, because it actually, if you imagine a, um, a dog's canine, um, it forms in that shape, the actual crystal itself. Um, but the chevron am amethyst and dogtooth amethyst are essentially the same thing. Banded amethyst is more necessary, more like sort of the separations without sort of the points internally. Um, but I want to show you this photograph because you can actually see the actual free formation shape um, of how do a dogtooth amethyst actually occurs. You think about how amethyst occurs, then amethyst is, is grown, if you like, in geodes, which um, fascin I find this fascinating. So imagine you, thousands of years ago, millions of years ago, a tree fell. Um, a tree falls and then over time, of course, it becomes submerged into the soil. Um, and then over time, over a period of time, that tree trunk essentially will decay, leaving a crevice underneath the actual um, 
or yeah, underneath the Earth's surface. Now, uh, that essentially, that space um, underneath the Earth's surface will collate gases and pressures and elements, etc., that then go on to crystallize and form this beautiful gemstone. So that's amethyst as a whole. That's why you sometimes see amethyst geodes. Um, however, dog tooth amethyst is different because it actually affirm, uh, forms in these beautiful kind of like canine shapes. Um, and I found this information, which is it's li literally this is all we're going to read today, but it talks about amethyst is a variety of quartz that has uh, fused with manganese and iron during its formation. The strength of its distinctive color is determined by how much iron is present in its content. Um, the geographical location of amethyst can have a strong impact on the characteristics of its crystals, including the shade and strength of color. These can range from pale lavender to a shade of purple close to black. Think about, for a second, think about your, your Zambian amethyst, which probably is that most chocolate box purple, and then you think about maybe the difference between Moroccan amethyst. Uh, bands are created in amethyst when the crystal combine a snow quartz I thought that was quite an interesting terminology, white quartz effectively, uh, during its growth resulting in alternating layers of, co um, of colour in chevron patterns. In dog tooth amethyst, each piece is a tumble shard of amethyst creating long tumble stones similar to the shape, shape of a dog's canine. So you're going to think about it, colour zoning normally Colour zoning normally is, if we're looking at, say, a tanzanite, you don't want colour zoning in a tanzanite. You don't want colour zoning in an amethyst, uh, sorry, in a aquamarine, for example, that you've just had. You do want colour zoning in something like an ametrine or in a dog tooth because it's those that I am present, say, here and not here that produces those beautiful patterns. I mean, that is a geological phenomena, don't you think? How, in such a, a small area, have you got such a concentrated iron content producing the purple and then completely void of it producing that beautiful snow core? as well and fascinatingly then you get this wonderful patterns um, these chevron like shapes so I, it has been genuinely I think years since I've had the chance to talk about dog tooth amethyst and you normally pay a premium for it as well because of its rarity and because of its distinctive patterning you know immediately when you look at dog tooth amethyst that it is a natural beautiful genuine gemstone now this is brand new um, I don't think it's going to see another auction I think it's going to sell out as your early bird today. I have over 100 available, which is fantastic, but it's not going to be enough. There it is. Can you see? So you know now when you see those, stri uh, those strong striations of purple that that's where the iron content is, and then the purest of white. And it's not just a blend, it's a definite layer, almost like malachite. It's like a purple malachite, effectively. You get those beautiful patterns internally. We could stop here, Ross. I know that when we first launched Dog Tooth Amethyst, and it was back in the days... Oh gosh, I'm going back years and years and years now. I know dog tooth amethyst was significantly more expensive than any other variety of amethyst that we had within our vault. I couldn't do a showcase of this. It's very, very difficult to actually get hold of. Um, but we've got over 100. Let's get it under, starting at 29.99, let's take it straight away under 20. And already there's collectors getting involved in your favorite size. I'd love to say that we could do a showcase of this. I'd love to say, oh, we've got 10, 8, 6, 4 millimeters. But that's highly unlikely to be the case um, because of the rarity of the actual gemstone itself. Now, we're under £20 already. I've got Lisa there, Kevin there, Sue there, Alison there, new customer there, Northampton there, Mand uh, Maddie there, new London there, and there's, uh, there's just a handful of names. We are not stopping here. I genuinely don't believe, and I'm sure, Ross, you're of the same thoughts, I genuinely don't think this is going to see another auction. I think it's going to be on and gone. And who knows, is it going to be another few years until we get dog tooth amethyst again? Imagine this with the pearls that we had earlier on. That combination. Purple is also one of the most popular colours, I think, to wear. It's the colour of crafters. Look at that. Look how beautiful. Look how it elevates those pure whites. And it's all totally and utterly natural. Not reconstituted jewelry makers. We're already under £20. 
but it is not where we're stopping. Everyone, I believe anyway, has multi-bought. First time to air jewelry makers, 12.99 for dog tooth amethyst. 12 pounds and 99 pence in your six millimeter round, 70 carats of, it's not dyed, it's not reconstituted in any way, shape or form, 12 pounds and 99 pence. In my head, if I think about dog tooth amethyst, it's a 30 pound plus strand, whatever the shape whatever the shape if we had 50 of these then yeah quite possibly it would be so i mean the fact we've got a hundred of them is still not you know you think we when we bring mookite we might yeah for an early bird we do hundreds don't we i had an early bird the other uh, last week that was like 400 quantity um but this is dog tooth amethyst that's highly unlikely hilda pauline judith maker patricia sue lisa kevin thomas patricia nicolette uh, cheryl cornwall durham well done susan vivian nancy almost half the stock has gone already jewelry makers so again make sure you're checking it out that's quality dog tooth amethyst remember this deal will disappear um when we dive into the break six millimeter rounds and 70 carats of so it's only available literally as we speak right now again look at the quality now and i deliberately sought out the best photograph the best quality dog tooth amethyst in its rough formation a so you can see how it, the, the shape it forms but can you see how distinctive those bands are you know that wonderful chocolate box purple then to the solid uh, bands of white it's all down to high concentrations of iron um, in the purple areas and being completely void of it in the pure white it's a fascinating stone that occurs completely and utterly naturally 12 pounds and 99 pence more than half the stock has gone and we've actually run over this hour we knew it was going to be popular shall we guarantee a one auction one done like chesney hawks oh are you gonna do it ross I tell you what, I'm going to put this to you guys at home. If we can guarantee that this is an on-screen sellout, we'll take it under ten pounds. Hi, Joanne. Hi, Al. I've not seen dog tooth amethyst in years. Love the marks on it. Me either, Joanne. Me either. It's been ages, and I'm lucky to see gems on a daily basis, and I haven't seen it in years. You know, though, Joanne, you know that this strand's not going to be under £10. We're already too low at £12.99. Dog tooth amethyst comes at a premium because of its rarity and its formation. Same as ametrine is more expensive than sort of a, a, a classic amethyst, you know, like the purple amethyst, because of its rarity with that colour banding. The same applies with dog tooth amethyst. We all know that this shouldn't be under £10 regardless we're going to do it anyway and remember you've got a curfew it's only going to be available for another couple of minutes let's see you there i vocalized it i've said it that's our intentions we want to take it under 10 pounds um but it has to be like a two-way thing we need to basically guarantee that this is going to be an on-screen sellout there are lots of multi-buyers getting involved it's been years hasn't it joanne since we've had dog tooth amethyst um and believe me i believe me our team would have definitely tried to get hold of it prior to now um it's just very difficult to get hold of it's very complex to facet something i've not really spoken about hello irene in west yorkshire morning ladies not seen amethyst like this for years uh, love them can't wait for demo l um love from irene in halifax Mwah. yes we're looking forward to that looking forward to that 30 second clock and we're gonna do it we're gonna get it under 10 we had over 100 of these I've got no other sizes, haven't got four, haven't got eight, haven't got ten. This is the only dog tooth amethyst we believe we've got in the entire vault. Um, is there any on the horizon? No, not that we know of. Is there likely to be a showcase? No. I don't, have we ever done a showcase? No, I don't think we have. So if you love it, if you love those sort of really distinctive patterns that you get with dog tooth amethyst, now is the time well done everyone that's been successful looks lovely with those pills that we also brought to you in this hour completely spontaneous completely unplanned 
under 10 pounds for you today mary well done to you getting two um in lancashire mary in cardiff barbara's got two conway's got three christine patricia well done to you multi-buying tina thomas's multi-bought cambridgeshire evelyn's multi-bought uh cardiff dorothy laura hello to you john and susan carol nicolette sue maker patricia in shropshire i'll have two please uh lisa says i'll have two so many multi-buyers a hundred quantity can last literally seconds with us here at jewelry maker and at under £10 for a rare, beautiful, natural gemstone. I think that's absolutely going to be the case. Um, probably, I'm looking down the call screens, maybe, what, 85 90% of people have chosen to multi-buy. I don't blame you. At under £10, I think it's basically half price anyway. Um, that would be fantastic. If this was on air at £19.99, I'm happy. Um, Ivy in West Midlands, Maker, Elizabeth, you can do it, but you need to get a wriggle on now. Um, we've got a minute. Uh, from the red clock, we go straight into your break jewelry makers this time's out not just your early bird but everything that we have brought you so far this morning so those pearls if you love that combination and um, those boxes everything everything the one pound deals everything that we've brought you everything that's on the website um, will time out in literally 36 seconds jewelry makers so make sure you are checking out jewelry makers um, when will be the next time we see dog tooth amethyst I, I generally don't know I generally don't know I, it's been years. To my memory, it's been years since I've spoken about dog tooth amethyst. This is the only size that we have available. We can't do a showcase. There's simply not enough. We've got millions of pounds worth of gemstones in our vault. Dog tooth amethyst is not one of them. Um, so now or never. Make sure you check it out, jewelry makers. Not just this, everything we brought you this hour. We've got so much still to bring you. Wonderful demonstrations with Ellie coming your way after this. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewelry Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion or just a way to say thank you, the Jewelry Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Do you have a stunning piece of jewellery you've crafted? Share your masterpiece with us and you might just see your design featured on the Wall of Fame. Every week, the most dazzling entry will win £100 credit to their account, with £50 credit going to the runner-up. To enter, simply send your entries to studio at jewellerymaker.com by Tuesday at 12pm in time for the Wednesday draw. Snap a pic, send it in and let your brilliance light up our wall of fame. And who knows, your creation could be the next to sparkle and win. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Well, we want to help you on your jewelry making journey. When you purchase with us for the first time, you'll receive the Jewelry Maker handbook, which is filled with 35 different techniques, as well as lots of hints and tips to help you on your way. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Every day our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewelry making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8 a.m. until 1 p.m. And you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's bestsellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. 
Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewelry making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8 a.m. until 1 p.m. And you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Welcome back, Jewelry Makers. What an amazing Wednesday we've got in store for you. Don't forget, this incredible strand of yellow jadeite is coming your way. How many times have I reached through it since the start of the show? Um, there are only 11 available, and Ross has just said, look at the quality of that color. That's the, that's the best I've seen, Ross. Um, he says, Elle, you haven't seen this before because it was launched um, when I was away on holiday. He goes, you don't know the price of it. It's one of the first ever full length strands of yellow jade. Yeah, normally they're like 18 or 20 centimetres because yeah. of the rarity of the gemstones. So we should expect them to be shorter, but that's a full length strand jewelry makers and it's coming up within this hour. It's on pre-order right now. There is 11 of those. Um, also, I have to mention what's happening at 10 o'clock today because the when we talk about jade obviously we talk about the color and the translucency and when it's a carving and um, the trend now really is not just to have sort of jade carvings that are effectively ornaments that you put um, on your mantelpiece now at the moment the biggest most desirable jade is something that you can actually wear um, so you've got color and translucency but when they are carved you want that level of artistry um, I think it was Sotheby's one how you who actually said that wow um, that wow reaction that's precisely what I said when I first saw these yeah. um, because you know we've shown before Aspreys Aspreys is quite a familiar um, name to us in the jewelry world here in the West they show a boulder. Um, they show a boulder that's 18 million, um, and it's got the different colours in there. It's got the greens, it's got the whites, and it's got the reds. The reason why that's 18 million pounds is because you can actually make carvings like this, where they have those different pools of colour. That jewellery makers again. Look at the concentration of the red. I think it's so clever how, like, even on say, you know, the the, the fold of a, a of a um, leaf, um, the details of the birds. You've got the reds just there. Absolutely incredible, and it's effectively it, it's 
multi-dimensional, isn't it? You've got layers within this piece. And that's not the only one. Um, these are completely and utterly mind-blowing. I want to show you, oh my goodness, look at these. The techniques, the skills, the techniques and the skills that go into actually creating such a work of art. I mean, look at that. If I turn it side profile, look at that. All those multi-dimensions, look at this. That detailing is absolutely mind-blowing. Launching for the first time today. For the first time today, beautiful jadeite. In artistry, that I'm not sure we've even seen before. Look at that one there. It's like looking through, like into the window of the most beautiful tropical rainforest. Look at that. The, and those different shades of color give it even further dimension. All coming your way. As a collector and as a connoisseur, they are absolutely remarkable. Every time you look at them, you see how much, look, look, look at this, how much, look the layers of that, of that flower there, it sits on top. Um, how much detail. Um, of course, Dave is stepping into the studio to actually launch these jewelry makers. So um, make sure uh, make sure you don't miss out on that opportunity. One thing I don't know, Ross, is quantities. Do we have quantities of them? Uh, I wouldn't. I wouldn't imagine so. I mean, look at the qual. Uh, look how the uh, the amount of skill. Thirty is the biggest quantity. So these are extremely, extremely uh, um, exclusive. Imagine one of those suspended from a yellow jade out strand. That would be absolutely incredible, wouldn't it? Now, speaking of incredible creations, we've got our gorgeous Ellie, everybody. Ellie, you've been busy, just casually working with some sapphire. Yeah. Casual. I know. I love sapphires as well. They're one of my favorite gems. Same. And I was very excited because I've got microfaceted gems. Yeah. Which are one of my favorites. Well, if you want sapphire, but you want sapphire, if you've got maybe a preference of cut, yeah. then this hour is perfect for you because we've got fa sapphire, uh, Burmese sapphire um, in faceted rounds. We've also got it in beautiful faceted rondelles. Um, so this, these projects, and there's what, one, two, three different projects um, in total. I mean, look at that, Ellie, that's absolutely incredible. Thanks. I made that in the hotel last night. Did you really? No, I, I was like, oh, I'm going to do a little fancy. <laughs> I don't know what it's meant to be, but I was like, oh. I'm thinking butterfly. Yeah, like I did think a little bit butterfly. And of course, you do get your um, your tutorial instructions as well with the pro uh, with the purchase um, of your projects as well. You know, how about a sapphire tennis bracelet, jewelry maker? Yeah. That's basically what we're getting here. Uh, wire work bracelet, so you get this instru these instructions too. Sapphire being the gemstone it is, it's got fantastic hardness behind it, so um, you could wear that on a daily basis. Now I'm gonna start off with, let me just see, faceted rondelles, 10 centimeter strand. Yeah, it's this one. Is it this one? Yeah. Okay. I was so excited when I got that box. Well, you, that's, yeah. <laughs> that's the coveted collection. I know. I was like, oh, you know, you're getting something special when you get that box. <laughs> okay. So that's why this project is as limited as it is, because we've never actually had many of this strand. So uh, that's the first thing. Oh, my goodness. I know. This is natural. Not even heat treated. I mean, for this alone, I don't know what price. Look at the quality of that sapphire. <gasps> You're right. Oh, it's almost like the other components don't really matter. Look at the quality of that sapphire. That's absolutely incredible. You can see why it's part of the cover to collection. The cover to collection basically is our pinnacle. It's the top grade. Mm -hmm. It's like our, the Larique to our sister channel, the best that we actually have available. So you get a full strand. Um, we're looking at natural Burmese sapphire in your rondelles, nine carats of, I mean, how amazing is that? Um, how, so limited, this is extremely, extremely limited. I'm gonna place this across the back of my hand then uh, because you don't just get that, you get more. You get a full 38 carat, uh, uh, sorry, 38 centimeter strand, 13 carats of your two millimeter sapphire rounds. Now, this on its own has been on air at 20 pounds. It's never been any lower than 20 pounds. But again, this is a pinch me moment, moment. 13 carats for 20 quid mm -hmm. for genuine sapphire. Where else in the world? 
You don't just get that either, jewellery makers, because you also get, if I slide this board towards me, you also get some of your essential sterling silver findings. So I'm looking at a toggle, featherweight head pins, ear wires, crimps, and also crimp covers. So you also get all of those. You know, we're casually bringing 22 carats of natural sapphire here and sterling silver of the finest grade. This strand on its own, let's be honest, what price point would you expect? £149 here at Jewelry Maker? All day long, outside these four walls, I'd be expecting significantly more. Significantly more. How about them? And you also get the box. Don't forget that. You also get the coveted collection box. How about if this was a deal of the day? Two, 22 ca carats of sapphire, one of which is totally natural, Burmese, the best that we have within our vault, all your sterling silver findings, and also don't forget Ellie's instructions. It's limited though, extremely limited. How about if we go lower? For the whole project, not just the one coveted sapphire strand, how about we said under £100? This strand on its own should be more, way more. How many jewellers do you know will actually produce even one of those rondelles for £100? This is the thing, I, I you know, you can look at, at sapphire and straight away people have got that perceived value, haven't they? If you go into a jewellers and find a sapphire pendant, I'm not talking the biggest and I'm not even talking about the best, but you find a sapphire pendant, it ain't going to be 100 quid, is it? Because it's sapphire and Burmese is one of the top three, along with your Ceylon sapphire and your cashmere sapphire. Burmese, Burmese is that finest pinnacle grade. When you say it's limited, Roscoe, how limited? 30, okay. There's literally 30 available opportunity. Even with that limited quantity, 99 pounds and 99 pence is not your price. Remember the two millimeter strand, that's the deeper of the, uh, of the colors, has only ever closed on air at 20 pounds. 11 confirmations already, meaning I've got 19 of these left within the vault. 30 second countdown, we're gonna take it to something absolutely ridiculous, the best grade. I mean, we've casually put together a project here with the finest uh, sapphire that we have within our vault. And that's no understatement. We've got a lot of sapphire, don't get me wrong. This is the coveted sapphire. It's the equivalent of Gemporia's Lorique collection. The best that we have actually sourced. And you can visually see that quality as well. Think about the Royal Engagement Ring. What makes the Royal, Eng and by the way, the Royal Engagement Ring is, is Burmese as well. What's so iconic and desire about the Royal Engagement Ring is that wonderful deep velvety blue that you see in these fine locations. That six-figured value piece of jewellery. Wow. Well, oh. <laughs> Ross, that was 20 quid. This, you're basically getting everything, everything else for 29.99. What? I was happy at 149 to be honest. That's a hundred pounds back into your pocket. I've got 30 of these available. You will need to be quick jewelry makers. I, if I was to sit here and talk to you about this one strand, and I'm singling it out because that is the best that we actually have. Mm -hmm. If this was a deal of the day and I was solely, solely talking about that one strand and I brought it to air for 50 pounds, that on its own, yeah, it, uh, yeah, we'd have promoted it as well weeks in advance because of the quality of it. If that one strand was on its own as a deal of the day, forty nine ninety nine, it would still sell out. Today, though, it's like you're getting the finest grade, that quad A grade, effectively. You're getting a twenty pound strand of additional sapphire and some sterling silver and a box and instructions all for free. It's almost one of those auctions that almost seems. I agree. I totally agree. Ross is actually saying, if you're hesitating, then don't buy. 
it's not for you maybe if you are hesitating then d yeah don't don't buy it's like what have you ever known us actually say that to you but that's because it's the quality of the sapphire like this if that isn't isn't shouting at you to say check out your baskets then i don't think sapphire ever ever will to be honest look uh, my mum and dad and, and i'm sure they wouldn't mind me telling you this my mum and dad when i was 21 um bought me a sapphire pendant um, not a particularly expensive sapphire pendant, but a sapphire pendant is incredi incredibly sentimental to me. The colour is nowhere near that great. No way near that great. And we're talking about one, maybe six by four millimetre stone. No way near that great. The quality that you're getting in this one strand is off the chart. So effectively, we've worked this out. This strand closed on air, the two millimetres, closed on air at 19.99, sold very successfully at 19.99. You're getting the coveted strand of Burmese sapphire and the sterling silver for another 29.99. That's absolute madness. And let's not forget, the instructions are a tenner on our sister channel. Those alone are £10. Unbelievable. Keep on dialing through jewellery makers, Carol, Barbara, Pauline, Tracy, Hilda, Pauline, Janice, Deborah, Angus, Suzanne, well done. I've got another sapphire opportunity to bring you. Put that back in his box. Yeah, I bought this strand for £20 when it was on air, but this one. Yeah. yeah, I know. So. Got everything else. I was excited when I got this. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, okay, now let's bring you the next project, jewellery makers. So you get. I'll scooch those out of the way a minute. Sorry, there's so many projects. <laughs> Hang on a minute. In this next one, you get your earring wires times two. You get a heart connector or charm or jump ring. You get your bolt rings. You get a heart spacer. We've brought that, something like that to wear for, what do you reckon, just under a tenner before? You get your featherweights. You get your crimps. You get your spacers. You get your crimp covers. And you also get your beading wire. So you get all of that. But not only that, you have a very long strand of pristine eye clean clear quartz by the meter mm -hmm. 100 carats of it's our it's our diamond alternative which we very frequently see alongside sapphire um, these are four millimeter round so a perfect size that is brand new jewelry makers something like this we would definitely do as a deal of the day definitely still not done you want the cashmere blue sapphire? You want a big carrot weight? These are some of the largest sapphires we actually have within our vault currently. Burmese blue, 38 carats, upwards to seven by four millimeters in their size. Plus you get Ellie's amazing instructions. Now, we're gonna open this auction up with a price that you're not paying. It, can I just, let's have a moment of realisation for a second. Imagine yourself walking into any jewellers, whichever one you think of, any jewellers, even the more affordable jewellers, walking in and speaking to a shop assistant and saying, I'm, I'm looking for some sapphire jewellery. Maybe it's your birthstone or somebody that you know is birthstone. I'm looking for some sapphire jewellery. Okay, what's your budget? £50. They're going to be like, mm. <laughs> yeah, you don't really buy sapphire for £50. Especially not 38 carats worth. No. Which is what you're getting in this auction. It is a moment of realisation, isn't it? Jewelry makers, we are bringing you some of the, one of the world's most desirable colour gemstones. Probably the most desirable colour gemstone. Would you agree? Sapphire. It's got to be number one or two. Sapphire or ruby. Yeah. We go even lower, but I'm going to want to see you there, jewelry makers. So you get 38 carats of your beautiful Burmese blue. You get a meter of your clear quartz of the finest quality in your four mil rounds. You get all of your sterling silver essentials. Plus you get Ellie's amazing instructions um, as well on that gorgeous tennis style bracelet. How many do we have, Roscoe? 
40. So they're all exclusive and that's because of the gemstone jewelry makers. Again, that one, you think about the Royal Engagement Ring and I always say that because that for me is, you know, it's that benchmark, it's the quality that I think we aspire to when it comes to your sapphire. 39 pounds and 99 pence only. For 38 carats, a beautiful sapphire. I remember jewelry maker, little old jewelry maker launching sapphire many years ago. In a, in in a chips and nugget strand, and it wasn't far off that price tag. Oh yeah, I got that strand. <laughs> Do you remember? Yes. All those years ago, yeah. and we were like so excited because we're working with Sapphire now, yeah. and it wasn't far off that price tag no. for chips and nuggets, basically what was cut off stones. Yeah. And here we are bringing you faceted to perfection, beautiful, rich, yeah. regal blues, less than forty quid. And they are chunky. Yeah, you could use them as individual solitaires, couldn't you? Oh, easily, yeah amazing make sure you check it out everybody to guarantee your success any questions that you might have to, uh, for ellie as well do feel free to text us um because we are uh, live in the studio now next project something a little bit different uh oh hang on i'm gonna pop that there oh this is lovely so firstly you get your threaded earrings I love getting threaded earrings because I never get to use them normally and they're really lovely. And they're the biggest trend at the moment yeah. in earring findings, aren't they? Because they're so comfortable to wear. So you get the, well, I think that's called an aglet that you push through and basically gravity does the rest for you. Mm -hmm. Then you also get this lovely star extender. Yeah. Then you also get your featherweight head pins. Then you also get this amazing strand of clear quartz bicones. And they're hematites in between as well. Oh, really? There's yeah. gems in between them? Yeah. Oh, that's so beautiful. So two gems on yeah. one strand. And I'm still not done. You also get, oh, I've just said, is this meant to be in there? Yeah. Some little sterling silver crescent moons. A moon and a star. You get a moon? I'll put that down. Oops. OK. And you also get a star in sterling silver and then you also get this amazing parcel of beautiful gemstones is that sapphire and appetite yeah wow neon appetite nonetheless we're going to go straight down to that price tag jewelry makers because we have your demonstration wow for the fi for the findings alone that's amazing hang on one two i'll call the findings three because they're all sterling silver yeah. the extender the threaders the heart and uh, sorry the star and the moon um all of that that's six pounds 66 per component that's crazy absolutely crazy make sure you check it out jewelry makers to guarantee your success plus you get ellie's amazing um instructions too oh. we aren't stopping you we've got 60 <laughs> available opportunities jewelry makers we might as well be giving beautiful rare genuine gemstones away at this price tag um we get all the inspiration as well make sure you're guaranteeing your success i'm gonna be honest do i have permission ross your projects have been some of the best deals, and yet it's really quiet. Really quiet. I can't believe the prices. If we were bringing individual strands, then they would have absolutely sold out. It's almost like we're, the, the deal is too good. Yeah. Too good to believe. <laughs> what? Wow. Okay. That's Again, ridiculous. It is ridiculous. I've done showcases of clear quartz where one strand has been more than that on your screen. Yeah. Um, the strand of clear quartz would be more than... You're buying your clear quartz and you're getting all that sterling silver, um, your near appetite and your sapphires for free and also the instructions for free. Um, we've got 60 available opportunities, jewellery makers. Make sure you're checking out your basket. That's one of the maddest deals I've ever seen. Basically, threader earrings. Let's call that one component. Um, let's call all the other sterling silver items as another component. Let's call the little parcel um, of your neon appetite and your sapphire another component. Let's call the strand of the clear quartz another component, which they all are. Four components. You're talking at what was that? Three pounds something. Yeah. Unbelievable. And these have got really good um, drill holes as well. The yeah. small faceted rounds. Are that what are these four? Yeah, four yeah. mil, four mil rounds. Um, take it away, jewelry mate, uh, mm. Ellie, with your with your demonstrations. Any questions, jewelry makers, that you might have? Do text in. So what are you going to show us? Show you've got gorgeous this creations almost here. Almost like, I guess like 
So it's almost like a, not a spider web. It might be called the herringbone, actually. I can't remember. I'm not very good with the names. I just do, if that makes sense. The one in the middle on the leather cord. Yeah, this one. Yeah. So I'm going to show you how to make that central pendant in the middle. And your instructions are on that beaded brace. Oh, wow, that's amazing. Um, are on the beaded bracelet, so you effectively get the two demos. Okay. Yes. So... <clears throat> What we're going to do is we're going to first of all we're going to use one of your bicones that we had in that last kit and just pop that onto an eye pin and then what I'm going to do at the end is about a centimeter down bend that out with my flat nose pliers then I'm just going to make a little loop so our bead doesn't fall off give that a little squeeze I always do this give things little squeezes, give the wires little squeeze with my uh, pliers just because it stops it from being bendy. So does it work hard? It yeah. does work hard on it, yes, yeah. So we've got this on here now, which actually is quite, I like the, I like jewellery with movement. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, I wanted to try out this, the herringbone, just because I think I've done it before, but years ago, probably when I was living in Barcelona. So about eight or nine years ago. That was when I was first started watching Jewelry Maker, really, it was just I before we moved there. I remember Ellie yeah. from Barcelona. <laughs> yeah, and I always used to send in my pictures to the Wall yeah. of Fame on the uh, terracotta background that was our, <laughs> I remember, I remember our balcony. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I've taken about a metre of the 0.4 millimetre wire. You probably don't need quite this much, but I always over... Over egg it. Over egg it, that's it. So, what I'm just, what I'm just going to do is near to the centre. I'm going to just wrap around a couple of times on this eye pin, and bring the bead up. I'm just going to trim that little wire off here, push that up, and then what I'm going to do, I'm going to hold the bead in the centre, bring this wire around to the outside. So as you can see here, I've just brought it round to the outside of this and onto the top again. So we're going to go back round on the same side. I'm going to wrap that round just once. I'm going to turn that around and then we're going to take the wire around the bead again and then wrap around underneath that wire. And then each time we keep turning, we're going to wrap but when you come to do the next one, what we want to do is you can see there's this little tiny gap here of about a millimetre. And what we want to try and do, instead of pulling that wire tight against the bead like that, we want to leave a little tiny gap all the way around. And that can be a little bit tricky, but if you just hold on with your thumb and forefinger, you can keep the shape a little bit more. And you'll see that when you pull it in to tighten it, it does close that up a little bit. And that's why when I'm bringing it round, I give it more of a gap than I want it to end up with. Because as you pull it round, it tightens the wire around and brings that closer in. And see, I haven't got mine quite central, so I just need to move that up a little bit. That's quite the useful thing about doing it on here because it will, you will be able to, the bead will move up and down as you're doing this, but actually you'll still be able to get an even finish because you're, you can just move your bead back into the centre where you need it. So bring that round again. And this, um, this will build up quite quickly. you'll see it gives it a nice organic look I think if you used um, a thicker gauge wire you might be able to get more of a more of a com not complete semicircle mm. what am I, th I thinking I can't think of the term I'm looking for I, I did it like this because I wanted it to look organic okay so rather than like rather than being a, that polished a, finish um, perfect Yes, yeah. Semi circle. I want, you want yeah. it to be sort of uh, exactly. undulation. Exactly, yeah. I wanted it to be an organic shape rather than it being too perfect. 
because that was that was just the look that I was going mm. for. So yeah, again, see, just over a millimetre. You'll find that once you start to get out to the the layers that are further out, this will actually get a lot easier because you can hold on to these wires here and just wrap around like this. So you can see at the beginning, it was quite tricky for me to hold on, but as soon as you've got a few of your layers in, I guess it almost looks a little bit like an onion with all the little layers. Oh, that, yeah, the skin. Yeah. Or the circles of a tree. Yes, oh, that's nicer, yeah. <laughs> Here, have my onion pendant. <laughs> oh, that's gorgeous. It's also a little bit, uh, it's reminding me of space. Yes. Yeah, almost like s solar system -y. Yeah, and satellite and things yeah. like that. So, there we go. Yeah, you can see it builds up really quickly. So this is, this is one of those pieces that actually you can get a lot of satisfaction out quite quickly. Yeah. Um, whereas like sometimes when you're making something, I know when I'm making the larger pieces and you've got all these wires hanging out everywhere and you sometimes feel like you can't see the end of what you're working on. But with this, with this sort of style of piece, it builds up so nice and quickly that you've got something at the end that is so, so pretty that you've made so quickly. So it gives you that real sense of satisfaction, I think. We go. Just do this. These last few, and yeah, you'll see that these they do actually move up and down like this. But what we want to do is put, just keep, make sure you keep pushing it into the centre, so that when you come to do your next one, it pulls in tight. But yeah, I haven't um, I haven't done this sort of. Um, style in ages and while I was doing it I was like oh why haven't I done this sort of style in ages it's nice and satisfying nice and quick and I think it makes a really pretty central focal point to what you're doing to your piece um, but yeah I also put it on the leather cord because it's lovely to have sapphires on chains but I just thought do you know what yeah, a bit contemporary it's nice to make something yeah. yeah a little bit more contemporary a little bit more just a little bit more different to the usual classic pretty jewellery, I guess. Yeah. Um, modern. Modern, yeah. Okay. So we're almost coming up to the end now. And that meter was probably just about right for that eye pin. That's why you said over, over egg it. Yeah. Because then, I guess it's not impossible to add if you do run out. But it's not impossible to add, no. But it, um, easier to it, yeah, it keeps the design a little bit more flowy. Hmm. Flowy. That's the technical term for it. Keep it more flowy for you. So I think the next one might be the last one. Let's bring this around here. Again, you can, mine's ended up being quite wide either side, but you might do yours and it might be more circular. Hmm. So, and when we're finishing off, just gonna wrap around a few times on this end. Cut that off with your cutters. Give it a little squeeze. Again, this is something I always do, squeeze in those ends, because if it's something that's going to be against the skin, you don't want that catching you. Um, yeah, and there you can see it's a nice little that's gorgeous. shimmery disc. And it also looks nice on the back, and because it's the same, it doesn't matter if it flips round, it just depends which side you prefer to nice wear it. Nice earrings too. I mean, yeah. what a great way of like taking one individual stone, whether that's sapphire or clear quartz, and yes. actually creating like a, a, a whole pendant out of one stone. Yes, yeah. A connector or whichever it is. And that would be really minimal, hmm? really minimal cost of materials to make something like that. Yeah, but still, like I said, a, a beautiful, genuine gemstone. Yes. What an amazing demonstration. Thank you, Ellie. 
Loving that, absolutely loving that. And don't forget, with each of your projects, you also get Ellie's instructions for um, that beautiful tennis style bracelet. Um, loving these designs. I mean, you could put one of the sapphires in the center there. Couldn't yes, you? yeah, you definitely could. Oh, oh yeah. Ross has just realized something. It's September, isn't it? <gasps> <laughs> you get an additional 20% off. Yeah. Even I the kits. Yeah, I forgot I saw that on the website the other day. I was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> I totally forgot that. And it's my, uh, it's the month of my birthday, so 20%, that's a big percentage. Mm. Um, so use your discount code on top. Well done, jewellery makers. I mean, it was an amazing deal even without that. Make sure you're checking out everybody. Now, remember, there's still lots to bring you this gorgeous uh, Wednesday morning. We've got that stunning strand. Uh, stunning strand um, of yellow jade but coming up with Dave in round about 10 minutes time are the finest carvings that I think I've ever seen it's it's the uses you know like an artist say so an artist is sketching or uh, or um, and they obviously literally using a pencil it's the areas of light and shade isn't it that make yeah. that, that that you know that really make that um, piece pop I suppose you know the shad the use of shadowing and things like that in a sense we're using the color of the jade in that same way yeah you know it's highlighting the detail within each and every single one of these carvings which are the one um, you want to actually look at here these are coming up in literally 10 minutes time now because we have just realized about that 20% discount I mean, look at that that's amazing coming up in about 10 minutes time shall we fully capitalize on the fact it's september um and sapphire is uh the birthstone for this wait that's a long strand right? these are amazing it's a very long strand shall we make the most of that of, of that 20 percent discount 45 carats of natural sapphire Look at that beautiful colour. You could do literally do uh, Ellie's technique that she's just demonstrated, couldn't you? You could pop these in amongst those gorgeous pearls that you had in the first hour. 20% off, but remember to use, get 20% off using September 20. Take advantage. Um, when was the last time we did a Sapphire Showcase? Mm. Have we got quantity, Roscoe? 50. <gasps> Capriccio, can you imagine a sapphire Capriccio bracelet? Yeah, I want them with this. I want everything with you this. You want everything with the yellow <laughs> jade? Yeah, that would look amazing too. Yeah, you could do tassels, you could create, uh, you could literally knot these individually. If you go on first dibs, you are most definitely finding sapphire beaded jewellery. So I've got 50 available opportunities. I want to see you there though, if we're going to do this amazing price tag. Let's open it up at a closing price. We know that what, sorry, the two mil on their own have closed for 20 pounds. The one that was in that project, we know they were 20 pounds. So you also get 20% off this, so which is 10 pounds off that price tag. So this is already a 40 pound strand for a casual 45 carats. That's amazing, isn't it? Mm. That's absolutely amazing. Less than a pound per carat with your discount code. I have 50 available opportunities. The joy of Sapphire is it's a gemstone that you could wear literally on a daily basis. Um, because you have got its natural durability. It's nine on the most scale, so one of the hardest gemstones that actually exists. We're gonna open this up at an already closing uh, closing price tag, if that makes sense. Because take 20% off that price tag using September 20. Now, if the two mil went to 20, then the four mil could easily close at 39.99. But that's a further eight pounds off that price tag, so 32 pounds. Mm -hmm. For 45 carats of natural sapphire. 60 seconds. Oh, you... really? Okay, there is no logic. <laughs> Logic's still out the window. Yeah. 60 seconds, and we're going to match the price of the two mil. For a four mil. These are four mil, but we're going to match the two mil price tag. 
in 60 seconds time, jewelry makers. Use your September 20 discount code on checkout. Um, that's literally TV, web, not just, yeah, literally everything for this first month. So use that September 20 on your checkout. That's eight pound back into your Skyrocket. Um, Maker five, Tracy, Deborah, Janice, Multivine, natural blue sapphire faceted and that's why you're seeing that gorgeous surface luster it's not a short strand we're talking about a full 38 centimeter strand here as well jewelry makers um absolutely unbelievable we're going even lower i've said it out loud we're matching the price jewelry makers we're matching the price of the two mils giving you a 60 second warning so you can make sure that you don't miss out on this opportunity it's happening we are matching the price of the two mils. You know there shouldn't be though. And let's be honest. Oh, so you're matching it. And then it's got the And then you've got the 20%. <laughs> oh, well, I, I assumed amazing. you were matching it with the 20%. What's you, it's actually 16 pounds. So these are actually more affordable than the two mil that we brought earlier on. How amazing is that? Yeah. But also that first kit as well that was forty nine ninety nine is actually thirty nine ninety nine. Yeah, then, with the discount. With the discount code for the Burmese sapphire. And if, yeah, <laughs> if these don't sell out, I'm most definitely joining you on this. It's my birthstone, um, and who wouldn't want to get hold of sapphire for what sixteen quid? Mm. Sixteen pounds. I go back to my original statement. Do you remember when we launched sapphire here at Jewelry Maker for in chips and nuggets? They definitely weren't anywhere near twenty quid. Um, Atia, well done to you, Karen, Five, Tracy, Carolyn, hello to you, Sharon, Joanne, Buckinghamshire, Olivia, Lynn, Tina, Corinne, hello to you, uh, Maker, Deborah, Janice. You know, whether you sell your jewellery or whether you make it a gift, people know Sapphire yeah. and they have a perceived, a, a justified perceived value of the price of Sapphire. It is not normally £16. These are not diffused, they're not Fisher filled, totally natural. You're getting 20% off that price tag. Oh, <laughs> Ross, are you being a tinker again? Oh. He says, I've got a big quantity of them. I never, never intended on stopping at 19.99. Put another 60 second clock on your screen because we're going even lower. Oh. Even lower. Are they going to sell out? Because I was going to get some of these. Yeah, I wanted to get some. I'd dash off and get them then because otherwise these are going to sell out. <laughs> Imagine a Sapphire Capriccio bracelet. How incredible that would be. How amazing that would actually be. In 33 seconds, jewelry makers would drop it even lower. Nobody is paying 19.99, whether you're the first or the last. Uh, Christine, Janice, Buckinghamshire, multi-buy. It's all right, Ellie's going off to get some sapphire. It's all good, Michael. With 20% off, September 20, Ellie. Make sure you use that discount code. Deborah's got two. 10 seconds, we go even lower, jewelry makers. Everybody is gonna pay that final low. 20 quid! Well, it's not a 16 quid, is it? Now, with your discount. Under 15 pounds. Use September 20, it takes it under 15 pounds. That's amazing. For how many carats? 45 carats of natural blue sapphire. The most sought after color of sapphire in the world. You know, as somebody that maybe is thinking, oh, making jewelry thinking oh, i might start a business i mean this is going to be bread and butter for you isn't it sapphire you and you can see it's sapphire because the quality of the blue the quality of the saturation do you have to do you have to use all 45 carats in one piece of jewelry no just one they're big solitaires at four millimeters uh, maker in county durham bought six well done i don't blame you county durham i would be doing exactly the same pamela's multi-bought lynn's multi-bought tina's multi-bought buckinghamshire's multi-bought pfeiffer's multi-bought you do disappear off the screens. I've got multi-buyers at the bottom of the screen as well. Take advantage, advantage. There is still chances for you to get involved. September 20 is the discount code to use. Um, so if your name is Sue, Christine, Anne, June, Anne, Emma, Carolyn, Sharon, Joanne, Janice, new customer, Rosemary, Ellie, you need to be checking out your baskets. Uh, use September 20 because these are going to sell out today without shadow of a doubt. Unbelievable, that's one of the maddest deals that I think we've ever done. Under 15 pounds for 45 carats of natural blue, genuine sapphire. And it's not so heavily saturated that it's borderline black. Let's do what? 
jump up in carrot weight, bring you a different cut, and continue on these uh, birthstone deals, shall we? This is more limited, though. I love cubes. Do you remember when cubes were like the, the hottest cut? And now all of a sudden we don't really see them, do we? I imagine because they're quite wasteful, because you've effectively got to cut your starters almost like a rounded shape, and then you're cutting carrot weight away. These are extremely limited, though. We've got less than 30 available opportunities. Again, brings like a contemporary design. Great for gents' makes, I think. Um, now, remember, you're getting 20% off using Sapphire 20. Could stop here, couldn't we? But we're not gonna. We're not gonna stop there. Beautiful, rich, regal blue, classic sapphire. Sapphire comes in a multitude of colours, but uh, blue still remains to be the most popular. Um, you know what to do. More limited, though, jewellery makers. So make sure you are checking out your baskets. Um, in 10 seconds, remember that 20% discount, September 20, to guarantee your success. You saw how popular the 4mm rounds were. Equally, I, I, I mean, I don't know, I'm not the designer here, but could you make a Capriccio bracelet with cubes? I think you could. And you could definitely make like a modern tassel. <gasps> 16 pounds! Is that right? Yeah, 16 pounds. 16 pounds with your discount code unbelievable jewelry makers with the pearls that we had earlier on i mean sapphires are always appropriate aren't they you know what to do jewelry makers you could go with a tennis style bracelet the uh, the pearls that we had earlier on in the beginning of the show i think they would work absolutely amazingly with as well um unbelievable opportunities hello tracy hello to you doreen hello to you deborah hello to you michelle hello to you london london Hello to you, Margaret. Well done to you, Kathy. You've got to be checking out though to guarantee a success. Four pound off, as if we just totally forgot about that twenty massive twenty percent discount that you can uh, that you can benefit from. When was the last time we had a sapphire showcase? Do you reckon we could do a sapphire showcase? Probably not. Oh, discounts like this. Um, keep on dialing through jewellery makers. Don't worry, everyone. Ellie's just gone to get her sapphire. Can't say I blame her at these kind of prices. Now, again, we have some of the finest artistry that I believe we've ever seen. Um, the fact that when an artist is doing some sort of sketching, like say with a pencil, they sort of use light and shade, don't they, with the strength of the actual pencil itself. With this, you're using the colour of the beautiful jade. Um, the skill is unbelievable. Like I said, it's three-dimensional in its designs. Um, and these are all done by hand. They're being launched, jewelry makers, by um, Dave himself, who's stepping into the studio. They're absolutely remarkable. Remember, the biggest quantity that we have is actually 30. Um, the yellow jade strands coming your way as well, which is absolutely incredible. But first, your fantastic creations in the Wall of Fame. <laughs> which means the draw i know it's exciting very um, exciting i never get to be here for the draw well you're here today <laughs> here today starting us off this morning got a lot of lovely makes here to show um 553 is from deb buckley hello to you deb absolutely beautiful jewelry and deb says hello everybody here is my entry to the wall of fame a trio of classy macrame friendship bracelets a gift to a great buddy for her birthday. Components of beautiful Eslon thread and beads are from Jewelry Maker. Idea from Mark and techniques from one of Natalie's projects. Good luck to everybody with your creative entries. Oh, good luck to you, Deb, and happy birthday to your friend. You're 553. I've got 554, Julie Codling. Here is my entry for the Wall of Fame. I made some simple earrings out of the lovely sterling silver line connectors. Everything from JM. Good luck to all. Beautiful. Lovely. Good luck. I have 555 from Jim Hall. Hello to you, Jim. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Uh, and Jim says, good morning, everybody. Here is my entry to the Wall of Fame. It's a macrame bracelet made using gold-colored nylon cord, channel set turquoise 80 seed beads, and the centerpiece is a bezel cup filled with milliput, colored with gold mica powder, textured and set with shell pearls and 
a tile. Uh, best luck to everybody in the draw. Take care. Jim, that's gorgeous. That's Loving wonderful. that. Very Ashley Clark. Loving yeah, that. Lovely. 555. Says 556, Julia Dudley. Hello again, JM family. This week, my entry for the Wall of Fame is something I've been working on this week. It's a bead embroidered jellyfish with cup chain tentacles. It will eventually be part of a design on a felt tote bag I'm working on. As I recently brought a large amount of huge felt sheets from the website and I'm slowly working my way through it. Good luck to all those in the drawer. That's amazing. Loving that. They are beautiful, aren't they, Jennifer? They are. I'm always in awe of the beading work as well. Because Gorgeous. It's just, yeah, Fabulously amazing. Intricate. I have 557 from Angela Smith, a lovely suite of jewellery. And Angela says, hi all. This week's entry to the WAF is a station necklace made with blue gold stone clover beads joined together with size 11 and 15 seed bead chain. Good luck to all fellow WAFers. That's stunning, Angela. Lovely. Very nice. Loving that. 557. And I've got 558, Jackie Bunce. Good morning, here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. Two simple stretchy bracelets, one is sterling silver beads combined with a garnet charm and the other using Baltic amber nuggets with the sterling silver. All bought from JM. Thanks for the good deals and designer inspirations every week. Good luck to all. Gorgeous. Lovely. Good luck to you. I have number 559 and this is from Isabel Morgan. Wow. Some lovely wire work there. Isabel says, uh, hello lovely friends, I've had fun with JM Wire and a super Jasper cabochon this week and I'm planning to gift it to my friend on a chain for her 70th birthday this Friday. Wishing you all a fabulous day. Isabel, that's wonderful and happy birthday to your friend. Isn't it wonderful we can make things for our friends? I know, really lovely. Good luck to you, 559. Uh, 560 Karen Forbes, please find attached my entry into this week's WAF. Blue Chalcedony with Lava Rock and Charm, gems are from JM and Charm from my stash. The meaning for Blue Chalcedony is to boost listening and communication skills, enhance self-perception and improves memory. I need to have lots of this during menopause, lol. Good luck to one and all. That's oh, lovely. Beautiful. Yeah, I hear you about the memory. I've yes. got terrible memory. Same. I think I don't think I've ever had a good memory. That's the thing. <laughs> uh, 561 is from Sheila Forbes. Hello to you, Sheila. Some beautiful rosary linking here, and she says hi. This is a project, uh, a product of my last pearl scoop. Um, love doing rosary linking and love the effect of uh, the artistic cross. Uh, very beautiful. Love a pearl scoop as well. Yeah. We had we launched one for the first time in four years, not so long ago. Four years. Um, That's stunning. A, but that might be what the four-year-old scoop, or is it the new one that you've just received? Um, good luck to you. Lovely. This is 562, Tracy Austin. Hi to all the JM family. Here is my waffering for this week. It's a bracelet made with gold-plated heart and leaf charms and fancy S-hooks. The bracelet kit I purchased a long time ago from JM. Wishing good luck to me and my fellow Waffers. Much love to all. That's Aww, lovely. Beautiful. Very clever. Really lovely. Using the S I like the photography as well. It's Very nice. nice. In the background. Shall we make some of our lovely viewers a bit yes. richer? Shall we? Go on then. Would you like to do the winner? Yeah. Take it away. Give it a, wh <laughs> give it a whiz. £100 being credited to your jewellery maker account. Go on, Ellie. Oh. The winner. Just got one. Got one? Hold it up to the camera. 535. 535. That's Jane Dignam. Jane Dignam. Dignam. Well done, Jane. Yay. You're our winner this week. £100 being credited to your jewellery maker account. Right, now for the runner up. Give it another whiz. So I get great pleasure out of it. I know, it's good. It's really satisfying. It is. <laughs> really satisfying. Right, let's have a little look. A little rummage around. Oh. I think I have one. Yeah. The runner up. Oh, it's a high number. Number 570. That's Linda Jones. Linda Jones, well done. You're our runner up this week, receiving £50 credited to your jewellery maker account. And if you're watching, thinking, how do I get involved on the Wall of Fame? 
it is very very simple you send a photograph of your creation um, to studio at jewelrymaker.com drop us a message the only stipulation is that they are jewelry maker products of course um, and every Wednesday we do the Wall of Fame draw um, you've got to be in it to win it Ellie you do got to be in it to win it yeah so make sure you do <laughs> send your photographs in we have gifted hundreds of thousands of pounds over the years so since jewelry maker has been broadcasting because it actually started literally on day one um, now coming up jewelry makers we've got one of the most breathtaking carvings with the wonderful dave tross there are carvings and then there are carvings. <laughs> I don't think we've seen anything like what you're about to as your as your deal of the day today, jewelry makers. Imagine sort of levels of different colours. The artistry is completely mind blowing. So do not go anywhere. I'm interested to find exactly how we've come into acquisition of these opportunities, or rather your opportunities, jewelry makers. So your deal of the day is nothing short of breathtaking, and it's up next. <laughs> Oh, I'm super excited about this next opportunity because when we talk about artistry, this has literally blown my mind. Of course, there can only be one person. We've got the wonderful Dave, everybody. Oh, thank you so much. How are you, Ali? Okay. I'm really good. These um, are incredible. Well, this is a level of artistry, a level of carving that we've never seen before. Um, all of us are in awe of these. Yeah. Um, as with anything that, that is new like this and, and the skill set that you're about to witness, it is ridiculously limited. I want to stress that uh, straight out the gate. These are from Manma, so we're talking about um, a very, very um, depleted source. Mm -hmm. uh, and when we talk about the red material, it's never been stockpiled. Yeah. We're talking about, uh, I've been saying this since about 2020, 2021, when I was speaking to real experts, real authorities in the world of jade, like Roland Schlussel, mm. um, when they used to say, look, these fancy colors of jade, when we're talking about the oranges, the reds, the yellows, at some point in the not too distant future, they are going to become the most valuable yeah. jades in in the world. Yeah. Right? And and I know Imperial Jade sits at the top of the tree. Uh, and look, it is the the ultimate. But when we talk about jade and its history, jade in particular, like mm. a thousand years, and for m much of that, the recent history, they used to mine forty thousand tons of it in a season. Yeah. So you know, we've talked about the boulders that are as big as houses yeah. that take weeks to be excavated that are then loaded onto trains and taken into the Far East and to China mm. to families to carve and process them. And we also know that in northern Myanmar, in, in the, the Kachin Hills where jadeite comes from, it's so dense in chromium, it's so chromium rich that all of the jade is green. Yeah. All of the jadeite that we find or have found is green in, in Burma. That's what makes it so magical. That's why we have so many different terms like Celadon green, Kingfisher green, mm. Apple green, Imperial green. Um, obviously not all of it is Imperial green, that's true. But when we talk about the, the ultra rare colors, the fancy colors, the, the reds, the yellows, they can only exist in that skin layer. Yeah. And, and I say can because they don't always. It's like one in a thousand chance you'll find it. Yeah, if. Uh, and that's, yeah, if. And that's why you don't get solid red jade bangles. That's why you don't get, you know, solid red jade pieces because it is just these moments of the skin. Yeah. Um, I remember filming a clipper film uh, when I was in Las Vegas in 2022. And I was speaking to uh, an incredible jadeite family that have been in the industry for like 100 years or 60 years. And I remember thinking I knew everything about jade, you know, because I'd been to China, I'd been to Myanmar, and I had the cameraman with me, and th there was this booth in Las Vegas in JCK, and they had the most incredible jade, and they had like a, I don't know, like an eight to nine mil strand of imperial green jade. Wow. And it was in, it was on a bust, it was, it was in a glass uh, uh, case on their booth, and I was like, oh, we'll go over here, we'll get this on camera. And I said to them, they had loads of other bits of jade, as you can imagine, all the different wonderful uh, pieces and varieties. And I said, um, you know, forgive me, is this, is this the rarest and most valuable jade on your booth or something along those terms? And they smiled and they're like, yeah, yeah. And then I was talking to them about how I'd been to Myanmar and they kind of opened up then. Because yeah. They thought, oh, he's not just a kind of tourist. This guy is he's working with jade yeah. um, and, you know, he's passionate about it. And they said, all right, to be honest, that isn't the most expensive jade on our booth. Many would think that it is. It is certified Imperial. Imperial. But they said, we've got some jade, some really special jade in our, in our safe. 
Now, which isn't unique. Like anyone who's got a booth at any gem show will have a safe. It comes as customary with your yeah. booth. You know, when you pack up at the end of the day in the convention centers, you have to have somewhere to put your incredible uh, jewels. So they have these big safes with the lock wheels. And they said, we don't get it out because the West don't really understand Jade, but we, we bring it with us. They said, we'll show it to you if you want. I said, oh yeah, amazing. So they opened it up and I was, uh, I was thinking, I was imagining, oh my God, it's gonna be imperial green jade bangles. It's gonna be huge imperial green carvings. Like with Asprey, where they have the ultimate incredible like 17th century carved teapots of imperial yeah. green jade. It's gonna be something epic. And they pulled out this tray and they put it on the, 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 the table and it's just like red jade. But not, not glowing red, not like supreme crazy red colors. It's like, you know, russet tones, terracotta colors. Yeah. Um, there was a hinge bangle, there were several other pieces. Like cherry tomato-like color. Yeah, exactly like this, if I'm honest. Yeah. Exactly like the pieces I'm gonna bring to you today. And they said, um, and the gentleman was young, right? The, 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 el the elder uh, people on the booth, like his family, were really traditional, didn't really speak any English. Mm -hmm. He's a young guy, he's like my age, and he spoke like fluent English, mm. American accent. Um, and he's probably studied here or in, you know, in, in America. And he said, this is the, the, the most valuable jade we have on our booth. And I was like, oh my God. And I was talking to them about it. And I was like, where are you getting this from? Yeah, you know, because like at this point, you know, I've been working with jade for two years. I've been to Myanmar, I've seen jade that I can't buy, but I've seen a lot of jade. Yeah. Uh, I've been to Guangzhou, like jade cities. Yeah. Cities, I'm talking thousands of people that all just deal in jade. Now they have loads of dyed material, they have the natural material, and you just don't see red jade. It's yeah. so bizarre to see. And here they have with a tray of it. And he said, and I've got it on camera as well, and I know I've shown it you before, but he said it sounds really terrible. He goes, but the only way I get this is unfortunately if someone dies. Mm. He literally said that. He said, you can't get this material anymore. Mm. It's so old. Um, because no one has stockpiled it, which is what Roland Schlussel has been telling us for like four years. He said, unfortunately, we've, we, we've got a big reputation in, in the Far East. And he said, families will come in, couples will come in, and they go, hey, um, you know, our grandparents passed away, or our parents have unfortunately passed away. We're going through their estate, and they've got this jade. They, they bought it from you guys like 50 years ago, 45 years ago, because they've been in the industry for like three generations. Um, and we look, we don't know what to do with it. We thought we'd, we'd see if you want to buy it. Mm. And he said, and like, I have to buy it back for like today's market Price value. Of, yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Well, obviously cost, because he's going to sell it again. But, and I was like, on camera I said this. So, so what, what kind of price is? And I'm talking genuinely pieces that are smaller than this, less red than this. And he said, well, we see the invoice because they bring it in. Because obviously anyone who collects jade of that value, they keep everything Would keep together. the documentation. So yeah. he'll see it. He, his family sold it. And he said, like, they, my family have sold it. I can see for like for, for 45, 50 years ago for like a few thousand dollars, mm. which is a hell of a lot of money back then. Yeah. He said, I'm having to buy it back for like 55 to 60,000 wow. dollars today. And he buys as much as he can. And he's still only got a tray. That is the, the legacy that is red jade. Now, also, another thing that I want to touch on, and I want to completely hit this off straight away so everyone knows, this material is heated, okay? This is yep. not like 100% type A natural. Most jadeite that is red will be heated, even the ones that are crazy $200,000. Mm -hmm. You can't just heat jade and make it red. No, it, it has, has to, to originate from the skin. Right. Okay, so it will only d turn it a deeper color. So this will, be, this will have been an orange or a yellow. It has to come from the skin. It's, ultra rare, mm. very valuable, and they heat it just to even out the color tone. You can't wow. take like green jade or white jade and heat it and it turns red. No. Many people, and I just want to be really frank with this, I am not the oracle on jade, many people will call this type A jade, and it's a gray area, okay? Um, the only reason I'm calling this just, you know, natural red jade and not type A is because I know it's been heated, so I feel like I, I want to tell you guys that. Yeah. It doesn't affect the value, which is the crazy thing. It is still uh, type A. So when you talk about type A, type B, and type C, and I want to cover this off, because I don't want you to miss out on this opportunity. I don't want you to look at this and go, oh no, I only buy type A. This, many of the, the red jade that we will have seen before would have come in as type A, and that we've sold as type A, will have been heated. We just didn't know about it. Mm. Right, because no one feels the need to put it on there. The certificate will not even talk about that. Like the certificates for these, I don't know if Wayne's in there. We'll say natural jade, right Wayne? The, the actual lab certificate doesn't talk about the heat treatment, doesn't say no. it on there. It says natural jade because the only way that we uh, classify treatments in jade eye, you, like we said, there's just three brackets, type A, type B, type C, right? Yeah. That's it, there's no others. Um, type A is 100% natural jade. Type B is polymer impregnated. Yeah, well, isn't... Type C is dyed, okay? 
the only treatment that we see when we talk about jade is when it has been impregnated. Yes. So no one talks about heat treatment because that's routine. In fact, every jade we bring you has had, every jade, type A, green, everything, has an element of heat treatment because every jade is dipped in wax and dropped into hot wax of course, yeah. to be polished. Even if it's 100% type A, not heated. So that is heat treatment because it's, it's really hot. It's, warm, it's melted yeah. wax. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. It's, so just because we know that, and we are at the forefront of what we want to be doing, we're telling you that, every red jade out there will have been heated. I'm not practically assured of it. Mm -hmm. But if we know it, we're gonna tell you that. Now, I can't call this type B jade, because it's, it's not, not type B. Yeah. I'm not calling this type C jade, because it's not type C. And I've, I've, yeah, I've spoken to many people in the industry. Many people sell this as type A jade. I just don't feel comfortable doing that, because I've always said type A means a no treatment. But there is no other name for it. There's no other term. And in a minute, uh, sorry. No, I, carry on. But in a minute, just I've gone to such lengths to show you this. I um, I got a friend of mine to send me a jade certificate from from the okay. jade lab in the GIA, right? So when we talk about the GIA, they've only just started certifying jade, right? Because you yeah, know, it is something that is really poorly misunderstood. And they'll say natural jade, and then when they put treatment, they won't put no heat or heat. They'll put no signs of impregnation. Because that yeah. is what is considered treatment within the world of jade. Yes, yeah. So I'm about to offer you these three unbelievable opportunities of the most valuable jade that we have ever offered. Yeah. The most valuable jade that we have ever offered. Um, and we know that as, as buyers. And I'm going to say, if you can, this is how passionately I feel about this. If you can, I would absolutely recommend you get all three. Mm. Because... Um, Many of you know, like proudly stood in front of David Harry Jules, um, and, and I bring you exquisite opportunities, or try to. I've only done two shows. I've managed to make Imperial Jadeye available in the Western world, right? That's I've, amazing. We, we, for me, it's like a feather in my cap. I can't believe I've done it. I've never offered red jade on David Harry Jules. Right. We cannot get it. Now, I have um, acquired red jade for a, a friend of mine who's a client in the Middle East. Mm -hmm. um, and someone who has a million dollar red jade strand, which by the way is heated, yeah, and it's still a million dollars. And he approached me about a year ago, and he wanted to get some more red jade for his father's collection, extraordinarily wealthy family, distantly related to the Altani royal family um, in the Middle East, he's from Qatar. And um, I've been working really hard to secure them some red jade, and we managed to get the deal over the line. I've got you these three opportunities. Now, there's not 100 or 200. It is just these moments. And just to give you some context of how valuable this is, because we have been talking about these of them, by the way. And just to That's give you insane, some... Yeah, it? it's ridiculous. And also, as well, while, while we're doing that, I'm going to turn one of them over. Oh, my goodness. Just so you can see the level of colour that we're dealing yeah. with. This is a very distinct level of carving, where they bring the colours out by carving like this. So they're it's pretty much painting with carving. Oh, it's three-dimensional for sure. I mean, for instance, there's this piece here, if I may, and you can see it is literally three-dimensional. It's carvings inside carvings. Like as you move this wow. around, you, you can see through these these moments to, to view the carving underneath, which is that just That one's outrageous. the most limited, Dave, oh, I'm being God, told. Yeah. There's 20. Yes, which is incredible that we that have 20. That is amazing, yeah. But, you know, we have said, even when we knew a lot less about Jade, we kind of parroted other authorities in the industry like Roland Schlussel. And I remember reading to you guys, oh, Roland Schlussel told me that um, you know, red Jade or, or these fancy colors are gonna become more expensive than Imperial Green Jade. Mm. And it, it's come to fruition because, sorry if I just borrow this, thank you. Um, Asprey, they are openly leading the high jewelry Jade Eye world, right? Mm -hmm. And they put together this incredible collection. They did a huge press release, just 60 pieces, invitation only. You have to schedule an appointment to go and view them. And their, their um, entry level price point is 130,000 pounds, <laughs> right? And it's all Imperial Jade. There's some unbelievable lavenders as well, but their most expensive piece is this piece, which is 18 million pounds. Yeah, it's, it's not a, even carved. No, it, well, they don't want to carve it because you know if you carve it into something that someone doesn't want, there's not very many people with 18 million pounds. So they're basically saying, we'll carve whatever you want. Yeah. As opposed to carving it and someone going, oh, I was going to buy something for 80 million pounds, but I didn't want the dragon. Yeah, or I yeah, didn't want yeah. the phoenix. So they're saying, look, we've got this epic, incredible red piece of rough. Yeah. And you can buy it for 80 million pounds and we'll carve whatever it is you desire. Because they understand how significant it is to have a piece of red jade that good. 
Wow. We have got those colors. So if, if I just read this to you, if I may, in their press release, obviously there's some wonderful green jade on that, but they talk about how the Mayfair based luxury house has recently acquired this piece of rough. Um, but they say this piece of jade art features many of the hues with which this silicate mineral can be blessed, right? Which obviously is the green. That's what, mm. the, yeah. but it says notably red and white. Mm. Every piece in our show today is red and white. Yeah. Right, that's what makes that 18 million pounds. That's how they justify that piece being 18 million pounds. And today we get to do, I believe, the impossible. We've been bringing you Jade here at Jewelry Maker for three plus years, maybe four years. Same as on Jewelry Maker. It's the only time we've ever offered carrot weights like this, carving like this, gemminess like this in red and white pieces. And if I could just, sorry, thank you. This is it up close. Mm. It's, it's about 30 centimeters long, it weighs 7.5 kilograms, and there's two plumes of white and one vein of red. Every single piece I'm bringing you today is red and white. Please don't call yet, I'm gonna tell you when we, we make these available, I'll make sure that everyone is aware when these tiny quantities are made available. But I'm just gonna cycle through the kind of value of red jade. Yeah. This is a red and white jade bangle. They, they call it just a red jade bangle. And back in 2015, the pre-sale estimate on that was 10 to 15,000 US dollars, just for a moment of red. Which they underestimate as yeah, well, don't yeah. they? Because they want to spark interest. Uh, uh, exactly, so uh, God knows what it sold for, but that is the reality. Uh, on the next slide is a, is a kind of carved two and a half inch snuff bottle. And again, it's just got a, a thin film of red clinging to it. That's the red yeah. vein, the skin. And yet they still refer to that as just a red jade bottle. No mention of green, just red. This is another bangle. And this is important Lovely. because this is the Bonhams auction house. This mm. is 2014, okay. and we can see what it sold for. Yeah. So that, the, forget the pre-sale estimate, that sold for 200,000 Hong Kong dollars, which is about 25,640 US dollars US at the time, dollars. back in 2014. And obviously it's huge, it's big, it's a bangle, and it's got a touch of red and white. No, no mention of Taipei, most likely heated, as much of this material has to be. I'm then gonna show you in the same year, at the same auction house, a much smaller piece, and the pre-sale estimate on it is double the price of the bangle. Wow. The pre-sale estimate. And the reason for that is there's more red. Yeah. It's entirely red. It's that russet color, red jadeite and diamond pendant necklace just on a, a, a standard cord. And US dollars now, 41 to $46,000 wow. to start you off. That is the pre-sale estimate. I'm going to offer you these magnificent opportunities today. You know, it is no stretch to say this is something that has been in the pipeline for three years. Working at getting you opportunities of this quality, of this rarity, of this size. And, and I know I talked about these being heated and I wanted to cover that, so I'm going to. Um, one of the other things that is happening right now in Greater China is remember these incredible mm. large tabletop sculptures. This used to be the way of the old masters. Yeah. They used to work on these for months and months, uh, huge boulders. Some of them are actually far larger than that. But the new wave of master carvers, the new contemporary carvers that are the new masters, well, they are leaning towards pieces like this. So this is the contemporary jade carving in China. And the trend is now towards jewelry and smaller carvings. Um, the official Chinese jade carving masters still dominate the high end of the market and continue to fetch extremely high prices for their work, which is generally, generally considered an investment. But they're now being challenged by a younger generation of artists who have less respect for tradition. And these new artists concentrate way more on the quality of the material. And they go online to find their customers. And you can see there's this red and white small tablet carving. They're very yeah. small, like a wearable pendant. And this is, this is you know, twofold, right? One of them is they want to set themselves apart from the old masters. The, the, the new wave of clientele want to wear these pieces. They don't mm. have big drawing rooms and palaces to put these huge four foot sculptures on. They want like this incredible wearable wealth. They're concentrating on the quality, so they're going for the red jades and the yellow jades. And on top of that, let's not forget, you can't get big boulders of jade anymore. No, so they have true. to work with smaller, incredible pieces that you know are, are matching the same value. And then again, I said to you, I talked to you about uh, and be completely open about this opportunity uh, for you today. I'm just going to borrow the clicker again. Sorry, Ross. So you go to Jade Art Atelier, independent body, um, and, and they talk about type A, type B, and type C. Well, type A, 
And they say, we consider this the only accepted form that jadeite should be. So type A natural jadeite means that the subject qualifies to be free of any form of chemical treatment. So type okay. A, the heat doesn't come into it. It's, is there a polymer? Is, is there, there a dye? Is mm -hmm. anything got suffused into the crystal structure Being of the added. jade? Yeah. So we, as with any jade, as part of the polishing process, they coat the jade in a colorless, colorless wax. And this is accepted so long as it does not damage the crystalline structure of the subject. And after that fine uh, polishing, the jadeite is dipped into heated wax in liquid form and then cooled down. So every jade is heated to a degree. Yeah. But what they're looking for is has it been impregnated? Yeah. Have they put anything in there? Like type B means chemically treated and resin infused. Type C, dyed colour. Is there anything artificial? So type B and type C, what happens with that jade? is it goes into a bleach for a prolonged period of time, okay. which completely draws all the impurities out of the jade. It turns it into like a husk, essentially, like a okay. carcass of jade. Okay. And then in type B, what they do is they inject the, the porous jade then, where it's all stripped out with a polymer. And with type C, they'll inject it with a dye. Okay. And so that's what they're looking for when they're looking to determine if it's type A. Remember, it should be free to qualify as type A. No mention of heat treatment. No. It has to be free of any form of chemical treatment. Okay. Um, and, and again, if I go to the, the Plum Club, they talk about pieces like we've got for you today. Oh, gosh, that's and so And they similar. say, look, when you heat this material, it will darken some, it will lighten some overly dark greens. And, and take a yellow staining and turn it to a deeper reddish color. So it uh. has to come from the skin. And this is the jadeite report. As I said, this is the GIA jadeite report. And on the right there, where it says treatment, it doesn't say not, you know, no heat treatment or whatever. It says it's natural color. There's no indication of impregnation. Okay. What they're always looking for is has it been impregnated, either yeah. with a polymer or a dye. So treated jade is when jadeite is impregnated and the chemical composition of the jade is altered or compromised. This includes impregnation of polymer or dye, or both, because both of these treatments require the jade to be soaked in bleach for long periods of time. Mm -hmm. So this, yes it is. By the, the, the standards of the GIA, by the standards of Jade Art Atelier, by the standards of the Plum Club, this is considered type A. I'm only removing that because I know it's been heat treated, and I know, forget what the market expects, I know what you expect. So with the market, we'd go, yeah, it's type A. It's, it's, it's not been polymer impregnated. It's not been dyed. It's not been soaked in bleach. There is nothing that has gone into the jade. It's just been heated. I want you to know, I've stood here and said, oh, type A means no form of treatment. So I'm only doing this by my standards. Yep. And I'm saying to you, yes, by anyone else's standards, this is type A. But I'm telling you, it has been a heat treated process that has gone on with this jade. Takes it from a lighter terracotta to a deeper red. It is still ultra rare and, and still you know, ridiculously valuable and we won't be able to get opportunities like this for you again. In the eyes of the market, this is Taipei Burmese red jade eye. I'm just extraordinarily open about it. There is three pieces. They are giant carrot weights. They are the craziest carvings you will ever yeah, see. Yeah, they really are. They really are. They, they, they're, they're red and white. They're not polymer. They're not dyed, they're not impregnated, they're not bleached. This is as good as wow. it gets for any collector. Masterpieces, translucent, top gem jadeite. Any, any one of you that is tuned in that is a serious collector, I would anticipate maybe, sorry about that. I'll no, you're now. all good. But I'm just I, I would anticipate that many of you are going to try and get all three. Um, absolutely try for that. But what I would recommend is you just, for, the one that speaks to you the most, make sure you don't miss out on it. All of them are hollow carved out. All of them have the piercing and the open work technique to, to view the carving underneath. All of them are, look like they've been painted, but they haven't. That is the, the most incredible natural jade that has come from the skin of jade art boulders. Probably some of these boulders will have been 60, 100, 150 years old. They have come from studios that have gone back generations. It's absolutely incredible, Dave. Mm -hmm. We could look, look, that shot there. You know, look at them. We could literally be in one of the finest well, auctions houses says, right says, now. I think so, and it says a lot. Where the first, the first instance you're you're getting to admire these, is in the studio. Yeah, that talks to the quality of this jade. You know, we, we could of course show you these in our incredible simulation recording. We could show you them in the daylight recording. We're showing you them in the the harshest and worst light conditions yeah, ever. Yeah, floodlights. Yeah, um, and this is how good they look. So I'm, I'm now going to give you a, a, a 30 second clock and we're going to make the first piece available. Remember, if we combined the quantity of all of these, of every single one, 
we don't have a, a standard quantity that we wow. would usually have for, for something that we bring to you. It's not a normal show. It's not a normal day. This is spectacular. Those two incredible, um, well, they, they are the, the phoenix. It's the Fueng and Hang, the Fueng Hang. Huh. Which is the, historically, it was the male and female bird. Over time, the Fueng and the Hang became the Fueng Hang, which is seen to be one mythical creature. But originally, a thousand years ago, it was two distinct creatures. They one faced east, one faced west, and together they face each other. Uh. So if you go back to like the 17th century, 18th century, you'll often you'll often find two of them, right? Like as bookends or whatever. Today we just uh, usually see one, and then the dragon becomes the masculine uh, version. Right. Okay. So it's the, the yin and yang, the male and female, the masculine and feminine. That level of detailing, David. I, I actually get... wish I wish for some auctions, for some moments, I genuinely wish we could do like price and application. Yeah. Like, you know, look, if you're interested, reach out yeah. to us and we'll have like a concierge uh, conversation with you that might take a few days. That's how this should be showcased. It shouldn't, like, I'm all for what we do here, but this mm. is ridiculous. It like, should be the opposite, shouldn't it? Yeah, it should it be should. climbing, yeah. Should, I don't mind showing it to you and introducing you to this material, but it should mm. be like, this is not normal. And, and if you want to reach out to us, then we have a concierge uh, service yeah. that we can speak to you on. You know, I'm just thinking out loud. It's like yeah. to 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 know where to put those that detailing, that artistry. Because you don't. Last thing you want to do is cut the red away. Oh god, yeah. Last thing you want to do is not polish it far enough so it I reveals mean, to, to the red. I mean, to pick out the red. Yeah. To pick out that color and make it a feature. To to yeah, essentially carve cool those two incredible birds and then the petals of the flower with this sensational raw material. That's is is a level of detail we we just don't ever get to see and the fact that it is effectively like hollow yeah 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 so you can see those holes along the side are where these incredible artists have gone in Into and managed the... to carve even beyond what you're seeing That's what amazing. you're seeing is is a window into a carving that exists behind it oh. That's absolutely incredible. Yes, it's 280 carats. Some of these pieces will be 300 carats. Yeah. Uh, 280 carats is the minimum carat weight. We always weigh the, the, the lightest one. They're all going to be individual. They're all going to be unique. This is the, the, the first piece we're going to bring to you. It's a tiny quantity. It's ridiculous. When you think about that one that sold for how how much was it? That bamboo style one that sold at auction in 2014? Oh, but well that, that, no, I don't even know. Pre sale estimate was 41,000. 41,000. For me, this is far more intricate. Oh, we far, know, the, yeah. the level of artistry is has skyrocketed. Yeah. There it is. There. The pre sale estimate on that was forty one to forty six thousand dollars, and that's like a decade ago, pretty yeah. much. Yeah. 2014. Well, it is a decade ago. Yeah. So. When the mine was operational. Yeah, when, when those incredible mines were producing. You cannot get the red material from Guatemala. Um, oh, this yeah. is. Oh, really? Uh, is that something that, that it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't we, change? We don't get it from, from Guatemala. It, it has only come from the skin of the boulders from Manmar. So right. the red is just not available in the marketplace. And anyone who does has it, does have it. Well, you know, they, they know it's irreplaceable. So yeah. the prices are sky high, as we're witnessing, even in the likes of the Western jewelry houses, like Asprey, mm. who have a, a piece of rough that they, they value at 18 million pounds. This is nearly 300 carats. I actually don't want to, I, I don't want I to I can give see you hesitating Yeah, because I just one. don't, look, we're never going to get anything like this again. We bring, we've bought you red jade, brought you yellow jade. We've never bought you anything of this caliber. Mm. Cheryl Ann, well done. Susan, well done. Michelle, well done. Gigi in California, well done. Hazel, well done. Anna in Derbyshire, well done. I've got a Wales in Hampshire uh, and Australian collectors. This is your stunning one-time opportunity. Huge carrot weight. Yeah, good luck, everyone. I mean, look at that. Okay, um, let me give you a 30 second clock. We, we have to begin somewhere. Um, reluctantly, I'll give you a start price on this and then we're going to give you the most incredible deal. I hope you're here for it. I, I hope that you've managed to get this. Quarter of the stock has already been allocated. Mm. Congratulations to you guys, truly. Um, there are many of you that will unbelievably be able to get the whole suite. That's it, amazing. Because of what we intend to do. What a legacy. A real legacy. And yeah. then just like, just consider, and this is what I was thinking when you were telling that story of the family yeah. that you discussed, like, oh, sadly, we only ever yeah. really actually see That's these right. if someone passes away. You know, your collection is probably as exciting oh, you know sure, 100%. where you've got these especially if you've managed to acquire 
um, a few red jade opportunities. Okay, do you know what? Can I? I'm going to start you off genuinely at about five thousand pounds, if I may. Mm. I know that to some of us we might go, oh my god, five thousand pounds. To others of us who exist in kind of the, the real world, we go, how on earth is this so affordable? Yeah. Genuinely, uh, you know we're not going to end up there. We're going to be nowhere near there, which is to me ludicrous. It's ridiculous that we're, we're going to entertain taking this lower. But we always look at the cost price. We always look at the deal that we managed to get over the line and we pass on those savings. That's why we have a million unique collectors, customers yeah. uh, around the world, across all of our uh, wonderful um, channels. Around the world and who are shopping with us today as well. Yeah. You know, it's, I mean, and I'm not surprised, Dave. But there you go, that's a red oh and white one. Oh my goodness. Uh, certified natural jade and jade. Again, this is on first dibs, 25,000 pounds. All right, we're 20,000 pounds lower than that. And we've got a three-dimensional yeah. carving. <laughs> Honestly. Just, the only thing I'll say to you is ask yourself this question. Regardless of the deals and the prices that we do, the savings we make, and, and how limited it is, do, do we think that we'll ever see an opportunity like this again? Because we're about to enter into our birthday mm. um, on our sister channel over at Gemporia. Very excited for it. In fact, we've got some wonderful collectors. Some of our uh, most uh, incredible customers are in the building today. And I'm going to go and show them, going to give them a heads up on some of the jade that I've got coming during the birthday. Do you know there isn't a single piece of red jade? Really? W not one single piece. Is there red jade in our museum? No, not right now. Not right now. So and that's a great point that you've made because maybe we do hold one of these back. Or, or one of each of these museum, back. For yeah. the museum, yeah. Because we do have an imperial piece of jade. I didn't think I'd in, seen in, it in, in there. In the building. It's not in the museum yet. We're building the exhibit. And I think we should have an imperial. I think we should have a lavender. I think we should have a yellow yeah. and a red all throughout. You know, in the colors case. of jade. Yeah. yeah. One incredible case. We do have the imperial jade. I think you've made a great point there. Um, for interest free split payments. If we, Ross was just saying in my ear then, he was like, if we had one at £5,000, mm -hmm. let's be honest, that'd be a great deal. Oh, I agree. 100%. Like, for instance, if you did, and many of you can, and it was something we're gearing back up for, we do museum tours here. Yeah. You guys can come in, see the studios behind the scenes, go and view our museum. Imagine if you walked in and we're giving you a tour of the museum and there was one epic, this piece here. You know, one of a kind or you know one last one in our case and you said I wonder if I could buy that mm. and we said you know what we'll do a crazy off the record deal you could take that it's like 300 carats it's red and white jade from mine it's mined out you, you, we'll do it for you for 5,000 pounds and we'll give you split payments on it yeah. you can take it home today whilst you're on the tour I think you know it, th would, th it, it would go yeah, it wouldn't be in the case it, anymore no I it's agree the reality I agree uh, obviously we're nowhere near done I, I did start the show by saying if you've seen all three of these laid out, you're going to be able to get all three. Shall I put them all next to one Yes, please, let's because do that. Because again, I mean, that's a, that is literally like a gallery, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. It's a gallery of red jade. Of masterpieces, yeah. There's the one wow. that's on your screens right now. And then these are the ones that are okay, also Okay, 30 second away. clock, uh, please, guys. We, we, we are wow. very busy, I get Look it. A lot that. of you are wow. calling for other pieces as well. Yeah, it's just outrageous. It's unbelievable. Um, yeah. We're already, at, uh, in my opinion, and look, it, it's only, my opinion is you know, null and void, really, but I get to go out into the real world. I, I've been working for other clients as well. And trying to, stick, if someone came to me and their, their remit was, I mean, this is here, so you're tuning in, but if you came to me off record and said, can you source me like a 300 carat red and white Burmese jade three-dimensional masterpiece? Mm. Yeah, I don't know. I'd have to ask you what your budget is. Yeah, uh, uh, like, you know, like that conversation you had yeah, before, and you're exactly. like, there is no budget. Yeah, well, yeah, very few people are going to have How that conversation. How many people can say that? I, the only person I've ever met that said that, <laughs> uh, where they literally said, we don't have a budget, which is insane. Um, Okay, I'll give you a 30 second clock. I've asked you to trust me. It is a very small quantity. It is one of a trio of gallery style carvings. That incredible uh, red and white jade. Let's go straight down to 999 from 5,000 pounds out. And I know you look shocked. Um, I'm just looking at that yes. on first dibs. Oh my God, yeah. And I'm looking at these and mm -hmm. I'm going, well, these are far more intricate yep. and bigger. Yep. That's 25 grand. Mm -hmm. You've just taken it to less than one. Yeah, look, I'm in uh, a really, really great mood today, okay? Which I am anyway when I'm here at Jewelry Maker, but I, I wanna let you know, 
on our sister channel, we've got some incredible showcases. Yeah. We're running what's called Priority Access. We're about to do some groundbreaking news later in the day. Okay. Like the biggest, the biggest news the gemstone world has ever heard. I'll tell you off air. Yeah, uh, but I'm intrigued. It's, uh, it's, gonna, it's never been done before, any jewelry house in the world. And that will be with us later on today. So I'm gonna do something equally as impressive. I'm gonna do something that shouldn't be happening. Something that has never happened before. I'm encouraging every collector um, that has ever been with us before, has ever shopped with us before, has ever saved with us before, who's building and amassing these incredible jade collections. We are going to deliver the most exceptional deals for our collectors today. Outrageous deals, um, massive carrot weights, unbelievable opportunities, third of the stock has gone. You need to be deciding now. I know we like to wait, I get it 100%. Mm. Uh, you trust us and you're like, I just wanna see the final price. I am gonna let you know, whatever you suppose, whatever you think we're about to do here, we're gonna better it. Yeah. It's going to be uh, a deal, uh, again, that is irreplaceable. We were aware of that, as I said. Uh, I've got um, some wonderful uh, collectors in. Um, and I'm gonna go and speak to them later on today and I'm gonna introduce our wonderful collectors at our sister channel to some of the jade opportunities that are gonna be delivered during the birthday, which includes some wonderful colors from Manmar. Uh, and obviously we've been working on it for over a year. But the one thing that is gonna be void, the one thing that will not be here for our birthday, unfortunately, even though I have tried, and it's, it's you know, I've proven unsuccessful, is a red jade. Like it's very difficult. We had a couple of opportunities uh, on the lead up to the mm. birthday, but they were very limited. But during the birthday, where we need the massive deals, where we need the big yeah, quantities, the biggest... we haven't been able to get it. Yeah. As you can see today, we, we don't have the opportunity to be able to deliver big quantities. If you want a multi buy, I'd suggest being in right now. I'm not gonna give you 30 seconds, I'm gonna give you 60 seconds, I'm gonna give you a minute, because we're about to destroy this price and show you how that we mean business, that you can get involved on all three when we make them available. It, it is on you if you are getting involved. There was only ever 30 of these available today. That means a third that of them has gone, and, and there is a lot more in baskets. A lot of you have already made your minds up. And just waiting, for that final price. This final price is going to shock you. This is a good point. You know, like Ross has just said, if you think about it, across the three oh carvings, God, yeah. Yeah. there was only ever 80. Yeah, when we usually, we bring you 200 yeah. or 150 of some of the previous carvings we've done. But right, the landscape has changed. But right now you're one of yeah. 30 people, at most, ever, yeah. who own this piece of art. Yeah. And that's precisely what it is. It's yeah, a it piece is. of it's art. It's a masterpiece. It really is. On the world's most valuable, the most elusive canvas. Yeah. You go into a gallery and if you want the real thing, yeah. there's one, isn't yeah, oh God, yeah. But they make prints of it. Mm -hmm. So people will have sort of copies sure. in effect. Yeah, yeah. Yours is literally a work one of, of art. One of one. Yours is one of one. Yeah. Yours is the masterpiece. Well done to Marion and Patricia and Cheryl Ann and Merseyside Susan, Michelle, California, Wales, uh, Southampton, Derbyshire. Yes, we're at 999, which I think at the start of this show was probably unbelievable. Ross, today, only because we've got all three, if we just had this one, uh, I wouldn't entertain this deal, but I do understand that many of you are gonna be trying to get all three. So we're trying to make it as affordable as we can. I want you, if we can, Ross, let's do it. Let's half the price. Let's go to 499 on what, 300 carats, 280 carats yeah, minimum. Some of these will be over 300, maybe closer to 350 carats. We are, we're gonna make it 499. You've got your, your four interest free split payments. We have two other masterpieces, two other huge, incredible carvings to bring to you. This is probably the most important jadeite deal we have offered to you here uh, by way of Jewelry Maker. I would, I would argue that. that, that natural, incredible red and white jade. Just that um, element of heat treatment, no polymer, no dye, not type B, not type C. Um, this is an outrageous opportunity, an incredible opportunity uh, that you can add to your collection. I know many of you have these huge, incredible collections. Half the stock's gone. Um, Wait, you know we were talking about that one at first dibs, Yeah, we were, yeah. And we're like, oh, it's 25 grand. Mm -hmm. Do you notice how I'm kind of rounding that down by 796 yes, yeah. pounds? Which is still less than what you've just For brought sure. this to. Yeah. Less than two pound per uh, carat. Uh, I'm fully aware of this. This is why I said I really do feel like I wish we had like a concierge service because I hate <laughs> yeah. doing this, like the falling price. I love what we do, I love what we stand for, but on pieces like this, this is outrageous. I don't know whether to do uh, a minute clock to close this one out or to do something crazy. I said I was in a really good mood today. I don't you know, know what I'm going to yeah, say. Yeah, right, Can I, let's show you the recording of this, because I'm going to go and speak. I see sales manager Wayne, and he's pulling his hair out. I'm going to go and speak to him uh, about this. very quiet, which is, is quite unnerving quiet. for Wayne, Pensive, isn't it? Yeah. 
It's very unnerving if, if Wayne goes quiet. Let me just show you something before I decide what okay. I'm about to do, if that's okay, guys. I'm gonna show you this. I haven't even brought my jade torch. Oh! <gasps> I'm bringing you it with a oh pen. Oh my line. goodness. This is, remember how thick this is. And there's three layers to go through. That's insane, Dave. Oh my God, this is the magic. And that's carved out of one piece of boulder. Yeah. I, I want you to understand, like to have the color is one thing. This is a pen light from Amazon. It's just a cheap light uh, and look. Yeah. But I want you to understand how gemmy this is. Look at how juicy it is. Look at how translucent it is. Uh, Collector in of West course. Sussex, can you please show the back of the jade? Of yes. Gladly, because it's literally solid red, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. It this is completely is mad what we do. Yeah. Or what you do, I should say. No, Dave. no, it's no, a massive no. team effort. Um, Hazel in Southampton says, Wow, Dave, every time I think you've reached the pinnacle of these jade carvings, you go one better. I've added all three to my collection. This is Amazing, it. Amazing, Hazel. Right, you know what? That's tipped me over the edge. Hazel. <laughs> no, no, but Hazel's like, You know what? I'm going to get all three. Yeah. So even with half the stock gone, I did say I wanted you to try, if you could, to get all three. And I know we have serious collectors tuned in. I said, like, I'm on the cusp of launching some crazy industry news later on today um, on our sister channel. Well, this is going to be, this might even overshadow it because we're about to make sure that people like Hazel can get this. At this point, usually I'd move on to the next one, do a minute clock to close. I think 20 of the 30 have already gone. But I'm actually going to take this lower. I'm actually going to take it a lot lower. So I apologize, Wayne. I'm going to give you a 30 second clock. Um, it is your time right now to multi-buy, to get involved. Uh, Wayne, I'm taking hundreds of pounds off. Hundreds. Um, I'm not just going to take a little bit off. I know we should probably do a minute clock to close. It might already sell out. I don't know. But Hazel messaged in saying, I've got one for all of my children. I've got one of each of these yeah, incredible cards. Yeah, Kay. Kay has messaged in. It was a stunning yeah. piece of jade, but the light going through it is amazing. It is, Completely yeah. agree. We shouldn't expect that. We shouldn't look for that. Not on red jade. It's just enough to have that color. But to have that gemmy, translucent absolutely. crystallization, it's absolutely it's magical. sensational. Right, this is it. Fastest of you can get this. I think there's 10 or 12 left, straight down. 299. And you know what we've done for 299. You know the pieces we bought you for 299. This is not one of them. It is one of 30 ever made. Yeah, it's that's gone. That's 1%? Yes, yes, that's right. Great of that maths. price, yeah. of that pendant, that's which right. I think this is more amazing than that, I personally. Um, I don't know how many we have left. It is a real struggle oh, to keep up goodness. with the balance. Seven left. I've got two other impressive carvings coming your way. This is going to have a knock-on effect. Justin, Patricia, Maker, Marlon, Marion, Patricia, Cheryl, Ann, Susan, Keith, Michelle, Gigi, Tina, Hazel, I see you there. Anna in Derbyshire, Jay, you're there. City of Bristol, Dorset, Greater Manchester, our wonderful Caroline, who's been collecting jade for longer than I've been alive. And this opportunity, a red jade out of this carrot weight, red and white, Burmese from the skin of these legendary jade art boulders. I've got five chances remaining. That's um, a pound per carrot. Okay. for the rarest yes. colour. Yes. Sorry, yeah. do you want me to stop talking? No, no, I love it. I love what we're doing. Like I said, I'm in an amazing, I'm in a great mood today. Uh, and I want to uh, bring you these opportunities. I want to be able to put them into all of your collections. I thank, I thank you for trusting us and saying, do you know what, I'm getting in ahead, I'm getting the other piece, I'm getting one of these or two of these, because we're gonna look after you, we're gonna do sensational, incredible, unmatched, unparalleled deals today. Translucent, bicolor, red and white jade, the material that we thought we'd never see, the material that you'd have to schedule, one minute clock to close now, we can do that, Ross. Um, you have to schedule an appointment at Asprey to go and view yeah, a piece yeah. of jade like this, and it's 18 million pounds and if an, you want it carved. And the last thing I think any of us should be thinking of is jewelry makers, we have what we call a stash. We a do. stash yeah. of gemstones. This is not a stash. No. This is a museum heirloom legacy piece. Yeah. This is treasure. This yeah. This is not even just a gemstone. Now, this is, for me, I consider this like a treasure trove. This 100%. Is a treasure chest of incredible bicolor jade. Um, in it's the eyes of the industry. Roadshow of the future. Oh, yeah. It's Antiques Roadshow now. Isn't it? I mean, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I agree. I completely agree. Um, we've got two chances remaining, 25 seconds on screen. I, I can't get more of these, so I've only got what I've got. It is a real struggle to understand how many have multiple, how many are actually available. Yeah. If you're calling for this piece or some of the other pieces in this show, this gets better and better and better. Just so everyone's Confident. aware, we should have stopped 200 pounds north of the price on your screen. Which would have been I amazing. I was tempted to just put the minute clock in, but then Hazel messaged and said, you know what, Dave? I've got one of each of these. 
So if you've done that, we've, we've just put, what, 200 pounds back in your account on this piece. And it's going to get even better with the other opportunities that I've got for you. Congratulations. Well done. Do speak to the contact center. See if there's one available. It's very difficult to us to have an up-to-date picture of what is currently available, especially with these masterpieces. Well done. Stay holding. Not, not for a second should you abandon your call. I know how frustrating it is. Um, you can use the app and the website. You can use the split payments. I know. I know. Like it's just going to get better and better oh, from here on out. Half the stock's gone. Half the stock's turned. gone. Look, people at Hazel, collectors at Hazel yes. have already got involved on this. Well done. Congratulations. There's little flowers that yeah. I love. Absolutely. And, and oh, they're wonderful the songbird as well. And you've got those unbelievable uh, um, windows into the carving behind. A uh, tiny quantity here. Like uh, much smaller than the previous piece. We are up at 300 carats, solid red here, as you can clearly see. And the level of crystallization is absolutely unbelievable. Wow. Painting with colors. It's one of those pieces you could just literally lose hours admiring. Oh God, yeah. And, and everyone who sees this is gonna ask you about it. Yeah. You know, the, the unbelievable rarity that is you know bicolor red and white jade oh my god look at the phone lines it's gone crazy yeah and, and, and look it does have a knock-on effect you know obviously i'm gonna have to deliver you an exceptional deal on this but east sussex you've got it at here you've got it in red mm. london wonderful hazel's got it anna in derbyshire's got it Gigi in california you've managed to get it this is uh, the the impressive artistry that we're getting up and close and personal with right now and obviously everyone will be unique everyone will oh god, yeah. uh, will be um of that amazing quality but everyone will be unique because this is a work of art yeah oh wow again we're going to show you with the torch oh through. there's 10 left dave okay apologies i'm going to do a crazy deal <gasps> even this. from a distance yeah oh my goodness me that's off the chart isn't it is. and what's amazing is as the red as we're viewing this through the light as the red mixes with the white it turns orange we've got multi buyers wow that's crazy Look at that. The amount of work that's gone into something like this. But 10 chances remaining. It's those flowers for me. I love those little flowers, every single petal. And yeah. the fact they almost layer on mm -hmm. top of one another. Um, okay, 30 second clock. Um, thank you for trusting me. Thank you for getting involved on, on these opportunities. This wow. is gonna get unbelievable. It, it, it it's been unbelievable. It was mm -hmm. unbelievable at the 999, let's yeah, be honest. Yeah. And again, you just took you just took the previous to like 1% of the price that, yes. that one on first dibs is. We, we saw the gemminess of, of these carvings. We saw the artistry on display. Yeah. We saw the glow. We saw the transparency. Um, as I said, this is very, very limited. I shouldn't do as much bigger carrot way. Extraordinarily detailed oh, yeah. in its carving, the translucency. Do you know what? Straight down, crazy deal. Oh. He's going to kill me. 299. 299 right now on this piece. This Live deal. It will never be this again. You know that. Should never be this piece. But collectors have managed to get involved on every single piece. And I want to help you as, as, as the best way that I can. Um, obviously, we have single figure stock remaining. Yeah. Make sure you are checking these out. Make sure you are multi buying if that appeals to you. If this design is the one that you want. Make, Alison, you've got it. Well done. Uh, Maker in West Sussex, Susan in East Sussex, Atia in Greater London, Gigi all the way from California. I know you've got both of these now. Uh, as has Hazel, has got both of these. I believe many of you actually, almost all of you, have managed to get both so could, of yeah. these. Yeah. Well, what a work of art. I For mean, sure. a collection, effectively. Mm -hmm. I remember, I'm thinking about going back to your Zodiac. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's a collection, isn't yeah, it, from I mean, the they same all artist? Match. They, they all showcase the same incredible colours, the same level of artistry, that wet look finish, that unbelievable detailed carving. Um, update, there is one left of the first oh one. Oh my God. Literally one. This yeah. one, I've eight got eight. Left. Eight chances remaining. Are you going to be checking out? Everyone along the bottom of the screen, you're successful, you can relax. Oh. Anyone uh, else right now, Someone's make just... sure 
you are there. Something's just dawned on me. If you're a collector, yeah. whatever it might be, I don't know, Bone China, mm -hmm. whatever it might yeah, be, sure. books, first edition books or something yeah. like that. Do you remember? And sometimes you see, oh, like, oh it's, it's worth this much. But if you had the collection. Yeah, if you had the suite, if you had the set, if you had the pair. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. You've got the trio here from the same carving family, from the same studio, the same level of jade. That's amazing. We've only got six chances remaining. Not everyone will be able to get involved on everything uh, because of how uh, oversubscribed we are, because of how busy we are. But make sure if this one speaks to you. I said to you, look, obviously try love and get that. all three if you can. But the one that speaks to you the most, the one that you fall in love with, make sure you are capitalizing it's on that very deal. Press your option one mm -hmm. key to get through to our wonderful call center. These are once in a lifetime opportunities, yeah, aren't they? Without a shadow of a doubt. Joanne, you can do it in Norfolk. Uh, you've just done it, actually. As I called out your name, you're there. You've, you've crossed over. Uh, Maker, you're there. Norfolk, you're there. Uh, four chances now. Unbelievable. Well done, everybody. Okay, we're doing a minute clock to close because I don't yeah. want to oversell it. I know there's a lot of interest in this piece. Mm. I know we're at a ridiculous price, uh, but we are you know, going to honor this deal, this price for the next, what, 50 seconds. Okay. 300 okay. carats. This red jadeite floral celebration, this masterpiece is epic. And a pound a carat. Yeah, well, don't. Let's not go there. But it is, you're right. It's a pound um, a carat. Dorothy's got it. Well done, congratulations. Yeah, amazing, there, there Dorothy. Are, even though we've got two left, even though we've got half a minute on this deal, there are people still being able to check these out, which is amazing. There's a bird well, in flight, there's flowers blooming. There is these moments that are carved through uh, the, this crystallized type A jade. That's unbelievable, isn't it? Absolutely, Absolutely unbelievable. And again, the layers, the fact you've got the... It's almost like a flower on top of a flower. You've got yep. hollow areas within there as well. That For sure. Just a, you can't even comprehend how no you way. go about creating something no. like this. Amazing jewelry makers. Congratulations. Congratulations. Well done. Take advantage of these deals because they sh quite literally shouldn't be happening now. I'll be honest, my favorite piece is coming up right now. Okay. This piece here. Oh, this which has been the most popular. Oh, it has. Yeah. Well, look, you guys have obviously seen what I'm seeing. So much intricate detailing taking place on the surface of this, you know, being carved through so intricately. And then that, that juxtaposition between the, 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 the red and the white, and there's a thread of green running through it as well. Um, this is, again, I'm gonna show you that transparency because it is truly as good as it gets. Oh gosh, that's Look at crazy. this. Oh, you're gonna be blown away. Oh, you've got the Imperial And this one. is, of course, the most popular. Oh, that's gorgeous. Wow. There are 30 available of these. That's amazing, Isn't Dave. It? It's absolutely incredible. Wow. And all of this is that three dimensional look, look, carving that goes through yeah, the Yeah, look the how layers. it lights up. Yeah, and here as well. These windows into a carving behind the, is the that the different color. depths of jade yeah, that you've I mean, got the, there to have something the this plays large, with the light but also something this fine where they can create these these wonderful as i said these kind of windows these intricate windows into the body of the jade yeah is absolutely sensational okay good luck to every single one of you good luck we're about to bring this live again 300 carats most of these will be over that um it has proved extreme. Same that's collectors amazing. again. There are same wonderful collectors who have managed wow. to get the entire suite. This is going to be epic. There's thirty. There is. There is thirty of these, which I believe is the biggest quantity so far. Um, mm. Which means we're going to deliver you uh, obviously an epic deal, even though we're dealing with the largest carat weight and the most intricate level of artistry and carving. Yeah. You've got the wonderful bird. You've got the flower. You've got those moments carved through it. Where, wherever you're calling from, whether you're joining us from Australia, North America, uh, the British Isles, Europe, this opportunity in any currency is going to be outrageous. And there is the, the glow, there is the translucency, there is this unique opportunity. It's that play of light though, yeah. Dave. I think it's because there's almost like a, um, layers of yes. jade. A third of the stock's gone, apologies. It is proving popular on pre-order. Um, we are going to do something crazy. It's the largest size in terms of millimeters, it's like six centimeters uh, across. Um, a third of the stock has gone. Okay, and you look at this, wow. and this is not me being disrespectful, but you look at this and then you look at the piece that we saw on first oh, dibs. Yeah, exactly. It's just, 
it's far There's finer. There's no compare, yeah. We're going to do something absolutely outrageous. I, I wish you the best of luck, genuinely. Um, Marion, you can do it. Uh, Cheryl Ann, you've just done it. I want you to understand that even though it feels um, you know, overwhelming, I know it feels really busy, you might be dialing into a queue, I would recommend using our app and our website. Yeah. There are genuine opportunities for you. Two thirds of the quantity are available. You can absolutely do this. There is no reason you need to miss out. We've gone to rock bottom pricing to allow you to get the whole suite, the, the, the complete trio. And some of you, you know, maybe don't want the full trio, but you're looking at this one going, okay, well, that many of you are looking at this you. one going, this is the one. Yeah. We're still gonna do the incredible deal. It's not that like you have to buy all three to get the crazy deals. We're going to deliver this for the crazy. It's the biggest carat weight, the biggest size, the most intricate and detailed carving. That. It's the penultimate carving of the whole show. And I'm gonna deliver you an unrivaled deal. Imagine that, Dave, as oh, a finished piece Imagine, of jewelry. Yeah, with a red jade strand. And then that conversation you had with the family, so yeah. I actually know that's yeah, the only that way. We, the only way we get hold of this is if, unfortunately, you know, maybe someone passes away yeah. and we get an estate collection, we have to pay the market price for it, which has changed over 10 times uh, what it once was. You know, my family was selling pieces like this for five, six thousand dollars in the 1980s, and I'm having to buy it back for 55 to 60 thousand dollars today. And you are picking this up for a ludicrous deal. Now, I'm, I'm going to give you a 30 second clock. Good luck. It has already started. Um, well done to all of our collectors that have trusted us. Unbelievable. Yeah, half the stock's gone now. Apologies for that. Um, I'm not surprised. Yeah. I'm not surprised. It speaks to a lot of people. Yeah, using the, the shades of the Yeah, yeah, yeah. The working jade. with the, 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 those wonderful raw colours of the jade eye. Not carving too much to cut away the red. Mm -hmm. Not too little, so nope. you don't see. Okay, the red. let me just remind you where we should be as a crazy closeout yeah. killer deal on jewelry maker. Can we just get a four nine nine? Yeah. Which, uh, Wayne sighs of relief. He's like, yes, please. It's Can we for once go to the right price? That's crazy. I mean, yeah. Remember, we started up at five thousand pounds on these opportunities. This is the largest. This is the, the we leave the best till last. This is the one with that intricate three-dimensional window carving through into the body of the jade. And this would be a, a killer, a crazy deal. Four interest-free split payments as well. I think every single one of us would be over the moon to own jade mm. this good 100%. for that price. This is Burmese jadeite jade. Bicolor, some of these will be tricolor. It's nearly six centimeters in size. It's absolutely wow. colossal. It's gonna be over 300 carats. That is the minimum. And I'm now going to give you a 30 second clock because we are unlocking, unlocking crazy deals today. Like we're going to, we are going to do it. Even on the one that we should never do it on, you've trusted us for a reason. Many of you have actually completed the full suite, all three of these, and I'm not going to let you down on the final hurdle. I'm going to say, you know what, even though we shouldn't, even though everything is telling me we shouldn't do this and we're an amazing deal and I'm over the moon for you and at 499 if you go and get these valued I'm sure you're going to be over the moon yourselves yeah you your 30 day money back guarantee I'm still going to do it because we said we was I've just it's just dawned on me you can get all three well you don't know yet for that oh you don't know yet um what are we going to do we're going to take 100 pounds off this piece because it is the largest one no we're going to go straight down take 200 quid off go 299 on this one as well um, so now you can say it. Yeah, you can get all three of these. I was being assumptive. No, no, that's fine. I, I hopefully, I, like, I think many of our collectors felt the same way because you've already uh, been all checking three for it that out. And I don't want to let you crash. down. Exactly. All three of them for the first Just to price call £24,796 yeah. pounds less than one carving on first That's right, dibs. absolutely. All three of these. And you can get all three. All from the same family, all from the same studio, all with the same level of detail. I mean, a bangle, standard, incredible yeah. jade bangle takes 10 hours. Each one of these that you're holding and showcasing to everyone takes days. I'm sure. As you can imagine. Yeah. Right, it is a piece of art. That's why you can't get hundreds of these. That's why we take what we can get. You know, okay, we'll take 12 of them. We'll take 20 of those. Uh, and they could have been being prepared for months and months and months. And we're bringing these opportunities. We're going to close out crazy deals today that we want you all to build your collections. Margaret, Patricia, Maker, Justin, Marion, Cheryl Ann, Atiyah, in Great London, Maker, Dorothy, Alison, Sheila, Make. These are successful collectors, by the way. Susan, Anna, Gigi, Hazel. Obviously, we've got collectors in the queue as well that currently aren't successful, but you can be. See if there is anything else available in the rest of the show that we brought to you. 
They have to be some Nine of the left. most pain- patient yeah, oh God, yeah. artists yeah. I imagine in the world. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, and the risks that they're taking yeah. involving this material. When you're dealing with what is now the most valuable of the Jadeites and the most elusive, like yeah. you're not going to get a second chance yeah. to, to carve them this That's daringly. Just you know, with small. those moments, those tiny moments that are clinging together, you know, these stencils essentially in the Jadeite. You gotta one. You gotta have fine, fine grade jade art, but you gotta have a real, real fine, skilled artist. It takes me it. back to the story of the Cullen and Diamond. You yeah, know, the gentleman yeah. that was uh, that, that was yeah, because yeah, he was because that pressure about yeah. pre- faceting the Cullen and Diamond. You can imagine. And you can imagine those pressures with red yeah. jade. Oh, for sure. Wow. One hundred percent. I'm gonna do a minute clock to close this one out. I've only got eight chances uh, yeah, remaining. That's I amazing. do have one final carving with you, and you know I always like to go out with a bang. It's going to be. A crazy, crazy deal. And um, we have a slightly bigger quantity, but do not lose out on these three masterpieces that we've got for you. That's wow. unbelievable, Dave. Yeah. As if we've got brought all three for less than a thousand pounds. Yeah, well, we shouldn't have. No. We absolutely shouldn't have. No. Like, to bring all three under two thousand pounds would have been special. Yeah. To bring all three at like fifteen hundred pounds would would, would be, be epic. Yeah, like hundreds and hundreds of carrots, nearly a thousand carrots of, of this red and white incredible jade eye. Uh, but you're right, under a thousand pounds today, and only today for um, all three of these. Bit of an update as well from uh, producer Ross is saying the first auction, the first piece, yep. there's one. Oh wow! Second, there's two. This uh, one, you've got three. Amazing. There you go. Perfect. Uh, a lot of you have completed the full suite. It's a familiar uh, list of names on the phone lines that have managed to get involved mm. on, on uh, securing all three, and we're thrilled for you. That was the intention today with the level of deals that we are making happen. Amazing. Make sure you're checking There's out our everybody. wonderful clip. Yeah, let's give a big wave to everybody upstairs. We're looking at some of our customers. So th- these, um, are, these are the collectors. I mean, you can't see them, but there's collectors <laughs> walking along the glass promenade now looking in. And I said, I'm going to go and see them in a moment's time and show them the jade that we've got coming uh, for the birthday. One of the things that they're going to hear firsthand is we don't have the red jade. We have some moments of lavender. We, we have uh, some of the other colors, but this epic, incredible material, oh unfortunately, goodness. is only available to you guys. Um, and I can see a few of them looking down now and they're opening the app, right? Because they're looking at these pieces um, <laughs> and they're like, oh no, okay, well, it's great to see the studios, but let's try and get involved. <laughs> yeah, they're bringing, is that Red Jade? Okay, this is my final deal with you. It's oh, gonna be a crazy deal. Oh my goodness. Um, we've got 50 quantity. And we, we con- consistently say, we constantly say, bigger the quantity, crazy crazier the deal and we're going to prove that staying on the red and white theme showcasing that incredible artistry that we're dealing with here you get to see something unbelievable caroline greater manchester says madness on price but grateful for perfect pieces for kids um after losing their dad on saturday i'm so sorry to hear that caroline oh um, bless yeah our thoughts go out to you well, um, darling, and, and, the, and the wider family as well um oh, bless you. yeah uh, apologies nothing can really um you know make that better but uh, you know i'm glad you're tuning in i'm glad that you're managing to get involved today um this piece here we're going to do a crazy deal on we're going to do a very very special deal Look on. At that. so you've got the rui symbol which literally translates that's the kind of upside down cloud you're seeing there with the swirls okay uh, on the left hand side of your screen that translates this as, part here no 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 over the, there you go. See, it's like an upside down. Oh cloud. yes, yeah. Um, that is the Rui symbol, and that translates as like as one wishes, or may all your wishes come true. Oh. And uh, right now, we're going to make all your wishes come true with the deal we're going to finish on. Always like to go out with a crazy, crazy deal. Full red, beautiful bicolor jade eye, supremely translucent. If I borrow it for one second, yeah, now, sure. We'll um, we're going to put the torch to well over a hundred carats, of course. That's um, beautiful. Oh, it's, yeah. it's, it's, it's it's that almost. Um, I've got the torch. Yeah. Wafer thin. Yeah. Well, you've got the. I forgot one here. I've got which. one. Ah. So you've got the wonderful dragon as well. Which, my God. Oh, look at that. There's the dragon's. Oh, I can see it's almost like it's coming from the clouds. Yeah. This That's is a unbelievable. Significant piece. You can see my finger through it. It's all translucent. Translucent. It yeah. Do you remember like some time ago, Dave, when you first introduced us to. To, to, to jade like this yeah. of this translucency where you literally were reading something through and it through it yeah it's that translucent and look i'll show you here look at <gasps> that all these moments these moments of, of red jade eye. that's gorgeous and still it's like red jade trapped in glass it's all incredible Burmese are they the pearls eye. that i can see yeah yeah these will be like the, the pearls of abundance 
which uh, you know celebrated in Chinese art where you'll see everywhere they have such meaning you've got the serpentine dragon that he's kind of hidden away in the jade emerging yeah, momentarily from moments and then the Rui symbol as well which translates as you know may all your wishes come true we're going to bring this body life. disappearing into yeah. the clouds yeah you can see him diving into the wow. transparency of this jade this is your deal this That's is incredible. incredible so here is the i'll show you there's the dragon's face yeah you see that yeah it's, it's very hard to see because of all the colors and everything else but um and, and when we put the light through it's very difficult to see because it is so transparent well because the tra the body almost sort of went inwards yeah. i kind of amazing yeah, that you well, can the, achieve the, that with something the story like of of the the um the dragon, the, the dragon in, in greater china is that it's so powerful that they say no mere mortal should be able to see the entire form of the dragon and survive uh -huh. to tell the tale that's why they're so long and so that's why they're always emerging from around mountains or in clouds or out of the waters that's why it's disappearing and re-emerging from the crystal object hazel you're in straight away you've got well, everything damn, today warren in hertfordshire you're there as well um i want to finish on one wild crazy deal in fact to show you how crazy let's start you off 50 of these, you'd be as fast as you can. Let's start you off at 299. We're, we're over 100 carats here, massively over 100 carats. This is um, going to be a spectacle. I always like really? to work with the bank. Yeah, we're, we're Year of the Dragon. Either. Year of the Dragon. Okay. We're at 299, four interest free split payments, um, over 100 carats, sensational levels of artistry. The, 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 the first dragon we brought to you this morning, you've got that wonderful pearl of abundance. You've got the whole story being told in the body of this jade. You've got the Rui symbol. You've got the transparency. It's yeah. like we're ticking every box and we're at 299. In fact, it's the story that uh, unfolds. Well, it's going to get even better. I'm going to go take 100 pounds off right now. We're going to 199. <laughs> okay. Still nowhere near done. Okay. Should be. Crazy still, but I like to go out with a bang. I said we're in a really good mood today i want to look after every single one of you many of you have managed to complete the whole collection and i'm gonna go out with a bang on this piece we're at 199 which to me tells me what was that 49 pounds on interest free split payments yes okay one minute warning for the rarest well, the only thing i'm gonna say I'm, I'm gonna give you the one minute warning right now before i absolutely destroy the price wait 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 you're it, going lower yeah yeah massively Not lower. 60 seconds nope. to close no 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 one minute warning in this minute Download the app if you haven't got it. Get the web page open. Dial the number. You're, you're going to want to stock up on these. That's how good it is. You're going to want to multi buy. We're talking about that level of artistry. We're talking about the buy color. We're talking about the red and the white. We're talking about the transparency. We're talking about the dragon in the year of the dragon. And in 30 seconds, I, I think we're going to shock even our, uh, our most loyal collectors that have been with us for many incredible Jade shows. You know, if you were to read your favourite book and every time you, you turn a page, like a great book, it's yeah. like, oh gosh, you learn more. That's what this carving's about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you've it unfolds. Oh, for sure, yeah. As you 100%. admire it. You know, the, the first things that strike you um, and then, you know, as you start to understand it, you start to view it, you start to, you know, Change find it. more meaning within your piece. Yeah. And then it will gain more meaning, you know, with the sentimental meaning, uh, with it being a part of your life. Yeah, let's do it. I always like to go at the crazy deal straight down. Yours today, 149. Yeah. I was like looking into the gallery like, can he do that? Because is he allowed actually, to do it, that? It's making me nervous how quiet Wayne is. I know. I've never seen him this quiet. No. I've never seen him this quiet. making me nervous. I know he's got a, a problem with his ears. Hopefully he just can't hear what's being let's said. Let's hope. Yeah, let's hope. That's it doesn't help that the price is on the screen. The he's got cotton wool stuffed in his ears, but we need <laughs> we need like a blindfold on him. because we, It's <laughs> one thing saying it. We're putting the price on the screen um so Jagan. this is this is your chance one for 37 pounds on interest-free split payments please Absolutely if you if you crazy. can multi-buy because deals like this shouldn't be happening uh, i've got joanne and denise and warren uh, and catherine in bristol we've got allison there catherine's got two now wow, hazel amazing, you're there we, we are doing and delivering incredible deals today again, and we'd love for you all to be a part framed of it. in yeah. red ridiculous literally framed in yeah. that beautiful red mm -hmm. The level of skill on show here will become apparent when you get it home, when you study it, when you hold it, when you look at it. Um, 37 pounds and 25 pence. Unbelievable. Well done, guys. I, I, like I said, it, for me, it's like it's like your favorite novel. Yes. You know, it just literally unfolds Absolutely. more and more and more. You look at it. 
Absolutely. This is the never-ending story, isn't it? Oh, it, you know, but it is. Right. If you've got it in your collection, it's a story that it's a book you don't Iconic. have to close. You get to have it uh, yeah. for forever. You get to pass it down through generations. Falcor, the dragon. Falcor, yeah, absolutely. Falcor, your luck yeah. dragon. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, um, Paul, you're there. Jay, you're there. Mark, you're there. Joanne, Denise. We, we, this is really happening. Uh, we are down rock bottom, 149, 37 pounds, under 40 pounds on your interest-free split payments. I did say, if you can, multi-buy. We're not gonna cap it. We're not gonna say, oh no, you can only buy one. No, it is true. up to you what you wanna do. I've already got collectors multi-buying. The same opportunity extends to anyone that's tuned in, whether you are just a, a collector or indeed you have your own store or you're a trader. It, well, Dave, I mean, I'm going back to the story that you, your experiences, they're not stories, they're your experiences. Yeah, yeah. You know, when you were speaking to that family in in, East, in, yeah. in Vegas. Oh, right, yeah. Where the they family, were yeah. saying, yeah, the only time we ever get to purchase Red Yeah, I mean, Red we've Jay. seen that clip of film. You guys have seen it. Yeah, but they literally I remember. Say, um, you know, the, the only way we get hold of this is if, unfortunately, a family passes away, they bring us the old yeah. Red Jade and uh, they're, they're small pieces. And we, we have to pay today's market value from that can be 55, 60, 70 thousand dollars. Yeah. Piece is not too dissimilar to what we're opening up to you right now. Wow. Congratulations to anyone that got involved. Now I'm just going to casually oh slide these on in there. What the hell? Because these are coming up, Dave. Oh my word. You After guys are a in very for short a spoil break. right now. You're going to get spoiled. Look. You can see they've got yellow jade, red jade strands. If you've got your carvings, you're gonna to wanna to get involved on this. The one thing rarer oh than a carving, God. the one thing rarer than a bangle, as all of you know, is a matched strand. And to get it in the two rarest colors, well, wow. why would you be anywhere else? You, you have to stay tuned. You have to be quick. You have to be checking out. We are all aware how busy it is right now. Um, I'm gonna love you and leave you. Thank you uh, so much for having me, Elle. I'm gonna join you for my birthday show on, on Saturday, which I'm very excited about. Your uh, birthday? Yeah, my birthday show oh, on Saturday. Me. Yeah, oh, there you go then. We get to I'm celebrate with you together. On right. Very excited. It's going to be special. Remember a bottle I've of wine never today. done, never done a birthday showcase before, but I'm, I'm thrilled to be able to uh, bring you on uh, today. So very ex oh. uh, on Saturday. So very excited for that. Um, but thank you so much for having oh, me out and the you, team. Oh, thank you, Dave. And um, yeah, get involved on those strands. I'll see you all very soon. Wow. Just when you think he, he's, he's, he's peaked. He brings you better and better and better, finer and finer, more mind-blowing carvings. The strands, which are extremely limited, are coming your way, jewellery makers, that work in perfect harmony alongside Dave's magnificent carvings. So do not go anywhere. I've been teasing you with these strands throughout the course of the morning. Uh, make sure you're checking out your baskets on each and every single one of those magnificent works of art that they truly, truly are. And don't go anywhere. Join me after this. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewellery Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion or just a way to say thank you, the Jewellery Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Are you new to Jewellery Maker? Well, we want to help you on your jewellery making journey. When you purchase with us for the first time, you'll receive the Jewellery Maker Handbook, which is filled with 35 different techniques, as well as lots of hints and tips to help you on your way. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Here at Jewellery Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? 
then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewelry making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8 a.m. until 1 p.m. And you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewelry Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion or just a way to say thank you, the Jewelry Maker gift card is the perfect answer. A moment to compose ourselves. Because <laughs> we're going to get all under, hot under the collar again. These strands are absolutely exceptional. As with all gemstones, whether you're talking jade, whether you're talking ruby, sapphire, whatever it might be, colour is key, of course, but it's not the only thing. Of course, you're talking about translucency. But certain colours, um, and I'll use as an example, Pink is the rarest colour diamond. Certain colours are rarer than others. The two strands, matte strands, as Dave just said, are the rarest colours of all. And that's not just my words, it's not just Dave's words. One of the reasons why our team travel as extensively as they do, like Dave's off to India, I think, in the next couple of weeks, is so that you can get the most valuable information that we can then relay to you had we not have made uh, had we not made that trip to uh, tucson a few years ago we wouldn't have had the conversation with roland slusel wouldn't have had the opportunity to meet him and roland slusel just so you know is is like a guru of jade he's so incredibly qualified more qualified than quite possibly anyone to contribute to some of the most um, informative jade books. I'll show you a photograph of Roland Schlussel and Dave and this was taken a couple of years ago at Tucson in his booth which actually surprised me that his booth wasn't as was was wasn't bigger 
because you've got some and bear in mind they still cost thousands upon thousands upon thousands of pounds you know that is incredibly expensive real estate if you like for want of a better description and it'll be booked years and years in advance and you've got to remember that was on the back of covid as well but Co um Roland Schlussel bought all of his jade to that location. But if you actually look just over Dave's shoulder, you see very little, very, I'm not saying none, but very little yellow and very little red. And that is because, his words, the price of type A jade I is right now at an all-time high. We know that. that. This conversation happened pre the Burmese mine closing, but actually it was only a, a year or so away, wasn't it? Particularly difficult for us to source um, is the sourcing of the skin, sorry. This is the fancy colours of jade, the lavenders and the reds. Uh, when we say reds, yellows and reds is under the same umbrella. These prized colours are so rare because this is the skin of the boulder as it oxidises, if it oxidises. I don't want you to think it's a guarantee. This is why you never get solid red colour sculptures or jewellery. The skin is so thin comparatively and the boulders aren't coming out into the current market. The book that you can see Roland holding there is a book that he contributed to. Both him and his wife um, are probably some of the most qualified jade experts in the world. He goes on to actually say, these colours have turned the industry on its head. The demand supply is a real issue and as such we are seeing some of the highest prices for this material and still dealers are reluctant to sell because it's simply irreplaceable. We are finding it easier to provide imperial green to our clients and at a more affordable price tag for the first time. That's huge. And that, by the way, was two years ago before the Burmese mine closed, imperial green is more accessible than red and yellow, which is, I'm going to start with uh, the yellow. Remember as well, going to another incredibly qualified individual, Stanley, Stanley Chu, who, uh, whose family have Ilya, um, which only, they only sell jade jewellery and the finest quality. Now, Stanley Chu's family were originally wholesalers. They originally used to supply, you know, the big jewellery shops with the finest quality jades, more obviously in the, uh, in the East. Um, but obviously with the closure of the Burmese mine, Stanley and his family realised, okay, well, we're not going to be able to actually, we're not going to be able to restock. So what we have is what we have. Now, what do we do? Do we close shop? Do we say, okay, that's us done? Do we, do we go into another gemstone like uh, Roland Schlussel did? He's gone in more into your tourmalines and your spinels. Or do we say, shut the wholesale shop and let's open our own high-end jewellers and sell the jade jewellery that we actually have? That's precisely what his family have done. So again, that's multi-generations. Now, it's Stanley's words that actually said, the only thing more valuable than a bangle and some of the finest carvings is a matched strand. You have the most beautiful matched color, translucency, quality strands in both the red and also in the yellow. Now, the reality is I'm never gonna be able to sit here and go, oh, we've got 300 those days. I don't think we're ever here in actual fact. We could, we've brought you big quantity auctions of say, your apple greens um, and possibly some of the whites when we first started in, our, um, in the world of jade. But these days we can't say, we, I don't think we've ever been able to say that with yellow and we've never been able to say it with red. I know that Wayne, if I don't know if he's still in the, in the gallery, has he gone? The amount of times, every time we have this conversation about red and yellow, he says it's irreplaceable. These are the prices. And he'll get his phone up, he'll show us his, his spreadsheet and the communications from the de various different suppliers that he speaks to on the off chance that they might have something like this. And he's like, this was the last communication or last offering I had potentially of maybe a, um, a yellow or red or whatever, and this is the price it is per carat. I, I agree and I understand why he's so passionate about sort of conveying that message to you all because they are irreplaceable. We've got 11 of your yellow. 
Let's go to Stanley. And here he is, very smart gentleman, studied at Harvard, so very educated as well. The only thing more valuable than a bangle is a match strand. This is the most expensive jewellery in the world. We have sold type A jade strands for over 10 million US dollars. A matched strand. And he's holding one of those. And you know how expensive bangles are. I'm going to show you the most perfect and the longest strand of yellow jade as well. Because I remember us first introducing these fancy colours and it was what, about three years ago, maybe, maybe, give or take. I remember us first introducing yellow jade and red jade and we were like, oh my goodness, we've got those colours. The colours that, you know, you could only dream of actually owning. And there was like a couple of little individual beads. Do you remember? There was maybe three or four or possibly five, depending on the size and the carat weight. Do you remember those? Then it progressed and we had strands of about that length. And then I think they went to something like 20 centimetres. But that was the biggest that we had. We did have 38 centimetres, but they were more of a honey brown colour. You are getting full 38 centimetres of yellow jadeite. Now, if you were with us at night, uh, sorry, 10 o'clock, you'd have heard everything that Dave said about the treatment. I need to emphasize, this is type A, it's just type A is basically void of any uh, um, chemical. So it hasn't got any polymer, it hasn't got any resin. Um, heat treatment is literally the same thing as what the sun can do. So for example, many gem labs, don't call heat treatment a treatment because technically it's 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 replicating what mother nature can achieve it's you can take a tanzanite which are all heat treated and you can bury it in the foot of mount kilimanjaro just on the surface maybe um under the heat of the african sun and it will do exactly the same thing as it would as a heat treatment in a gem lab Heat treatment, in the world of jade, technically all gemstones, really. It depends who, what conversations, which, which gemologist you're talking to. Most will say, it doesn't make any difference. You're not, you're not injecting it. You're not filling it. You're not, you're not dyeing it. It's, it's literally heating it up, I suppose. Um, and it was really interesting to actually hear sort of all that information you know, particularly where Dave was saying type A means this, type B means this, type C means that. It's not dyed, which is type C. It's not polymer impregnated, which is type B. It's natural. Yes, it's had a little bit of heat treatment. Sometimes, you know what, jewellery makers, our transparency can cause us problems. And what I mean that is because we have to explain absolutely everything there. Most gem labs literally do not call particularly your jade labs, tree treatment, anything. In fact, all do. We've got 11 of these available. Look at the quality of the matching. I want to go back to what Stanley was saying. A match strand is the most expensive jewellery in the world. He doesn't even just talk about jades there, does he? He's like the most expensive jewellery in the world. A match strand, the most expensive jewellery in the world. Do you want to know how many I've got for you today? I haven't got 50. I haven't got 30. I've got 11. <clears throat> Ross has just asked the question to Wayne. Are we getting any more yellow and red? He says he's working on it. At a minimum, it's going to be next year. What kind of prices? Oh, we don't know. They're going to be much higher. Well, yeah, you'd imagine it to be. You've got to remember, the, 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 as time progresses, the further away from the mine's closure. So you'd expect it to be at a higher price, wouldn't you? I don't want to make assumptions. It all depends on the deal that Wayne makes, but that's what I would think logically. We are about to open this auction. Some of the finest. I've been showing you this all morning, jewellery makers, haven't I? I've got 11 in the world. 
This is the last 11 for 2024. We are not, we cannot replace it. Good luck. The auction is live. Good luck, everyone. Five millimeter. They are perfect sunshine yellows as well. Um, in your beautiful jade. I just, a bit of heat treatment, but actually it's not, you're not adding any um, chemicals or artificial polymers to the actual gemstone itself replicating what mother nature does with the sun herself straight away hello to our collector in durham who secured theirs you're not alone though you've got northamptonshire there um and i've got people on the phone and so i can't see your names as of yet it's not just a tiny parcel of three or five or a 20 centimeter strand it's one of the only 38 centimeter strands that we've ever brought to you here at jewelry maker and most likely will be one of the only strands that we ever do bring to you as well certainly a 2024 this is the finale i've got 11 available patricia you've just got yours well done well done um taking us immediately into single figures i only had 11 i only had 11 remember never mind what sort of i say or any of us actually say here some gentleman that is far more qualified than well two gentlemen that are far more qualified um than i am would be stanley chu uh stanley chu who's obviously lived it uh, live jade now owns Ilya um in the east one of the most uh, um pivotal jade jewelers in the world and he says the only thing more valuable than the bangle is a match strand and um, this is the most expensive uh, jewelry in the world we have sold type a jade strands for over 10 million us dollars i don't know about you but i think that is most definitely matched to perfection then let's have a little look at stanley uh, sorry not stanley roland schlussel roland schlussel who says literally the fancy colors um reds and yellows they are so rare because they only occur as the boulder actually oxidizes he's more able to supply imperial green than he is actually the yellows and the reds because it is astonishingly rare and he believes it will overtake the price as well of imperial green jadeite gail well done northamptonshire london i haven't even touched that price yet and already almost half the stock's gone big collectors getting involved sally well done let's get the wheels in motion the reality is for what you're getting I'm not going to sit here and say £5,000 isn't a lot of money. Of course it is. And at Jewelry Maker, I don't think we've ever done a £5,000 auction. We've done those big one-of-a-kind jade carvings. Oh, yes, we have, yeah. Those but one-of-a-kind jade carvings. We've got 11 available opportunities. And we are not stopping at five thousand pounds the next price is not your closing price four hundred and ninety nine pounds for a full 38 centimeter strand you go to mason and k mason and k it's jade and jade only that they sell you try and find yellow jade on their website. I'm not saying they don't have it. They do, but they're tiny, tiny pieces occasionally. And they're the expensive pieces that they actually stock. And they're irreplaceable. We're good friends with Mason and Kay. You know, they're fantastic at what they do. And they bring some of the most amazing, uh, amazing deals to their audience. But they're usually one of a kind pieces, especially if they've got colors like reds and yellows. There you go. This is Mason K. This is off Instagram. I think I literally screenshotted this, uh, Roscoe, some time ago. Look, you can see maybe three yellow, most likely heat treated as well, yellow jadeites. Three. Reds, Mason K. Two individual beads. This is, you know, they're very selective about these rare colours. Two little orangey red ones there. They're probably about, I don't know, three mil maybe. Here we go. Look at this. This is the front cover of one of their catalogues. I can see one yellow. One on the ring. 
itself. That's the rarity of yellow jadeite. We could stop here, couldn't we, at £499. And we could also stop... Wait a minute, Ross. You've just gone a whole hundred pounds less than I thought where you were going to next. I thought 299 was your price. This is the best we've had, right? At the beginning of the show, when I first saw this, and I said it on air as well, throughout the 8 o'clock, the 9 o'clock hour, and the 10 o'clock hour, this is the finest yellow jade I've seen. You know, because I, I love all the different colours. Hand on heart, I believe this is the finest yellow grade. Because look, sometimes, look at this, yeah, yeah, yeah. This, I was following, I was following Mason and Kay whilst I was at Tucson, by the way. Or I thought, no, this was after, actually whilst the team were at Tucson in 2023. Um, and if you look, 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 I screenshotted that. This is something they were putting on this story to get people saying, look, we're at the AGTA Gem Fair. That's basically a building in Tucson. Um, 23, booth number 1,200. And they're showing pieces like this. Look how many, how many, how many pieces of yellow jade are on those? And they were thousands, by the way, thousands upon thousands of pounds. Thirty seconds, and we're going even lower. And this is a better quality of colour. It's a better quality of colour. It's the yellowest yellow. Sorry to say something really obvious, but it is, isn't it? There's no suggestions of brown in there. It's not darkening the colour. It is literally buttercup yellow. And we go even lower in a full 38 centimetre strand. Remember Roland's words. Rele remember Stanley's words. Remember when jewellery maker used to bring you little parcels of three, four or five. And then it went to a 20 centimetre strand. You're getting 38 centimetres. And there were only 11. That's crazy. That's actually ridiculous. No, it makes no sense whatsoever. We only, by the way, in the beginning we had 50 on launch, on the original launch. I'm, I've brought you, the first of this month, I've brought you the last remaining 11 today. Thank you, thank you. Uh, Ross is just saying, and I got those last 11 so that you would actually see it, Al. Um, yeah, because if I, if I hadn't seen it today, then it would have sold out and I'd, yeah, it, I would have missed out on the the finest yellow. It's beautiful. Buttercup yellow is how I would describe it. It's not orangey. It's not sort of more terracotta yellow. It is a definite buttercup yellow. Um, there are a few of you with it in, um, on the phone lines. I don't want to panic you, but I've got three left. Please do not abandon the call. So if you're holding on the phone line, stay where you are. Sarah, I can see you. Maker, I can see you. Um, Cardiff's there. Cheshire's there. Mark's there. Uh, Nottinghamshire. And I've got Diane there as well. Please do not abandon the, your calls. I promise you our amazing call centre team will get you as soon as they possibly can. As long as you've pressed your option one. As long as you have pressed your option one, our call centre will get to you. Um, the finest yellow. And, and, and I've been lucky enough to see this beautiful colour or shades of this beautiful colour. Nothing quite like this, though. The final three opportunities. Good luck to each and every single one of you. The red jade is coming up immediately after this opportunity as well. I've got two of them left. You can get it home for £32.25 today. That is crazy, isn't it? Should we show it up to the neckline? Ah, as a Tazza walks in the studio, she's eyeing up the jade, isn't she? I am. <laughs> Look at that. How beautiful that colour is. That's stunning. It's amazing, isn't it? The last one. Last one available. Who's going to get the last one? Don't leave it in your baskets. And then that's it. Yellow jade out for 2024. Done. Done. And it's not a guarantee we'll have it in 2025. Isn't it mad we're about to enter into 2025? Sorry, I still think about the year 2000, like a couple, couple of years ago. 10 years ago, that was 2000, right? Yeah, it's mad, isn't it? Mad. Well done. Okay. Next up. Roscoe. Have you seen this red though? Oh, it's so translucent. It's outrageously translucent. Can I get a torch behind this? Oh, I was teasing you all with the carvings earlier on. I don't know if this is the right torch or even if there's a battery in it. No. 
there is, but that's too bright. Hang on. This one's... There we go. Gosh, it's really bright, this torch. So I'm not going to put it in your... Can you see that translucency? Wow. Look at that colour. Beautiful, exceptional translucency. Remember, in the jade world, we're not just talking about colour, we're talking about translucency. And the words of Stanley Chu, the most expensive jewellery in the world is a matched strand. Irreplaceable. How many do we have? 22 available opportunities, jewellery makers. That's it. You can bet your bottom dollar there's more than 22 people watching right now. If you saw me kind of teasing you with this amazing strand um, uh, during the carvings auction opportunity, and you're thinking, yeah, that's perfection. Just with those gorgeous carvings, whether it be the dragon, whether it be the flowers, whether it be uh, the birds, whichever, um, and you wanted to literally knot those pieces together, then this is just crying out for you to do so. I remember probably going back about sort of three years or so um, when what we entered into what I, I always refer to as jade fever, where we were fortunate enough to all, all of a sudden gain those wonderful relationships that stretch sort of all across the globe effectively that gained us all access as collectors to, to the world's most sought after gemstones and it was that moment in time really that became quite a pivotal point for us but do you remember when we first started introducing your red jades and they were literally little individual parcels you were lucky you were fortunate enough to maybe get four maybe get five especially in the rarest colors of all the rarest colors the color that only occurs if and it is an if because it's not always a guarantee if the boulder oxidizes you're getting a full strand not just the one a full 38 centimeter strand the mine closed in 2020 four years on jewelry maker and gem pour is a partnership still bring you the rarest colors but Let's not be complacent and think this is a guarantee that's going to last a lifetime because we absolutely know it's not going to. First price crash at £499. First. I've got 22. 22 available. I'd love to be able to say, oh, jewelry makers, I've got 200. It's amazing. We've got 200 available opportunities. 22. Out of those photographs that we showed of Mason and Kay, how many reds did they have? How many, how many reds do you see over Dave's shoulder there? I can see some yellows, I can see some oranges, I can see some beautiful imperial greens, I can see some lavenders and black. I actually don't see a single red, do you? You're getting a full 38 centimetre match strand. That's unbelievable, isn't it? And we're not stopping here. Your next price crash. Next. Did you mean to say next? Next price crash. It, the six millimeter full 38 centimeter strand that I put probably one of the brightest light sources that honestly every time I turn that torch on it hurts my eyes it's that bright so if it was opaque if it was completely void of translucency um I think I think even even that would struggle but did you see how they literally lit up literally glowed 199 pounds and that's one of your that's a next price crash still not done if your budget allows wouldn't this be amazing with the yellow that we had just previously if you got any of the carvings that dave launched um in the 10 o'clock hour wouldn't this be be absolutely beautiful you've got your 0 percent interest split payment there as well jewelry makers are you ready the last carving that dave brought to you i can't remember what it was Oh, I do. Wait, so I can make this piece of jewellery for less than, less than £300? 
With that, you saw, you said, mentioned that dragon, Ellie. You've, you had that dragon, didn't you? I actually might have two of them. Oh, really? Casual? Yeah. <laughs> well, because they're, the part at the bottom is also like the phoenix as well. So my son is called Phoenix. So I oh, basically you needed it then. I basically bought them and let him choose which one he wants. Not now, because he's five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, <laughs> but I'm like, this an, is yours, but this is something for you for when you're older. Yeah. yeah, as an heirloom. Yeah. And that's precisely what they are. You know, I think opportunities like this can, I always think in my head, you know, fast forward 10 years, and it, I, I could say 10 years, I could say next year, but fast forward 10 years, when we look at, because uh, I think then it will really resonate with us all. When we look back on opportunities like this and we think, okay, um, hang on a second, we used to do red jade. We used to do natural jade, which basically is what heat treated jade is referred to. It's, it's, type, it's type A jade. It's not, hasn't got polymer, hasn't got any dyeing in there, no chemicals as such. So anyway, we used to do that. And we used to bring it to air for £149, which is complete and utter madness. We know it's madness, but in future years, it's going to become definition of insanity. We've got a full matte strand, you know, and we don't... The thing is, we have all this information from some of the most knowledgeable individual in the jade industry, Stanley Chu, Sally uh, Hewer, Ronan Schlussel, to name just a few. What, you don't stop there? Today, on the back of what has been an amazing showcase, hasn't it? It's been amazing. I, I had 22. Today, and only today, we're gonna get this under 100 pounds. Today and only today. The same conversation, Ross, that we've had with Wayne about the red jade, does that apply? So we're not getting any more red jade for 2024? He said uh, there are conversations for 2025, but it is going to be at least 2025 and I can't guarantee the price of it because we know how the industry is working. Do you remember, there's a book just to my, um, to my left on our shelf called Secrets of the Gem Trade. Can you pass it to me, Michael? That's written by Richard Wise. When I was doing my GAA, that one there, just a big brown one, perfect. When I was doing my GIA accredit uh, um, accreditation qualification, so this, um, <laughs> this is an old tatty book here. Richard Wise, Steve gave us a copy of this book and he said, read it and read it again. In these pages, I'm not even gonna attempt to find it. it it actually says, if you see a gemstone that you love and you can afford it, get it straight away because chances are it goes up in price. I don't want to say that definitely. I'm not, I, can't, I haven't got a crystal ball. But if you see a gemstone that you love and you can afford it, get it. Very few gemstones decrease in value, especially when they're as rare, thank you, as your type A jadeite. Can you believe today? We know we're not buying any more. We've, t we've said out loud, we're not buying any more 2024, there you go. We can put the price up. Matt Strand to perfection. 99 pounds and 99 pence. Cast your mind back as well, never mind comparing outside these four walls or a pillar of st and stone where I see absolutely no red, none whatsoever. We used to bring individual parcels, fours and fives, didn't we? At not far off this price, Roscoe, didn't we? So we could get at the time and we were happy and that's amazing. It was kind of our foot in the door to the world of the, uh, the, the, the rarest colours of jade. Michelle, well done. Sally, well done. Maker, Nottinghamshire, Lynn in Highlands, Mark in Cheshire, Edith in Angus. London's there as well. I've got telephone callers on the phone as I can't yet see your names. I only had 22 opportunities. You've basically got a third off what was already an absolutely astonishing price tag. Today, you can get hot. And I think, and I, the reason why I'm saying only today is I don't think it's going to see another show. And that tells me it's not going to see... You're not going to see red jade out for the rest of the year. In my head. In my head. If we're not buying any more in 2024, what we've got is what we've got. You might see the odd drip and drab, but we haven't got anything of big quantities. How often do we do red jade like showcases? Other than today, very, very, very seldom. Um, make sure you're checking out your baskets, everybody. I'm going to put the yet. We put. Yep. Yeah. What's that? Under 100 pounds. You know when you just say you hear it and it still doesn't quite resonate because it doesn't seem right? Under £100. So I can get both of these for two, £229. That's insane. 
put one of those carvings because it had areas of yellows within there as well mm. put one of those carvings and suspend it from this as a long line necklace talk about <clears throat> talk about legacy jewelry shall we add to the rarity shall we sign me up for this trio <laughs> Look at those. Come on, stay there. Imagine, what's the date today? 18th of <coughs> September, 2024. What were you doing on that day? Oh, I was buying three of the rarest colours of jadeite in the world. You know, red and yellows, but also the colour that only achieves that colour because it's three times older than any other colour of jade. And the only way, you can't heat treat black jadeite to achieve black. Mm. You can dye it for sure, this isn't dyed. The only way of achieving black jade is time. And by the way, that's millions of years. The new multiple millions multiple millions multiple, wow. multiple millions of years it's transitioned through the different colors of your jade so once upon technically black jade is not black it's actually a very dark inky inky green color mm. so once upon a time this may well have been imperial green um and like i said over millions of years it, it has achieved that amazing color now you could be making pieces like oh wow Where'd you get that from? It's mine. That's yours? Yeah. Where have you got that from? Well, over time, like working here, I'm able to, you know. Buy amazing kind of jade. Exactly, yeah. Do you know, that is so gumps, you know that? Yeah. Very gumps jewelers. Oh my goodness, Michael. <laughs> yeah, Alison Mason. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Alison. Um, that's, that was what the casual cough was. He's like, uh, excuse me, he got it from me. That's amazing, <laughs> Michael. So you can see the black, which worked perfectly in this bracelet. I want to just grab... Wrong side. The torch might be too big here, but yeah. I don't know if you can see this, but it is on for sight. Sorry, yeah, the torch oh, is geez. really, really bright. So let me put it... <laughs> Sorry, Ellie. <laughs> Um, come to work, get blinded, it's yeah, fine. <laughs> it's so bright, this torch. But can you see how it's actually a very dark, inky green? Can you see that? Or is it too bright? Absolutely incredible. This is called omphacite. And it basically really dem demonstrates how your black jadeite actually was, once upon a time, in imperial jadeite. We're going to do this in one price crash. I'm going to turn this torch off because it is incredibly bright. Yeah, I know. I'll turn it away from everybody. Is that off? Yeah. One price crash, jewellery makers. Are you ready? 50 carats of your type A black jadeite. Technically, I shouldn't say jet black because it's not jet black. It's actually a, a very dark forest green. Millions of years older than any other colour of your jadeite. So um, we'll do it in one price. What? I've just looked up Ross. <laughs> Ross, what are you doing? There's seven left. He said it's essentially a clearance deal for four mil. <laughs> right, I love it. If you got the yellow earlier on. That. Oh, yeah absolute perfection if this doesn't sell out i'm all over it what about do you remember when we were looking back at the jewelry editor and you saw those black spinel comet earrings for 20 grand i mean this is rarer than black spinel and you're getting it for 49 pounds and 99 pence there's not nearly enough of you on the phone lines getting involved with this mad deal and it is a completely mad deal so i'm happy to get the remaining quantity roscoe because you know you're going to use it there's very few mm. black gemstones with the level of rarity that is on your screens right now Okay, um, Ellie, you mentioned earlier on. <laughs> <laughs> what, look joking? what just accidentally just happened. Just joking, it's too big for my wrist, Michael. There you go. There you go. Um, we mentioned earlier on some new findings, different findings. Yes. 
Now, we haven't got clip-on earrings yet, but I think that's something we should definitely work on. I've already been unspoken. Have you? Yeah, I went up and spoke to people earlier. <laughs> How about some clip-on bales? Yes, oh, To nice. make your pendants on an offable. Yeah, as on the an tortoise offable. said. It's easily on an offable. Um, here we go, let me show you. Right now, let me turn it that way and you can see. Oh, nice. They literally, it opens like a door, obviously, and then you loop it over, say, a knotted pearl necklace mm. or a knotted jade necklace. Um, makes your jewellery interchangeable. You don't just get the one. You actually get two of them. I'm going to start with the gold. Same design. The graphics are live. So let me just scooch that over. And I'll try, if I can, just a second, to open this up. So you can actually see just how easily on and offable they are. Here we go. I love that, sorry. <laughs> on, on, and, and on and offable. <laughs> on and offable. There you go. You just loop it over, click it down into place, and away you go. You get the two. You get the two of them, lovely jewellery makers. So, buttery yellow gold plated 925 sterling silver. Um, I love this. It's a, in a sense, it's a little bit like the carabiner, only reverse it clips out rather than in um equally you know if i was to oh yeah i can show you a strand like this if i wanted to have um a pendant that i attached on and off use one of these and it's very 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 easy to do that how about for the investment of sterling silver how about 10 pounds per sterling silver clip bail 19 pounds and 99 pence how about for the pair under ten pounds. Oh goodness, that's, that's mad, good. isn't it? And it's nice and easy. There's nothing stopping you using these um, as a sort of a traditional clasp as well. Yeah, you could because they're less fiddly. Yeah, but also I just think it's great. Like if you're if you're if you are selling your pieces to have interchangeable things. Yeah. So they could come and buy. If they can't decide which pendants they like, you could have them as an add-on. Mm. So and then people can just simply switch it out at home because it's nice and easy for someone to do that themselves at home. And and not own, not always, um, Ellie. You can actually take a pendant off a chain, can you? No, not always. So this often is going to be the hoop the at the ring. other end, the jump ring at the other hoop. <laughs> I promise, I do know words. She, know, for she does make jewelry. <laughs> yeah, she does make. She knows that. She knows the language. <laughs> Apparently so, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so um, <laughs> it's too big. Yeah, it's too big, so you can't take the chain off. Mm. I mean, as a jewellery maker, you can, but as someone who's not a jewellery maker, you can't just easily no, do exactly. that. It's not something you can do. Exactly. Five pounds each, jewellery makers. There is a bit of a queue that's forming on the phone lines, jewellery makers, so um, do bear with our amazing contact centre. We've uh, they've, they've earned their crust today, haven't they? They've earned their crust today, the call centre. <laughs> They're busy little bees, aren't they? Here we go. There we go. And you get both of them. Shop, can we shop out on the silver? No. No. You have to wait for those. <laughs> bit of patience. We'll have to be patient. Uh, Cynthia's got two. Well done, Cynthia. Hazel and June in Oxfordshire and Camilla. Hello to you. Uh, Lynn and Sheila. Hello to you. Nicolette, Maker, Margaret, Pamela, Sandra, Dawn, Amelia. Uh, Cynthia, Sandy. Mm. Hello to you all. Ah, oh, five pounds. That's an unbelievable deal. All that silver that's invested into those, and you get the ish additional jump ring. So you could, if you wanted an on and offable, on and offable pendant. There you go. Less than ten of those remain. Sit perfectly mm. with the yellow. If you were like, oh, I want an on and offable pendant, maybe that I can wear sometimes with the black, sometimes oh, yeah, with the yellow. Look. On and offable. Creature comforts, that's one of the best adverts. Um, amazing, well done everybody. Make sure you're checking out your baskets and do bear with our call centre team. I'm gonna move on because we've got the silver colour to bring you as well. Now, there's a hundred of these. We're gonna do it in the next break, did you say? Oh, no, do it now. I don't know where I heard that, Ross. <laughs> don't know, in my head. Here we go, let's bring you the silver. Nice wide bail as well. Great, if you do suffer with sort of dexterity issues or you, you just really struggle with class because I find some class really tricky to do, particularly your bolt ring class, mm. and you want to make your life simpler, um, then these would be a great alternative. Just use like a large jump ring. You can get sort of 10 mil jump rings, can't you? And this would work for that. Yeah. 
So you can use it in a, as a as a clasp, not just as a veil. Oh, in the sapphire kit earlier, you had the heart charm, nice. like the large one, and I actually used that as the as the jump ring, as the clasp at the back of the necklace with the bolt ring. Nice. So that would work perfectly with those. Yeah, it's just the right size and adds that nice little loving finishing touch. Yeah, I mean, I remember showing a piece of jewellery that was from, I think it was Mulberry, actually, who created it. And it's basically an, um, an exaggerated toggle mm -hmm. um, and a, quite a chunky chain that you wear on the front. But that's the whole thing. The exaggerated yeah. design, uh, um, clasp itself is the look of it. You could do exactly the same with these. So they're, I know they are bales, but you could easily use them as something alternative, couldn't you? You could use them as like a, a charm carrier. Yeah. Um, there's lots and lots of different uses. Do we have quantity of these? Over 100, but loads of you shopping ahead on them as well. Cynthia snapped up two. Good has got two. Dorothy's got two. Margaret and Megan and Hazel and Sandra and Pamela and Margot and West Sussex and Patricia and Anne and Mandy, Sheila and Dorset. Make sure you check it out. Five pounds each. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. I'm just going to pop those down for one second. We've got quantity over 100. Sorry, Michael. Hi, Margot. These bales are so invaluable. Um, you had them years ago and I've loved them since. Oh, they're back in stock, Margot. Back in stock. Clearly by very popular demand. I can't believe it's taken us that long. I've just borrowed Michael's uh, bracelet. So, for example, there you go, Michael. If you wanted to put a charm or a pendant on there, it clips on. There you go, just to show you. And I literally did that whilst in the studios. And obviously it's gonna suspend beautifully as well. Uh, 8.99. There you go, Margot, they're back in stock from years ago. I can't remember the last time I've actually seen these, but they are super simple to do. Just literally get your fingernail underneath the um, catch. It opens like a door and clips over your gemstones. Obviously, I guess there is certain restrictions. If you've got a gem that's maybe, I was gonna say 12 mil, but even then you can slot it in between, can't you? Yeah doesn't have to go over the actual gem go over itself. the actual gem itself you could go by the actual knot or the or the elastic in this case again make sure you're checking out everybody we had over a hundred available opportunities absolutely beautiful inspired pieces um now coming up after the break keep on dialing through with these because there are tons of you there um coming up after the break we're going to be talking about the wonderful product invention that is gallery wire i remember this as first launching gallery wire and i was like this is genius this is revolutionary because you don't have to be a wire worker to work with gallery wire is what i think you don't have to be a silversmith to work with gallery wire as well um and you've got wonderful ellie to teach us how to use it plus you get your instructions as well keep dialing through on your clip uh your bail clips and all your amazing jades and don't go anywhere join ellie and i after this Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your jewelry room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewelry Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewelry Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. 
Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Jewellery Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewellery Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Here at Jewellery Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got Split Pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with Split Pay. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Jewellery makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewellery Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewelry Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says gift cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion, or just a way to say thank you, the Jewelry Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Now we have, or rather Ellie, you have a very special mention today, haven't you? I do, yes. Okay. I want to say happy 90th birthday to my Nanny Beryl. Nanny Beryl? Yeah. Oh, happy birthday. <laughs> Bless yeah. her. She's lovely. A wonderful nanny. A wonderful lady. Yeah. Well, I'm not surprised. She no. dyed her hair pink for her birthday. It looked amazing. You rock, Nanny Beryl. Yeah. You rock. <laughs> and did I hear you're making bunting? Oh no, that's my mum is making bunting. Your I'm mom watching is making it. Yeah. bunting, right? I say, I love it. You all rock. Happy birthday, <laughs> Nanny Beryl. I love that. Yeah. Love that, love that. Now, incredible. We've got a big quantity of this opportunity and um, 100 on the nose. We have not seen, and it is silver, 925 sterling silver. We have not seen the gallery wire since. 2022 but can I just add another we've not seen for a very long time and mm. I can't put a date on this but weirdly I was talking about it the other day when was the last time that you saw silver wire on our screens this this not the gallery wire this I was gonna say Ross I can't remember the last time we actually had silver wire we used to have it loads didn't we yeah all the time but yeah, Eagle, e uh, sort of um, Ivy House, we used to get this all the time, didn't we? Yeah. We've just looked into it, 2022. And Ellie, right at the start of 2022. Hmm. That's unbelievable. So it really has been a long time. I, can't, I genuinely don't know why. Maybe it's harder to get hold of silver wire of late. I'm not sure. Prices of silver, because that it has skyrocketed. 
Is it me or you get masses there? How much is that? I think you get five meters. Five meters? I think. Yep. In your 0 0.4, which Ellie, I I always remember it being the most popular because you can do yes. so much with it. Yeah. I use it, 0 0.4 is my go-to wire. That's what I use most of really on a daily. Yeah, because you can make head pins from this. You, you can obviously cut it down. It's fairly, when I look at wire like this, you think, oh, okay, um, it's some wire. It's 925 though. Let's not lose yeah. sight of the fact that that is a lot of precious metal um, that you're actually getting here and what they can actually achieve. I'm also thinking about sort of the price that this project is and how much 0.4 wire used to be by five meters. Yeah. It's a great prize, just if we were talking about the wire on its own. You don't just get that though, jewelry makers. You're also getting about 10 centimeters, is that right? Is that 10, 10 maybe more? Might even be a bit more. I'll measure it if you like. Yeah, 10 centimeters. Yeah, 10 centimeters um, of, again, solid. It's really sturdy. Really sturdy. Yeah. Gallery wire. Again, you think about the weight that's actually in this yeah. alone. That is solid 925 sterling silver. So there's a lot of precious metal in those two components straight away. We're still not done. No. Always has been one of our most popular gemstones. The beauty that is labradorite. And when you look at labradorite, initially, if I hold it like this, you think, okay, it's a dark, dark stone. But actually... When I turn it towards a light source, you say these amazing phenomena effects that are totally natural. It's not coated, it's not treated. It's the platelets within the gemstone that react, reflect the light effectively. Um, you get a parcel, look at this one, it's all cobalt blue. What we'd refer to as blue sheen. Let me put that down. Faceted blue sheen. We rarely do see faceted because it's really similar conversation to what we were discussing with the red jade eye. Thing is, this is you imagine that opal is whilst opal is usually carved into a cabochon, it's hard to cut, and that's because if you cut too little, you don't see the opalescence. If you cut too too much, you cut it away. Yeah. So the same applies with your labradorite. If you cut too little, you don't see that labradorescence. If you cut too much, you're cutting it away. Um. So there's no room for error whatsoever. Um, so that's why it's really actually ever faceted. It adds to the risk. Go to a cabochon. You know, there's, you know, you're risking it once, not multiple times. Look at that entire blue sheen labradorite. And these are three cabochons. You might get more. We guarantee the carrot weight. So three luxury components, three of which we haven't seen in a very long time. Five meters of point four wire. When was it? I can't remember. 2022. There we go. We can tell you. When was the last time you saw this amount of sterling silver gallery wire? And it is really thick. It's different yeah. to the gallery wire that we've seen previously. It is, yeah. This it is much thicker than the gallery wire that we've seen before. It's super sturdy. <laughs> it is super sturdy. You could yeah. almost turn that into a talk, couldn't you? Yes. Yeah. Turn it into Very a easily, sort of I think bracelet. so. And then don't forget, you've got all of this amazing uh, labradorite as well. Now, what we're going to do, because it's been such a long time since we've seen the point full wire, that's that gallery wire, since we've seen faceted labradorite, what we're going to do is put a 60 second clock onto your screen to make it fair for everybody. You also get Ellie's downloadable instructions as well. This becomes available upon dispatch of your order. Um, so you can, and, and you should, I'm sure you're forming a nice bank of these now. Yes. Print there them must off, be quite put them a into few. a ring binder. <laughs> And it's techniques that you can uh, constantly look back on um, and reference. So this is all about the gallery wire pendant. So you get this for free, jewellery makers. Um, I can't remember the last time I saw point four. Well, we can tell you. Our history tells you, 2022. And the last time it was seen before then was a year ago. So actually, it's only actually been seen once since 2021. That's mad, isn't it? Absolutely mad. And point four was always the most popular gauge mm. because you can weave with it, is that right? Yep. Wrap, weave, like you say, make little head, like featherweight head pins yeah. with it. Yeah. Findings, I could make things like uh, um, certain findings with it, shepherd hooks, do you reckon? Possibly a bit thin for bit shepherd possibly hooks. Possibly a bit yeah, thin. Yeah, I'd probably go. 100 available. 
graphics are live. And remember how expensive Gallery Wire was when we first launched it? Yeah, wasn't it like... Yeah, £129. It was... <laughs> oh, I yeah, got it. You bought it, didn't you? I still haven't used it. It's Have somewhere not... in a drawer. <laughs> oh, Ellie, you need to dust that off I now. because you've had. You've now I know this... how to use it, you exactly. see. Exactly, <laughs> you've had the experience of it now. You know what you're doing. Yeah. And you can solder this if you want, can't you? You can do, yeah. yeah. Or you can uh, cold... How do you call it? Cold... Is it just cold, cold joints? Curing? I guess so. Cold I'm joints sure. where you literally wrap it with your wire. Yeah, so that's and that's what I've done here because I think it is because it came with the wire as well. You can easily just make a whole piece of jewelry with just this kit. You don't yeah. have to add stuff in. No. Um, but yeah, it's it's very easy to use with the wire. A lot easier than I thought it would be, which is why I didn't use my own for so long because I got it thinking, oh, this is exciting. I think it came with Larimar. Like, but really tiny, like 10 mils or yeah, something yeah, yeah, like yeah. that. Very not small massive, no. Not massive cabochons like these. No, no. Um, incredible jewellery makers. And again, literally, it's, I'm not a wire worker. I'd love to be able to weave wire like a, the likes of Ellie. Um, but, you know, effectively, it's the weave done for you, isn't it? The yes. gallery wire. Yeah. And then you basically secure it around and the you just secure it, yeah. itself. Um, unbelievable. We had a hundred of these available jewellery makers. Now, first price crash, five metres of your point four wire, um, your cabochons of your beautiful natural labradorite, plus you get 10 centimetres of one of the most solid gallery wires that we actually, um, well, I've lifted because it's very heavy. Where we first launched gallery wire, and, and I, I don't know, you didn't get the gemstones, did you, when we first launched it? Gallery wire. Or did you? I can't remember. Yeah, but they were they were very small. Like it was say, a they were three gallery wires, wasn't it? Yeah. I don't know if you got your gems. I might be wrong. I got Larimar with mine. Did but you? I don't, yeah, so, but... They were small. They were small, yeah. Okay. Very, very small. Okay, well, right now, you're looking at all that sterling silver, five metres of your point four wire and your labradorites, which aren't small. We're at one hundred and twenty-nine pounds, and that is not where we close. Not where we close. Let's start chipping away at that price point. Let's get this under one hundred pounds. <gasps> By a big bit, Ross. I was thinking you were going to take that to ninety-nine. How much is that? Fifty pounds off. Fifty pounds back into your pocket. Is gallery wire something, Ellie, that people who maybe have never worked with sort of the metal smithing side of jewellery making, um, something, is it ideal? It is, I think so. Yeah, I think so. So like I say, I, had, I, I bought this gallery wire. I hadn't used it for ages. And then as one of, as my first kit from when I started working here, I was sent gallery wire and I had never used it before. Was it like one Man, of Man, I panicked. I was like, <gasps> how am I meant to do this? I don't know if I can do soldering. And then I was like, no, I'm sure you can do it without you without adding that in. I do yeah. have a solder, I don't know where it is. But I was like, I'm sure I can try and do it in a way that makes it more accessible than having to solder the solder the joints. Yeah. So, and because it has these, it has the little gaps at the top, the little loops in the crown, it means that you can wrap in between those yeah, to secure it. Yeah, literally anchor it on together. Yeah. And I think that's something that Claire did when she originally launched it. She yes, did, yeah. She was like, yeah, look, you can solder it this way, but you can also literally just wrap it. Yes. In fact, I'm, I'm sure the first one that Be Beadsmith supplied for us, actually, um, actually came with a supply of your 0.4 wire, but it was only a metre or so, um, certainly not five metres. We're at £79.99. It's a great way of actually uh, sort of starting your um your metal smithing journey i don't want to say specifically you know just your gallery wire because i think you can do so much with it yeah. how about like a torque bangle nothing yeah, saying you can't nice. put that on like a um a slider bracelet or something like that look at that there's the amount of sterling silver um enough mm. sterling silver to actually create that with or just like this but with that instead yes so you've got uh, that's what because that's what, all yeah, i've I'll put got. your hand down next to mine See, I couldn't make the bracelet that you're wearing because I can't weave. Yeah. I'm useless at weaving. Whereas I could do this. I could put this onto um, uh, basically what is a slider bracelet. Yes, yeah. 
We're at 79.99. There's lots of you already getting involved. Good luck to each and every single one of you. We have five meters of your point four. Invaluable as jewelry makers, whether you're a wire worker or not. You get 10 centimeters of your solid gallery wire. I need to emphasize that it's not thin. This is really, yeah, there's a it big is. amount of sterling silver invested it, in this there one. There really is, yeah. It's very chunky. Yeah, which I, which I guess you want, you know, if you're gonna be able to, if you're manipulating it around a gemstone, you want it to have that precious metal for the actual, um, for it to stay solid, don't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. We're going even lower, jewelry makers, not even stopping here. When we first launched Gallery Wire, um, and I know you've got different components, and I know there was a couple of different designs, etc. but um, it was 129. And that was because we didn't butter source it ourselves, we didn't make it ourselves. We are making it ourselves now. You get the five meters of your point four, and you get the gemstones. Instead of being 129, you're getting it for 49.99, and you get Ellie's instructions. It's a great introduction to um, into your gallery wire. That is our absolute final price. What? Uh -oh. Wait, 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 Ross, I was saying earlier on, and I can't remember exactly, but point four wire, I'm sh fairly sure, by the five meters, wasn't far off that. Well, I remember. I might be wrong. I can't remember. 30, maybe? Oh, okay. It's all right then. Let's say Just that. 30 pounds yeah. for the 0.4 wire, 5 meters, and then for 20 pounds, you're getting this solid piece of sterling silver gallery wire and three beautiful cabochons. Yeah. Today, you are not paying 49 pounds and 99 pence. <laughs> I'm going to show you another price that you're not paying today When we as well. came in, I asked this morning how much it was going to, and this is what I was told. Yeah. <laughs> another price you're not paying. If you have ever showed any interest in your precious metal, now is the time. If you've always wanted to, and like I said, I'm useless at wire work useless but i know i need wire you can do rosary linking with it mm. you know if you want to make your own featherweight head pins if you want to do bubble styles you're going to be needing an investment of your sterling silver that we are going even lower if ever you've had interest in gallery wire and you're thinking okay i don't quite want to spend 129 pounds but i definitely do want to give it a go uh, my suggestion would be as well this one would be great because it's thicker Mm. The actual gallery wire is a little bit thicker. Plus, you've got quite large cabochons. In 60 seconds, we're going to take this to your final price tag, jewelry makers. You get, as well, Ellie's instructions. Um, so she's there to hold your hand, if you like, uh, through each and every single... Uh, um, well, I don't know, stumbling block that you might mm -hmm. have. We should have been at 39.99. I uh, Sorry, we should have been at 49.99, Ellie. That's when we're meant to close it. Yeah, that's where that's what I was told this morning. That's what when I came my in. sheet says. Yeah. But you know, Ross, he's uh... a law unto himself. Oh, he is. Yeah. <laughs> and he's like, you know, we've got a hundred of these. If you want to do it, show us you're there, and we'll take it even lower. Like Donna, like Kevin, like Alison, like Pamela, like Elizabeth, like Hilda, like Angus and Sally and Georgia, and new customers getting involved. Um, we are going to take it even lower. I think this is the most affordable precious metal gallery wire project that we've done. In fact, yes, Ross, it's got to be the most affordable gallery wire project we've done for everything that you're getting. Essentially, three luxury components. Mm. No way. Wow. That's mad. That is one of the craziest deals. You've just bought, in my head, you've bought your point four at a discount, in my head. You've got your 10 centimetres of your solid sterling silver gallery wire, which is weighty, and you'll see, you'll agree with us when you get that home. Yeah. Plus, you've got all your labradorite faceted cabochons, which when, when do we used to do faceted cabochons for tenor? We didn't. Maybe one. No. In one of those little white boxes. Yeah, maybe. And also, so you can't see on the pieces because of the camera angle sometimes, but both of the pieces that I've got, that I made there, and the other one that I've got here, they have so much shiller on, like every yeah, single one. It wasn't just one with a little piece. It was um, like all the way across, across the front of the whole of well, the cap. Well, the one I'm holding here, I mean, that's a bl what I would describe as a blue sheen. Blue sheen is the best grade where you've got that full, complete blue coverage. Can you see? 
literally complete blue coverage. There's one. You see that? Every millimetre across the surface of your labradorite has that beautiful mm. shiller. Then, let's show you another one. Again, complete blue sheen labradorite. And it's all totally and utterly natural. I used to dread, I'm being really honest now, I used to dread bringing labradorite to wear. Because sometimes you couldn't find the flash. Sometimes you needed the right, exactly the right angle mm. to hit the light. Um, here in the studio, I used to dread it. I used to, up, used to film me, oh no, not labradorite. Because then if I didn't see the actual labradorescence, um, but I don't look. I can see it from here. Yeah. I could look at the big one on the. Yeah, unbelievable. Yeah. If you look at the big one here that you've got near to you on the yeah. stand, if you move that, you might need to move it up and down so that the camera can see it. But the blue flash that I got on that was. Yeah, I can see it there. Right. Look there. at that. Look at that. Even from meters away. Like it was ridiculous. Yeah. I used to dread it. Absolutely like <laughs> dread it because you'd see it on the recording and then you'd see it in the studio where you've got floodlights. They'd be like, no, 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 there's no labyrinths. You can see it all. Make sure you check it out. Those baskets, everybody. There are tons of you there. That's the maddest price I've ever seen on a gallery wire project. For me, you've bought your point four, five meters of your point four. You've got ten centimeters of your sterling silver gallery wire, and you've got your labyrinth, and you've got your instructions all for free. That's unbelievable. Or £10 per component in your instructions for free, whichever way you want to look at it. Any questions that you might have as well for Ellie, do text into the studio jewellery makers. So, um, Ellie, I mean, stunning makes. What, what, what are you going to show us? Um, I'll show you how to do the gallery wire. You do have the instructions for it, but sometimes it's nice to see it being in made. Action. Yeah. I also just made the little pumpkin. Oh, you need... Oh, you just want a pumpkin? Yeah, I was... Because I did a... You're thinking all Halloween. I did a little... Uh, <laughs> I did a bit of filming um, for the social media stuff and I did a pumpkin and I was like, oh look, I'll just quickly Aww. make a little tiny Cinderella pumpkin. Oh, it's very Cinderella. That's yeah. absolutely beautiful. There's that labyrinth. Look. look at that. Just literally turn it towards the light. Amazing. Take it away. Right, I'm going to need this, sorry. Okay. Because <laughs> I ran out. So, with your gallery wire, what you need to do is make sure you've got your cab the way you want it, although actually the backs are really nice as well. So mm. it's actually quite nice that you can leave the back open. So if you want, you can flip the pendant over if you wanted to have a different look. Yeah. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to ease this round and this it is really sturdy. So, and I'm gonna do this at the pointy end just because I quite just like- Just because you can. I, I quite like having it a bit bit different so we're going to pull this round and what we'll need to do is bend these little bits up slightly to sit it in because you also find i don't know if you can see actually there's like a little lip almost on this gallery wire just a really small one it's about a millimeter oh, yeah. round and actually that actually helps to keep the back of the cabin as well Does firmer it almost in place. Act as like a bezel for the almost yeah it's almost that um that type so we need to bring that in further as you see it is it's super sturdy so i'm it's it was really nice to have the wire so sturdy in fact because it's mm. like sometimes you don't want to worry about breaking something just gonna bring this round bend that up and do the same on this side. So, once you've got it roughly in, you can see here that that's, that, that actually sets in, like because it has got that little lip, I haven't actually got to do anything to the back because it keeps it in place without mm. dropping through, which is really helpful. And then what we're going to do is take off some of our 0.4 wire. And you'll find the uh, sterling silver wire is a lot more malleable than your plated wires. Yeah. So you have almost a lot more give. Yeah, a lot of people say it's yeah. easier to work yeah, with. Yeah, it's a lot silver. easier on your hands, yeah. yeah.
Yeah, I've heard that before. Actually. Yeah. Silver's easier to work with. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to hold hold this cap here. I'm just going to give these these two ends that we've got at the top, I'm going to give those a squeeze together with my pliers. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to take this 0.4 wire and you can see we've got these little little gaps here in the top of the crown. I'm just going to pass the wire through and all we're doing is feeding this through and you can pull it nice and tight that's and it does it really holds it nice and securely. It's definitely the right, right, the <laughs> the right wire for wrapping for mm. wrapping with this. So it's ideal that it comes with this kit. Because before, when I've had the gallery wire kits, I've I've added in the wire, which is absolutely fine. But it is nice to have it within the kit, so you don't even have to think, oh, I need to go and buy that separately. Yeah, it's not a, it's another not another purchase you need. To make. Yeah. So we've wrapped that round just a few times in here. Just going to trim this wire off here. Again, just bend that in so that we don't get any catchy bits. And just wrap that round one more time. And what I'm going to do here is just pull it tight with the flat nose pliers. It round, trim it with the cutters, and then give it a squeeze to make sure that this sits in. Tuck it in here. So now, so as you can see, there's a few little gaps down the edges. I don't know if you can see. And what I'm going to do is, using the side of the pliers, I'm just going to push that in a little bit more. And my fingers. There you go. And now what we're going to do is gently bend in these prongs. So what this is almost like, these are going to sit proud over the top. So you're going to have that gap in between. Oh, okay. But it almost makes like a little, almost like a little cave. I guess. It made me think of like, you know, Aladdin's cave and a cave of wonders. Like you look well, through. One of those amazing pools. You know, sometimes you see these beautiful pools. Yes. Which like uh, have an electric blue. Yes. Like in a cenote or yeah. is it a cenote? What they're called. So yeah, bend each of these down. Do you know, I watched a film the other, um, was it not last night, night before, called uh, The Shallows? Has anyone seen that? No. Is it a horror film? No, it's not a horror. Okay, good. <laughs> it I sounded... Wouldn't, I, I wouldn't watch a horror. Um, oh, what's her name? Blake Lively. Oh, yeah, I like her. She's a surfer. She gets stuck on a rock. Okay. She gets stuck on a rock and there's like a, a nasty shark in the waters, basically. She gets oh. bitten by a shark stuck in a rock. But that's got the most beautiful blues. That's the reason why I'm thinking about it. Those beautiful blue seas. Yeah. So yeah, look, then it's got, you've got this little, it's almost, yeah, it's like having almost like a little cave. You can see that there's a gap yes. here. But I thought that was really lovely. I liked having that detail. The, it's nice to have it touching the cab as well, but actually it's very nice to have it above. It gives it that extra, it's almost like, like you say, looking into a pool and being able to like, you Almost, feel like you feel like you can be drawn in. in. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, beautiful. And I'm just gonna get my cutters, my other cutters. Or not. They might be in my suitcase. Here we go. Just hold this here. There we go. So then we've got this here. This is the top. And if you want, you might want to file, this bit can be quite sharp, so you would probably want to file that. But you could use just a nail file. Mm. You don't necessarily have to, because sterling silver is softer, you don't have to use um, 
like a proper metal file, you can use a nail file to bring down the sharper edge here. Amazing! Yeah. Look at that! And then all I did for the one that we've got here on the instructions is I created a, a rosary link at the top to hang it off so that I could hang it Sorry. onto the we hang that. it onto the chain. Put that down a bit. There you go, and you can see. Yeah. And oh, I can, sh I can show you how to do the rosary link. I just accidentally put the beads away. But I do have some in here. Um, I'll give you a little bit of an update on stock quantities, jewelry makers. Half the stock has gone. There's still loads of you with it in your baskets. We absolutely cannot go any lower than what's on your screens. It was meant to be £49.99. Yeah. You've got £20 <laughs> back into your pocket. Um, and I can tell you, literally, on my star buy sheet, it says exactly that, £49.99, which I thought was a great price. Um, so you get five metres, just to recap, you get five metres of your point four wire. So there's masses here, and it's been years since we've actually had 0.4 wire on air, um, over two years. Um, you also get um, the 10 centimetres of your gallery wire, which you actually saw Ellie demonstrating with, I don't physically have yeah. it here. And then you get your cabochons, your, your faceted cabochons of beautiful quality, top quality, labradorite, and Ellie's instructions. So essentially four components. Um, four components for twenty nine ninety nine. I had uh, did you say a hundred? Started with a hundred, but over half the stock is gone. So well done, Tina, Alice, Lynn, Sally, Helen, Jan, Marion, Faye, Sue, Megan, and Jenny, Regine, Kathy, Linda, Elizabeth. If you are Debbie, uh, and those are the names I can see by the way. There's more on the other side, uh, lower down <laughs> the screen as well. Um, I should encourage Beverly in North Hampshire. If you want five, I would definitely check out. Ayrshire, Joanne, Ma uh, Marcia, Carolyn, Debbie, Deborah, Lauren, Buckinghamshire, Helen, Merseyside, Nora. Like I said, there's so many names there. Lots of you with it in your baskets. You've still got a chance. Go on then, take it away. Yeah, I'll just show you how to do the rosary link for the top. Mm -hmm. So in the instructions, I actually used one of the sapphires from my other kits because I was like, Why not? they were so nice and chunky. And the blue. With yeah, the would be yeah nice, that's yeah. what I thought. So, um, but apparently I've put them away and now I can't find those ones. So I've got a different bead. Okay, I was going to say, do you need a bead? I've got, no, no, I've got a different bead. So I'm just going to take some of this 0.4 wire, make a right angle with my flat nose pliers and create a loop. I'm going to do this at the bottom of the pliers. I want this to be a large loop because it needs to fit through the top hole of the gallery wire here and we because this is a bit larger we need that we need that space in that loop so i'm just going to bring that up as you can see that fit that large loop at the bot using the bottom of the pliers gives you enough space you've got enough clearance there it's going it's got a space to move it's not going to hang funny mm. so once we've got this on take our Flatten those pliers and wrap around a few times here. I usually do three or four wraps when I'm doing the rosary link. Then we'll pop our bead on. Here. Take our flat nose pliers again. Make that right angle bend, and then again, right at the bottom, we're going to bring that wire all the way around so that we've got a large loop because I didn't know what size chain I was putting it on when I was making it. So mm -hmm. I wanted to make the loop as large as possible so that I had options on chains. I'm going to wrap down to the bead. And then what I've done on the piece I've got here, sorry, the piece that's on the display, I've wrapped, I've done like a fancy rosary link. So instead of just having a plain bead, it's what I call a fancy rosary link anyway. It's like yeah. got twists of the wire around it. So we take the wire, and we take the tail of the wire that's at the bottom and then bring that up and around at the top and wrap around once, bring the top one down wrap it over that bead and wrap it round once again. And then we're gonna bring those back up again, then wrap that all the way to the loop. And trim that one off here. Just 
give that a little squeeze with your flat nose pliers and then bring this one back down to the bottom and wrap all the way to that loop here. Ooh. And then I'll trim that off with the cutters just here. And then give that a squeeze just there to make sure there's no catchy bits. So, and then, yeah, there we've got our, um, our nice gallery wrapped cab. Beautiful. With our rosary link. And, you know, this, this one isn't perfect, the one that I've done just here, but you, at home you'll have a bit more time to sit yeah, yeah, yeah. and like push everything in to make sure it's Tweak as neat it. as possible. Um, but I'm actually very happy with that. It's I gorgeous. think that's really nice. And I love that blue. Love it. Getting that blue would, is love amazing. gallery wire. I think it's a revolutionary product, to yeah. be honest. Great ideas for, for those of us that can't actually weave. Thank you, Ellie. There's still loads of you with it in your basket, so I'll leave those with you, jewelry makers. Make sure you do check out your um, check out. We uh, that's twenty pounds back into your pocket today. It was meant to be at forty nine ninety nine, so that's absolutely incredible. Now, whilst Ellie was just demonstrating, I, I literally clocked something in my peripheral, and I was like, Oh my goodness, it's the original. This is the original magnetic clasp. And what I mean by that is, listen, I know that those of you that are watching are jewelry makers or at least aspiring jewelry makers. But when I first started, I was on our sister channel mm. and I launched the first ever magnetic clasp across the whole partnership that was. And I remember, the, and, and, and literally, I'm not joking, thousands sold. Wow. Thousands. And the reason for that is because it was like, oh, wait a minute. Have you ever wondered how they change their necklaces and jewellery? They haven't got someone sat behind the desk. It's because they're on magnetic clasp. And you might be thinking, yeah, but you've got to be a sil you've got to be a jewellery maker to a certain degree to be able to take the, the clasp off. Not with this one, you don't. So, look, this if you, is the perfect gift for anybody that maybe, maybe you know who struggles to put jewellery on. And I've just done this, Ellie. Mm. I've only got 40, so you're going to need to be really quick. I want to get some of these. So I can't be bothered, and I haven't got the time to oh, literally... Oh, that's fantastic. They Look literally that. clip on. Oh, I love that. So I've put that together to show you how it works. That's so easy. See what I mean? So you put your normal bra necklace. This is a necklace. You could use bracelets too. Clip the one lobster claw into the one end of the magnetic clasp, the claw of the magnetic clasp into the other side, and it's literally job done. Look at that. Genius. You don't just get the one of these, though. You get two. So clever. So, so, so clever. This was the original magnetic clasp across the partnership, and it actually started not here on Jewelry Maker, but it actually started on one of our sister channels. Really? The USA channel. Do you remember, Roscoe, like, like thousands of them sold? Because it, and people were getting like fives, because I was like, how many of us have got pieces of jewelry or bracelets that you don't wear because the clasp is fiddly? Yeah. Look, yeah, I'll show you. And I've got talk back on. There you go. How quickly have I just put that on? Wow. And you get two of them. Two and a half grams. How quickly can I take it off? That quickly. Two and a half grams of solid sterling silver. I wanted to show you how they actually work on your existing pieces of jewelry. Can I yeah, feel sure. how strong they are? Yeah, sure. Lovely and strong. Oh, wow. They are heavy. Yep. Two and a half Ooh, grams. That's a really good... Um... Whoop. Sorry, I liked it. Nice <laughs> magnetic clasp. Hours of fun with magnets. $49.99. <laughs> and they'll work on necklaces, also on your bracelets too. Um, so, it was years ago when we first introduced these. Um, was it more than 10 years ago? Yeah, it was right. It must have been about then, because I was definitely presenting. I think I was new present, newly presenting. Um, Ross is saying, yeah, about 10 years ago. You think, yeah, I think it is. I think you're right, Roscoe. Uh, amazing. And they went crazy, because it was like, oh, that necklace that I barely ever wear, or I can't be bothered wearing, because I know it's going to be a pain to yeah, put on. Yeah, because the clasps are so because tiny sometimes. Because the clasps are so tiny yeah. or fiddly. Literally. And these are interchangeable, you know. You don't have to have one um, um, one per piece of jewellery. There are only 40 opportunities, jewellery makers. I'll tell you what we're going to do. 30 second warning. I'm going to do a mega deal. How giftable are these? If you know somebody who wears jewellery but is str struggles to put their jewellery on... Look, if you, necklaces in particular, 
if, 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 for example, I try and put necklaces on, I can't always do it. If Tom's not there, I'm in trouble. I ain't wearing yeah. it, am I? Um, so almost what, half the stock has gone already. How perfect are these for gifts? Fiddly bracelets. Oh, that's a nightmare doing them on your own. I get sometimes a little bit hot under the collar here because I like put that necklace on now and I'm like, <laughs> and I haven't got a magnetic clasp. So, whereas this, done in seconds, under 20 pounds. That's unbelievable. With the price increase of sterling silver, I'm fairly sure they were about that price years ago, Ross, weren't they? Yeah, about 10 years ago, I'm fairly sure these were, 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 were around about 10 pounds each and they didn't have that fancy design. Well done, Sally, Tracy, Janice, hello to you. Alice, who's got two, Sally, Sue, Linda, West Sussex, Linda in Cambridgeshire. Um, so giftable. I'm definitely going to be getting some of these. Do you know what? You could also use them as charms, like clip-on charms. Yeah. And you could have different charms on each one and then just interchange them as yeah. and when you wanted. They're also extending your necklace too, or bracelet. Yeah because you've got that almost inch, haven't yeah. you, there? So it's actually extended it ever so slightly. If you want to, as jewelry makers, to swap it out and use it as a magnetic glass, you can. But you have everything here for it just to be to an interchangeable one. I have 40 of these, though, jewelry makers, so you do need to be quick. Sally, Hilda, Tracy, Linda, Marcia, Sarah, Persis, uh, Norma, you're there as well on the phone lines. Again, it's as simple as literally just clip. I wanted to show it to you on a chain. Clip the one side of your magnetic clasp on here. You clip the other side of your uh, necklace or bracelet onto the magnetic clasp, job done. Again, if ever you see, I don't know, lovely Lindsay or Kate McCarthy putting uh, swapping their jewellery really quickly in the break, it's because, I am revealing all their secrets, <laughs> it's because they're on, um, they're on magnetic clasps. So they can do it. I've got 14 left, once they're gone, they're gone. Here you go. I've got my director in my ear now saying, Al, put your necklace on. Put your necklace on, please, Al, put your necklace on. There you go. <laughs> Elle, can you swap over your necklace and put something else on? Yeah, no problem. It's that, it's that simple. It is that simple. Um, okay, jewelry makers, as we come to the close of the show, we've got a few minutes left. I'm going to leave that with you. Um, I've got less than 10 of your magnetic class. So again, make sure you're checking those out. Shall we make the most of the fact that September... Is it September what? September 20. Take advantage of this opportunity, jewelry makers. These are your two millimeter. Hang on a minute. It's like twisting this one. Two millimeter faceted rounds. Natural, genuine blue sapphire. There's 50 available opportunities. Okay, look, I haven't got time to do that. Um, 50 available opportunities. It's a full 38 centimeter strand. Oh, look at those. Mm. September 20, that's what we need to remember, isn't it? Yeah. First price crash. 24.99 for genuine sapphire. We do become a little bit complacent, don't we? Yeah. You know, we, <clears throat> the fact that we are bringing the, genuinely this gemstone for under 25 quid, sapphire. Yeah. Not, not, not a simian, not a faux. I've brought costume jewellery for more money than what's on your screens right now. This is 15 carats of genuine sapphire, and we're actually taking 20% off that price tag as well. So wait, that's £5 off, so it's already £20. Yeah. Unbelievable. Let's make the most of this sapphire 20 in the same way that we do, like, you know, in June, we're like pearls or July, or oh, rubies, August, lovely spinel, or peridot. Natural, not diffused. Even without the 20% off, this is an amazing. Wow, that's great. <laughs> I, so, eight pounds? <laughs> no, I can't believe we're under 10. <laughs> under 10 pounds for genuine sapphire. Under 10 pounds shouldn't get me one of these micro faceted gemstones, let alone a full 38 centimetre strand. Are we kidding? Sorry, I've just looked up at the call screens. Seriously, eight pounds <laughs> for genuine natural sapphire? You'd be lucky to get a sandwich and a cake. 
No, you couldn't get a sandwich and a cake. True. <laughs> I went to Pret on the way here and my sandwich was six pounds on its own. Six pounds? <laughs> You're getting best part of a beautiful 15 carat natural blue sapphire strand. Imagine, imagine a, a sapphire tassel. Imagine a sapphire capriccio bracelet. Unbelievable, unbelievable. Also, jewelry makers, if you um, weren't able to tune in at 10 o'clock today, we have the most incredible showcase with um, Dave. These carvings are literally sublime. They're out of this world. Um, the level of detail in these, almost like three-dimensional. Um, the first carving where um, you have the, um, the phoenix, um, the male and female phoenix. I've got one left of these. We did not stop um, at 5,000 pounds. We could have done, let's be honest. We've so showed carvings, like, uh, um, I, w I don't even want to say of similarities, but um, of the jade quality for 27,000 pounds. We brought them to air today, look at that, for 299 pounds, which is absolutely incredible. Again, get your certificate of authenticity. You can take that very last one, that's the, the Phoenix, because once upon a time, there was a male and, uh, male and female um phoenix so this is something you're familiar with because it's obviously yeah. your son's name <laughs> um i think you should take the last one <laughs> maybe the, the phoenix if carving. i'm quick enough carolyn you can do it lovely if you check out your basket um uh, now recapping two left of the jade flowers ah uh, this is the finale one we played there's two left of that one that's gorgeous, isn't it? And it's almost like it's almost like a cage in the centre. Mm -hmm. You've got that sort of the negative space in the middle, which is what really gives it that wonderful illumination. Again, took this to two hundred and ninety nine pounds. You think about it, it's almost like lace, yeah. but carved out of one incredible rare gemstone. But again, the rarest colour of all your jade is uh, is the reds. Um, you can get the last. Did you say two, Roscoe? Yeah, there's two. Um, and then there's three of the uh, of the final. Sorry, two. Two as well. So we are talking literally one mm. or two. Oh yeah, it's almost like a big bouquet of flowers. We only had twenty of this one. It was the most limited, the most exclusive. Um, incredible. Well done, everybody. Now I'm back with you tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow morning, bright and early. And um, is it Monica's birthday? Oh, Aww. wonderful. There's lots of September babies. We've got Dave's birthday on Saturday as well. Um, I wonder why that is. Why is September? Um, so coming up on tomorrow show, we've got lovely Monica. Your eight o'clock early bird is about uh, the bangle and ring sizes, which is us. Oh, so important to get hold of those. Yeah. Nine o'clock, you've got your Baltic Amber um, projects with Monica. Ten o'clock, we've got the most amazing white nucleated Ed Edison pearl strand. Um, Eleven o'clock, we're going to do an under £10 showcase just because we can. And it's Monica's birthday. And then at 12 o'clock, we have a uh, further gallery wire with freshwater shell pearl cabochon. So, oh, yeah, I spied those amazing. out there. They look great oh, as well, you? yeah. <laughs> I like the fact that we can give you different designers. Yeah, no, it's great, well. and they're completely different as well. So oh, it's, yeah, they are different. Loving that. It's different. been ages since I've seen Monica, so I'm yeah. looking forward to that. And also in her birthday show. Um, who said that? Monica said it's been a while. Oh well, we're looking forward to seeing, it, especially for her birthday show. Ellie, you are a dream. When you back, my lovely. Probably in December now. I've got an operation coming up in the next oh, few weeks. So I'm going to have a bit of recovery time after that. So I'll be back hopefully in December. Oh, well, you rest yeah. up. Take it easy. Thank you. Enjoy the break. <laughs> yes, I'm actually going to make sure I rest this time because I'm not very good at resting, but I'm actually going to do it. Yeah. Doctor's orders. <laughs> Need some nice books or something like that. Oh, yeah, I've got a really good book at the moment, so yeah. I'll have to get the rest in that saga. There you go. There you go. Oh, well, we love you, Ellie, and we'll send you lots of healing best wishes. Thank my you. Darling. Stay in touch, though, won't you? Yes, I will, yeah. I'll Facebook. be messaging in. There I'll be saying go. hello from the bed. Yeah, be like, oh, Sally, yeah, please do. I need to treat myself. I'm feeling terrible. Definitely. <laughs> We're a good tonic there. We are a good tonic. Yeah, um, yeah I'm back with you bright and early in the morning. Sorry, Bruce, what was that? Okay, um, I'll be back in the morning. Take care. Have a lovely afternoon.